Baldi. This is a match between the BFP Lady Firefighters. And the Judiciary Justice Servers. We now have the official warm-up at the net.
ang mga binibili ang bibida dito sa ating Liga ng Public Servants as we bring you the UNTV Volleyball League Season 2. It, it, uh, it is our sixth play date at ang BFP kontra sa judiciary sa ating unang game, uh, AFP sa Sabah kontra sa SSS. Samantalang ang Senado taking on PNP sa ating final game ngayong Sunday triple header. Maraming salamat sa panonood. Thank you for being here with us and watching us on UNTV at sa UNTV News and Rescue Channels on Facebook and YouTube. Uh, Eric Tipan, kasama si uh, Chiki, of course, Chiki Pablo. Um, oh, it's gonna be a great game. Itong BFP, naghahanap ng kanilang unang panalo. And uh, they're going up against a team na medyo veterano na dito, Chiki. Right, you know, ang, ang judiciary, they're going for their third straight win. Right. And why not? Because mataas ang level ng kanilang confidence. At saka, yung connection nila sa isa't isa is mas mabilis. BFP, guy nang nasabi mo, wala pang panalo. But, you know, this is such a good team. And laki-laki ng potential. That's as right. evidenced by their stats in both block and aces. So, counting exposure pa, threat na sila dito sa ligang to. Alright, para ma-update yung ating mga viewers, let's uh, go back to our previous play date, April 11. We uh, were on the court once again at tingnan natin yung ating mga results uh, in during that match. Yeah, so you can see, no, um, um, sa first one, sa AFP, sila pa rin yung nanalo. They are the defending champions of, um, you know, the first season. Dito naman sa game two, um, PNP, uh, sila ang nanalo dyan, but uh, BFP, every time they play, exciting eh. Kita mo yung third set, extended set. Because they, sobrang, sobrang sipag sila eh, on the floor. And of course, in game three, it ended in three sets, but uh, maganda pa rin, no? uh, close yung first two, close enough. Uh, the, the third one, talagang tumakbo na ang uh, defenders. And uh, yung ating past few games, eh, pinapakita chiki sa ating mga viewers at uh, sa mga fans ng volleyball na uh, yung competition talaga nagpapantay-pantay na to because yes. we have a lot more, like yung sinabi mo, extended sets. We have a lot more uh, longer matches, mga five-setters we've yeah. seen here. At dito nyo makikita kung gaano sila kadikit-tikit. There's no undefeated team so far sa ating Season 2. Yeah, you know, AFP, Senate, and Comelet, tied sila no, in the win-loss category, 3-1. to one. PNP, dalawa ang kanilang wins. Uh, isa yung loss. Jujil Shari, ito na nga, yung they're trying to go for their third win. Ang SSS, isa pa lang ang panalo nila because they're one of the players that they really uh, depend on, Sang Muang, uh, wasn't able to play twice. So maybe that's a, a big uh, factor there. And BFA at saka ang BFP, wala pa silang panalo. That's right. Um, BFP, tututukan natin to. They are coming off their third straight loss. Yes. And they're practicing daily. Sabi nga ng kanilang coach kanina, nakausap ko, sabi niya, baka naman nasusobrahan lang tayo sa practice. <laughs> because uh, maybe that's burnout, maybe not. We'll find out if they uh, pick up a win here today. Pero tingnan natin yung result ng kanilang last match. Uh, they went up against PNP. Obviously, that's a tough opponent, Chiki. Oh yeah, PNP is a very tough opponent. Pero ang BFP, kita mo yung third set nag-extend. Yung uh, second set, 25 to 20. Yung sa first set, medyo naiwan sila doon, no? Nung momentum nakuha agad ng PNP. And the leading scores for BFP at that time was Bentik Adolfo Abeliana. Si Bentik, sila, siya yung talagang uh, nagkakaroon ng double digits every time they play. So, malaki ang sandal nila kay Bentik. But of course, this is a group, uh, this is a team sport, so everybody has to perform. Uh, you like yung uh, BFP na nalo ng second set. They extended the match to a set yeah. four. Kinulang na nga lang, hindi sila nakaabot ng set five. So today, you uh, are expecting to see them fight much better. Uh, extended rallies as well and longer match. We'll find out. Pero ang kalaban nila, hindi bido to. Uh, this team struggled in Season 1, but right now, you can tell they're veterans already of the UVL and they're playing a lot better and yung record nila speaks for itself. Yeah, and you know, it also helps na Season 1 magkakasama na yung judiciary. Exactly. Diba? So, ito here, no, yung, yung, well, let's go to the next one, judiciary. Speaking of the judiciary, Three sets lang sila uh, because nga yung kanilang communication inside the court, mas maganda, uh, mas fluid ang movements nila inside. And of course, si Pesebre still is the highest pointer with 24 points. Yan ang leading scorer. Uh, 21 attacks, 3 blocks, 1 ace. And we'll see here um, yung blocks nila against... Um, Itong ano, SSS, pareho lang sa two, parehong service aces, nagkatalo sila dun sa errors. So, very crucial talaga yung mga unforced errors. Kailangan iwasan yun. There's gonna be a slight change sa lineup ng uh, SS, er, ng uh, kanilang uh, judiciary because uh, si Jennifer Verhel, their starting setter, will not be in the starting lineup today. She got injured in an uh, off-the-court 
incident. So they're, they're going to have Mitch Alcansha as a starting setter para sa kanilang kopunan. That's uh, an update about them. Samantala, may update tayo about the BFP. Uh, game plans coming into today. Panoorin natin to. So, pagdating lang sa third set, third set to fourth set, parang biglang bumaba yung kumpiyansa ng team. Na yan lagi namin sinasabi sa kanila na pagdating dyan, sa moral nyo, hindi namin makokontrol. Kasi lahat na ito naman na, lahat na i-guide na. Pero kung kayo, yung moral nyo, hindi nyo talaga kaya ipaangatin, wala na kami magagawa. Yun ang sinasabi ko sa kanila ba? Na ngayong match na to, wala nang excuses dapat. Ilabas na nila lahat. Kasi kung anong makikita at papakita nila sa amin ngayon, yun na yun sila. No excuses na dapat. Diba? Parang kasi naka-adjust na dapat kami. Diba? Ilang pag-ilang nilaro na to, pang-apat na. So, sa ngayon dito sa judiciary, talagang pinaghandaan na talaga namin na tinitiktik ko talaga sa kanila na kuno natin yung unang panalo natin. Do so, sabi ko, isa lang naman ang papantayan natin sa judiciary or dalawa. Pero lagi yung isipin na anim pa rin yung kalaban nyo. Huwag tayo masyadong, masyadong um, kumbiyansa pa ba? Pero dapat hindi mo wala yung kumbiyansa nila sa sarili. Kasi yun ang maniisip namin eh. No once talaga, malamangan, ganyan. Biglang kumababa yung kumbiyansa nila. So yun ma. Kaya yung match talagang pinagpukulong namin pansin yung core defense nila. Tsaka Blackie. May dalawa kami maayos na middle mami. Lahat naman actually magagaling talaga mga players mo. Pero ngayon talaga si Bentic yung matatapat ko sa kanya. Um, message ko sa team ko, guys, sabi ko nga nung muna pa lang, ang salta pa lang ako sa team, nakita ko na sila mami na mag-training. Muna pa lang nakita ko sa kanila na may potential talaga yung team. Kailangan lang i-boost talaga yung moral. Tsaka sa loob ng court, kailangan yung mag Tiwalaan ba ma? Tiwalaan ang sarili. Pati ang ka-teammates nyo, dapat itiwalaan nyo. Huwag nilang bitawan. Dapat lagi tayong may panakos. Huwag nilang bitawan pag ang momentum na sa atin na hawakan natin hanggang sa matapos yung tema. Hindi hindi mo wala yung tiwala ng coaches sa inyo, guys. Yun, yun lang po. Yun ang panghawakan nila. Yan po si Fire Officer 3, Franz Bautista, ang head coach ng BFP, looking for their first win. Da, anong tingin mo sa kanilang mga planong and adjustments coming into this game, Chiki? Kailangan maingay sila agad. Pagpasok na pagpasok nila sa court, <laughs> maingay para talagang yung momentum nila, energy level goes up right away. Well, gusto nila itigil ang kanilang three-game losing streak. Samantala, looking for their third straight win. Ang judiciary set number one coming up. Let's go courtside para sa introduction ng parehong kopunan. Ladies and gentlemen, let us now meet the national referees for this match. First referee, Elmel Onkoy, national referee. Second referee, Marlon Makabenta, national referee. And now, let's meet the starters first for the BFP Lady Firefighters. Team Captain number 11, Chief Inspector Marky Markaida. Wearing jersey number 3, Fire Officer 1, Chris Matalugto. Jersey number 7, Fire Officer 2, Bans Hosmilio. Jersey number 8, Fire Officer 2, Gang Adeliana. Jersey number 17, Fire Officer 1, Benz Bentik. Wearing Jersey 18, Fire Officer 1, Fanny Atolfo. Libero wearing Jersey number 14, Fire Officer 1, May Magpantay. And head coach for the Lady Firefighters is Fire Officer 3, Malin Bautista. And now the starting lineup for your Judiciary Justice Surfers. Wearing jersey number four, Joe Gallo. Wearing jersey number five, Jam Angeles. And jersey number six, Lerma Tupor. Wearing jersey number 11, Arnie Pesebre. Jersey number 12, Mitch Alcancha. 
jersey number 18, Jen Yavor. And Libero for the Justice Servers, number 9, Sheena Castillo. Head coach of the judiciary is Arnaldo Dino. UVL fans, let's get ready to serve, spike, and set with the BFB Lady Firefighters and the Judiciary Justice Servers. Ito ang starting lineup ng Lady Firefighters looking uh, to get their first win in their very first season sa UVL or UNTV Volleyball League. And they're going up against, uh, yung nabanggit na nga natin, Chiki, yung mga veterano mula sa judiciary. Uh, Mitch Alcancha in the starting lineup instead of Jennifer Verhel. Uh, we wish her a speedy recovery. Okay. Miss Verhel, that service outside for the first point ng BFP. That's not really the way that you want to go for the first point, no? First stroke yep. outside. Pero Bowie again. Marky Markaida, kanilang team captain with the serve. Alcancha, underhand pass. Pesebre ang papalo. Opportunity to get their second straight point, but a good rally here. Rosmilio is a set ulit. Back row attack. Good passing ng parehong kopunan. Pesebre. No, Pesebre going for zone 1. Kailangan po mag-stretch doon, eh, no? Ang, ang BFP, but wasn't able to cover that spot. Eh, ito yung isa sa mga weaknesses na sinabi ni Coach Bautista ng BFP. Kanilang floor defense, pinapaigting pa nila yan. Osmilio with the set, medyo mababa. So it's gonna be a chance ball dito para sa Justice Servers. Good dig! The back set, Osmilio ang papalo. Pesebre mula sa gitna. And then yung uh, receive ni Magpantay. Alcansha, balik kay Pesebre. Drop naman, Osmilio inangat. Nice! Matalogdog with the push. Yeah, madalugdog. Nakita niya na bukas doon sa gitna. Kaya she just pushed it. Look at this. There goes that push and late in defense ng justice servers. Madalugdog with a good serve. Palo into the net para kay Angeles. Pero you could see, no, na kahit na nagkaroon ng error si Angeles doon, yung teammates niya talagang egging her on na, you know, bawe agad. Di maganda yung pasa na yun. Medyo short, the push by Angeles. Itong Justice Server scrambling pero hindi na itawid yung bola ni Stephanie Adolfo. Yeah, the ball was just near, too near the net, kaya masyadong limited yung options ni Adolfo doon. Parehong kupunan, may mga kanya-kanyang errors magpantay with a bad receive. You know, sabi nga nila eh, ang setters usually sila yung mga matitindi mag-serve. I don't know why, maybe it's because mas madalas yung hawak namin sa bola, so mas uh, kabisado, maybe that could be it. Ang kata ng palo, coming from Bentik. Adolfo will get the kill. There was just a miscommunication dito sa Justice Servers. Uh, kailangan lang talaga malakas yung pag-mind sa bola. Sabi nga nila, pag volleyball player ka, kailangan ano ka, greedy. <laughs> Say mine. That's the wrong ah, server. They check. Ah. Oh, last minute kasi na-realize ni Husmilio, wrong server, hindi pa siya yung dapat magsaserve. So that caused the delay. So easy point para kay Alarni Pesebre at ang Justice Servers. Right on the line. Yeah. 
that was a good hit. Paano siya? Long by Abeliana. Ang tinarget talaga niya yung end line eh. Kasi ma, kung ikaw yung defender, nakakalito talaga. Iisipin ko outside. Really good hit there. Ito na yung serve ni Josmillo. Tubog, a-atake. There's a net touch. Contra kay Bentic. Uh, you, you like what uh, no, BFP is doing, no? Nagbablock sila kasi rin recognize nila yung mga matitinding mag-attack mag for the justice servers. And Lerma Tubog is one of them. So second deadlock dito sa ating opening set. Osmilio with a one-handed pass. Alcansa inangat, yabut ang papalo. Oh, nice hit by Bentik. You know, si Bentik, yung first ano niya, sport niya talaga is basketball and she was a point guard. Ngayon, she is one of the leading scorers dito sa BFP. And she only started playing volleyball in first year college. Di maganda yung basa ni Pesebre. Pesebre gets it back, hits. Bentik with a pass. Two-handed push, madalogdog. Pesebre, papalo ulit. Second straight hit para kay Pesebre. Overpass, Josmillo ay nangat. Here comes Abellana. This one outside. Well, you'd like, you like the way that, that both teams are moving in the floor, no? Maingay din sila eh. Naririnig dito sa arena. They're really communicating with each other. Dikit na laman so far. Madalogdog. Got it. Good hit there by Madulugdog. Wasn't a very strong hit, pero maganda yung placement niya, o, yung angulo ng kanyang tira. That's why she was able to get the score or the point for BFP. So, balik sa kalabangan dito ang Lady Firefighters. Hindi pa po lumalabang. So far, ang Justice Servers, Pesebre, make that tubog with a hit. And that is gonna be outside para kay Adolfo. Maganda yung ano no, eye ng judiciary floor defense. Nababasa nila kung yung bola is inside or outside. So far, they were able to let go uh, a couple of balls na tama. It, they were, it was really outside. Lerma Tubog. Game is tied. Abeliana, inangat. Ang ganda ng pasa. Lerma Tubog, pesebre into the net. Hindi pa rin makatikin ng kalabangan dito ang justice servers. Yeah, malaking factor dyan itong ano eh, blockers. Because, syempre, when you're the attacker, may intimidate ka when somebody's in front of you trying to stop you. Puntahan natin itong report ni Dana de Guzman. Dana? Hello. Eric and Chiki, kanina ay nakausap ko si Coach Franz ng BFP at pinaalalahanan daw niya ang kanyang mga players na ani mang naglalaro sa loob ng court. Huwag nilang bantayan ang two or three players lang. Sabi ganyan din ni Coach, alalahanin nila ang kanilang kumpiyansa sa sarili at magtiwala sa kanilang mga teammates. Sabi rin niya ay mas maging matapang sila sa magpag kanilang mga pagpalo. Mas nag-iingat sila ay mas lalo silang magkakamali. Ngayon, tingnan natin kung paano maa-apply ng BFP ang mga payo ni Coach. Oo oh, nga, kasi pag masyado ka namang careful inside the court, eh, hindi, ka, hindi ka na makakagalaw talaga, eh. hindi na fluid yung movements ko. And yung attack na yun, outside para kay Adolfo, lalamang ang justice servers for the first time dito sa ating first set. Kita mo, no? first set pa lang, alam mo na walang gustong bumitaw, very close ang kanilang puntos. Yabut with that nice underhand serve, Cosmillo. Oh. Looking for a one-two play. Medyo naging too creative that time. Hindi nga siya natakot pero hindi naman niya naitawid ang bola. So that's another error. Back-to-back -back errors para sa Lady Firefighters. And they're down by two points. 10-8 contra sa Justice Servers. Timeout for Coach Bautista. Justice! 
ang ganda nga nung sinabi ni Coach Franz, no, na talagang dapat hindi ka conscious when you're inside the court. Pero medyo mahirap kung alam mong may mga TV cameras, <laughs> diba? Pero kailangan labanan mo yon. And of course, find the weakest link dun sa kalaban mo. Because that's the way na makaka-earn ka ng easy point. Doesn't have to be, alam mo yun, yung malakas na ano na palo. Kung maganda yung placement mo, tapos linagay mo dun sa weakest link, o di okay yun for you. Ay, right, let's see kung uh, may execute yung mga instructions na yan ni Coach Franz Bautista ng Lady Firefighters, Josmilio. Madalogdog, blocked by Pesebre. Pinush ni Madalogdog to the back row. Uh, Pesebre, atake. Yun ang ating magpantay. A good floor defense para sa Lady Firefighters. Alcansha, back to Pesebre. And hindi na itawid yung ball na yan. Oh, nabantayan siya eh, ni Madalogdog. So, na alam ng ano, BFP, sino yung kailangan nilang stop So, when the ball is given to Pesebre, you can be sure, ayan, no? ganda nung habo ng kamay ng Madalog Dog. You can be sure na talaga net defense will be there for her. Nagahabol dito. Ang Lady Firefighters, pero maudlot yung paghabol na yan with another error. So, in last three points ng uh, Justice Servers have come from errors nitong Lady Firefighters. That's something that you really want to avoid. Adolfo in ang atambola. We're gonna go to Bentik. Bentik is blocked by Pesebre. Adolfo Papalo, what a dig! Yeah. Um, right now, itong rally na to, good throw defense para sa parehong kapunan. Bentik, Alcansha, in ang ata, habol si Pesebre. Tubog, itatawid ang bola. Longest rally so far, Adolfo got it! And then the distribution ni Osmilio, binigay niya sa outside, nakuha ng uh, justice server, so she went for the middle. The blocker was there, pero yung target nung, ano, nung middle nila is the high hands. So point for them. Back-to-back -back points! Para sa Lady Firefighters, and from down, two points, tied na naman po tayo at 11. Yeah, Adolfo coming from earning a point in the middle to earning a point from the service zone. What? May have been double contact. Yeah. Na hindi tinawag. And a lifting violation ng... Sorry, no. A violation contra sa justice servers dito. Yes. I thought that was a double contact. Pero pag walang tinatawag ang referee, game continues. Oh, Tuloy-tuloy yun. And of course, mag-reklamo si Coach Dino ng justice servers going to the technical committee. And dahil dun sa non-call na yun, ang uh, Lady Firefighters on top by one. Pawiyan natin, lumangan natin, lumangan pa natin ang lumangan. Ha? Ang plano natin ay ang manalo. Let's do this, let's do this. Firebird! Firebird! Ano ba ng kalaban nyo? Una ba ba na sa nagkakaroon? Ano ba ba na Ano ba ba na sa kalaban nyo? Bakit ba binablock nyo pa? Alam nyo na magpitribol na binablock pa dalawa. Oo nga. Pag alam nyo sa ano, Chance. Saka bakit ayaw, na kayo. ayaw nyo banatan yung bola? Sayang, sayang ni eh. Walang, walang, I mean, I mean, dalawa lang ang opensa nila. Marami kayong pwedeng targeting sa service yung marunong pa yung sinatarget nyo. Targetin nyo yung mga, alam nyo, ano, yung kanto-kanto na yan para mahirapan sila sa depensa. Kasi ang nangyayari tayo, nahihirapan tayo, nag-abot. Tignan yung score, dikit na dikit. Lahat tayo pumapalo. Lahat ng, lahat ng palo nyo, puro error. Necessarily, kasi magbablock ka eh, free ball naman. So kung tumalun ka, nag expel ka ng energy, sayang. Tsaka kailangan alam din nila, sabi nga nung coach no, na kung ilan ba yung attackers ng justice servers, yun yung babantayan. Dalawa lang yung attackers nila. So, let's see, no? Oh, that's a good serve. Adolfo with an ace. And kung titignan natin, I'm looking at the stat sheet dito. Yeah. Offensively, mas magaling ang BFP. They've scored... Nine points already. Samantalang only three points sa atake ang score nitong Justice Servers. Most of their points galing sa errors ng Lady Firefighters who've committed eight errors already. So eight of the 11 points ng Justice Servers galing sa errors ng Lady Firefighters. Speaking of errors, that's an attack fault para sa Justice Servers. Yeah, there was a miscommunication between Pesebre at saka si Gallo. 
Patuloy ang run para sa Lady Firefighters. Now up by three. This is the biggest lead para sa Lady Firefighters. Oh, make that another point. And it's a four-point lead para sa Lady Firefighters, set number one. That was a good hit. It's a cross-court hit. At yun yung confidence no, na sa pagpalo. Ganda tingnan. So, Gallo, tatawid ang bola. Magpantay with the pass, Josmillo. Daming pagpipilian. They go to Bentic. And Bentic scores again. And you know, on a roll ang BFP ngayon. No? At tuwang-tuwa si Coach Franz because now their attacks are earning them the points. Biggest lead para sa Lady Firefighters. Hindi mapatay ng uh, Justice Servers ang run na ito. Tatawag na ng timeout si Coach Dino as we will check in with Dana de Guzman. Dana? Eric and Chiki, isa sa mga inaasahan ng team ay ang playmaker na si Jen Verhel para sa judiciary. Ngunit ngayon ay nando, nandoon siya sa kanilang uh, tahanan para magpahinga gawa daw ng kanyang nasangkot sa tricycle accident. Pero mabuti na lang ay wala naman daw naging fractures at kailangan lang ng pahinga. From UBL family, we are wishing a speedy recovery for Jen Verhel. Now back to the timeout. Si Michelle yung in charge sa iso lang. Alright? Yeah. 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 Let's go. Relax na. Relax na. Relax. Justice! Service! Oh, we hope that Jennifer Hell gets well right away. I hope hindi ganun ka-serious naman. No? Sabi ni Coach Dino at saka ni Attorney Inting kanina, uh, uh -huh. tinanong ko sila, mga na, may pasa lang daw kasi nga um, of the collision. Uh -huh. But she's gonna be okay, so that's definitely good news. Samantala, Mitch Alcanza muna, starting setter, para sa Justice Servers uh, for the meantime. Pero ito, nagahanap ng uh, way to stop the run, and finally, there it is! Yeah, si Pesebre found a way para mailagad yung blocker ng BFP. There's that first ball, and Mitch goes up to Pesebre. Matagal-tagal din nahirapan itong Justice Servers to stop that run. Sabi niya na. That hit is gonna go outside para kay Angeles. Yun yung sinasabi ng coach ng BFP. When you hit the ball, huwag niyo ito-target yung mga magagaling na mag-receive. Kasi babalik yung bola. So find the weaker link. Bans Hosbillo. 30 years old, yung kanilang setter ng uh, firefighters with a serve. Nice up by Abellana. Josmillo, binalik kay Abellana. Now with a drop. Uh -uh. That on set, it was high. It was, I had the distance from the net. Kaya kayang-kayang basahin ni Abellana kung saan niya gusto dalhin yung ball. And good, ano doon, good decision. Went for a, a slow ball. Six-point lead para sa Lady Firefighters. Pinakamalaking kalabangan nila to in the opening set. Tubog against two blockers. Binalik ni Tubog with a push. And running attack is no good para kay Markaida. You like what Osmilio is doing even if that one didn't work out. Iniikot niya yung bola eh. Iniiba-iba niya yung mga nag-a-attack for BFP para malito yung floor defense, net defense ng judiciary. Samantala, Aleli Boras checking in for the first time. Five-point game, 13 serving, 18 for set. Angeles with the serve, so back-to-back -back errors para kay Angeles, an attack error and a service error. So matala si Bentik ngayon. Bents, Bentik, uh, fire officer one. That is the entry-level position sa Bureau of Fire Protection. Gets an ace? Yes, it is an ace. Diyan mataas ang stats ng BFP sa kanilang service uh -oh. So we'll see later no, kung ano yung production nila dyan if continuous pa ba yung taas ng putos nila. Sabi nga ni Coach Bautista, doon di na kami nag-practice kasi noong last game nila, maganda na nga yung uh -oh. aces. So they focused on other things. And now they're up by seven. Biggest lead para sa Lady Firefighters. Pesebre. That could have been outside. Kinuha ni Abellana. So a free ball para dito sa Justice Servers. A bad pass by Pesebre. Tubog. This is a chance ball. Osmillo, one-handed set. Boras with a hit. 
Inangati Abellana. Abellana will get it back. Nice push. Boras will send it outside. Oh, the set wasn't that good para sa attacker ng BFP. Pero wow, nagawa ng paraan. You know, si um, Abellana really looks at the ball, watches it. Reads the play of the defense ng kalaban at ina nga maganda yung hulog niya doon. Hit the floor. Samantala, uh, si Jaja Kainglet will check in along with Jen Sumalino para sa Lady Firefighters who are now up by eight, their biggest lead dito sa opening set. Another good serve. Short pass. They're matubog. This is practically a free ball. Nice. Almost. Oh. But it is unsuccessful yung pagtawid ng Lady Firefighters ng bola. Good job by the justice servers. Hindi malakas yung bola ng atake nila, pero ang ganda ng placement, nagkagulo yung defense ng BFP. Kainglet will pass. Abellana. Alcansha to Pesebre. Nasa gitna. Kainglet. This time, Abellana. A hard hit. Yes! Abellana is on a roll. Ah. May oh, yeah. kita mo, iba-iba yung kanyang atake. Merong malakas, merong tip. Pero kahit na tip, ano siya eh, ang gulo. Kaya nahanap niya yung buta sa floor ng justice servers. Gonna be five points para kay Abellana. Siya ang leading scorer right now para sa Lady Firefighters. Boras, naghahanap ng kanyang unang puntos. Off the block, kainglet, inangat. And a nice pass by Bentik. Adolfo with a hit. A lot of good attackers para dito sa Lady Firefighters. Uh, right now, it's paying off. That one, my block touch. Finally, a side out para sa Justice Servers. Pero malaki na to. They're down by seven points. Pero maganda yung target ni Pesebre doon. Went for the high hands. Got the point from the, off the block. Served by Lerma Tubog. Then peak with the pass. Kainglit sa gitna. Madalog dog will push it and score. Madalog dog kinaliwa yung atake niya. And not a problem for her. Even if merong blocker sa harap niya, mas mabilis yung pagpasok ng bola niya kesa pag-block ni Pesebre. Marky Markaida with the serve and it's outside. That was a good read by Gallo. Pag mataas yung bola, nasa, nasa likod ka na and it's shoulders up, you can let that ball go. Antala. Checking in for the first time, one of the more senior players ng Justice Servers, 43-year-old Kat Dolorosa. Uh, she will be the setter. Or at least will help Mil, uh, Mitch Alcansha with the setting duties. Kainglet with a one-two play. Inangat ni Pesebre. Pesebre will get it back. Third touch. Bentik. Oh. A one-two play. Oh! Wait a minute. Double contact by Tatawag. Yeah. Double contact by Kainglet. Inunaan pa ni Alcansha ba? Yung uh, referee. Sinarin oh, yung bola. Sinarin yung bola eh. <laughs> Coach Dino not very happy with that call. It, the call was a bit late. Here comes Adolfo. Got it! It is going to be seven set points para sa Lady Firefighters. They are right now on fire sa ating opening set. Madalog Dog looking for an ace. Tubog with a great pass. Dolorosa inangat Pesebre against two blockers. Kainglet will set it. Bentik with a push. Tubog, great save. Pesebre pushing it to the other side. Kainglet on a one-two play. Alcansha, Pesebre, one-two play. One-handed dig. Great run here. That hit going outside para kay Adolfo. Tito mo, no? Aggressiveness of both teams dun sa net. Kasi nare-recognize nila na hindi biro yung mga attackers. Yeah. Parehong teams. So, isang set point saved by the justice servers but anim pa yung kanilang kailangan burahin kung gusto nilang mapahaba pa tong first set. Oh! Almost forgot to send the ball over on the third touch para sa Lady Firefighters. Pesebre with a little help from the net. So, two set points saved by the justice servers. You know, sometimes, uh, well, pinapractice talaga yan, eh, na pinapasabit yung bola sa net. I just don't know that time kung talagang sa job yun or hindi. But nonetheless, it earned the justice servers their point. Third point naman para kay Pesebre. Alcansha 
with an ace. Three wow. points then para kay Alcansha and tatawag din ang timeout si Coach Bautista because she doesn't like it. This is three set points given up ng uh, BFP kontra sa judiciary. Papagos pa tayo kung papahabulin pa natin sila. Tapusin nyo na. I-receive na maayos. Biskardihan natin setter. Okay? Ja. Game, game. Receive natin na maayos para makaset tayo na maayos. Oh. Game, 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 game. Fire! Huwag mo na papasok. Huwag mo na papasok. Dito muna kayo. Ako sabi pa kayo ni Ma. Okay? Oh, okay, let's go. Justice! You know, that was a very strategic timeout by Coach Franz. Kailangan kasi sirain mo na yung momentum ng justice servers because they're on a roll. Yep. At isa na lang yung putos na kailangan ng fire protectors, no? or firefighters rather, para makuha nila tong set na to. Five points Abellana, four points Adolfo, three points para kay Madalog Dog. Yan ang mga top scorers ng Lady Firefighters. Samantalang, Three points. Yan ang highest scorer ng uh, Justice Servers. Ayan ay si Pesebre at si Alcansha. Kulang sa opensa right now itong Justice Servers. Let's see if Pesebre can score again. Block. Yes. Oh, what a yes. save. It's so high. high. Alcansha to Pesebre again. Three-point run para sa Justice Servers. Can they make it four straight points? Pesebre inangat. Pesebre papalo ulit. Hainglet. Bentik. Yeah, in angat ni Boras. Uh, Pesebre. Uh, long rally here. Kaiglet. Bentik for the winning point. Wala pa. Alcansha with a dig. Pesebre with a push. Markaida in angat. Gonna be a chance ball para sa Justice Servers. Pesebre right in front of the net. It's outside. And that is it. Justice Servers with the attack fall. Eh, bibigay ang winning point sa Lady Firefighters. And that's why you like, you love watching you and Volleyball League kasi you never say die eh, yung yeah. mga teams and yun, prime example of that. And another look at that long, exciting rally. Pati yung crowd dito na papatili each and every hit ng parehong kopunan. Uh, highlights of the opening set. Kung saan both teams nagpapalitan ng puntos, Chiki, until midway to the set, kung saan kumawala itong Lady Firefighters. That's right. And you know, sa first few uh, points nga eh, masyadong gipit. You know, at talagang 5-5, uh, 6-6, five, five, six, mm -hmm. six, yung mga ganyan. No? So talagang uh, the energy level of BFP, the communication inside the court, the strategic timing of Coach Franz, yun talaga work together for them. At the end of the first set, it is a... 25-20 win para sa Lady Firefighters contra sa Justice Servers. Okay, UPM, oras na muli para hanapin ang ating face of the game. Saktong-sakto, mainit ang panahon. Mas lalong nagiinit ang mga laro dito sa UVL. Show us your excitement! Ayan, umiikot ang ating mga cameramen. Nagahanap kung sino ang mapipiling face of the game. Ayan, ito na nga siya. Ayan, I see si attorney Rose Ann Bonaobra. Ayan, she is also supporting the BFP Lady Firefighters. Thank you for watching the games. Pag ikaw ang napiling ating face of the game, you will win a special gift pack mula sa ating mga sponsors. Once again, this is the UVL Season 2, ang unang volleyball league ng mga public servants. Yeah, attack points ng BFP. Mas ang laki ng putos, no? 13 as opposed to 6. They had good first balls. The setters were able to distribute the sets um, to all their attackers. Blocking, mas aggressive sila sa net. Uh, service aces, pareho lang. But, you know, mas madami yung errors ng BFP. Pero, na-over, na-compensate ito sa kanilang attacks. Mas marami pa silang uh, binigay na puntos kesa sa in-score ng uh, Justice Servers. So only scored 8 points. 
Um, so that's an, an issue na kailangan nilang batayan moving forward. But a, an excellent uh, first set para sa Lady Firefighters. They led by as many as 8 points uh, and really controlled the, the first set, uh, Chiki. Yeah. And you, kung ikaw yung coach, ikaw si Coach Franz, gusto mo yun. Kasi talagang <laughs> you need that one point dun sa winning column. Yep. sa team standings, di ba? So, yan yung talagang goal nila. But, you know, matagal pa tong game na to. It's just the second set. So, the justice servers can still be able to uh, get this uh, second set and give us an even more exciting ball game. Oh, well, right now, ang issue, if, if you're Coach Dino ng justice servers, o pensa mo, it's really stagnant. I mean, highest scorer mo only has three points. Uh, and that's uh, Alarni Pesebre. You know, they're gonna need a lot more kung Gusto nilang tapatan itong mainit na mainit na Lady Firefighters who are led again by Abellana with 5 points, yeah. Madalogdog with 3, and several other players with uh, 2 or more. Yeah. So, ang an daming, an daming dito kailangan bantayan. Um, there's the very lethal offensively. Samantalang kayo, bilang lang yung umuopensa sa inyo. That's Alarni Pesebre na banggit natin. So, gotta get everybody going right. if you're Coach Dino. Right. And you know, it also doesn't help na malakas yung serve ng, ano, ng BFP so that na-out of system sila. So, nahihirapan silang mag-set up ng game. Uh, two aces din in the opening set. Yeah. Itong uh, Lady Firefighters right now. Ang taas ng kumpiyansa coming into set number two after a big five-point win in oh, the opening set. Abeliana was a big factor for them in the first yep. set. Top scorer with five points all coming from attacks. Mm, there you go. Mantalang Rafa checking in yeah. for the first time today. Yeah, they all, she's also one of the players now you have to watch out for. Oh, let's see, may adjustments. Starting set number two para kay Coach Bautista with Rafa in. So a much leaner, quicker, taller lineup. Pero the first point of set number two going to the justice servers with that service error. Mula kay Abellana. So another error, binanggit natin, they had 12 in the opening set. Yeah. Ano kaya? Sahig kaya yung may diparecho doon? <laughs> Kanina din, first point was an error. Preferasa, that's an attack error. So back-to-back -back errors to start set number two para sa Lady Firefighters. Ganda rin yung tandem ng block ni ano eh, Pesebre at saka ni Alcantia. They were very close to each other and very intimidating. Lady Boras will be in the starting lineup para kay Coach Dino here in set number two. And that's a block again. Against Adolfo naman. A nice hit. Mula kay Gallo. Adolfo with the push. And Gallo with a nice save. Kay Inglet sends it all the way to Prata Rosa. Papa Mawian, and she gets the point. Kasi yung talo ni Prata Rosa, kala mo she's gonna hit it hard eh. Pero yung pala, oh, in the middle, nagbago siya ng isip. Makikita mo yun sa kamay niya eh. Nakabukas yung kamay niya. So you know it's a drop ball. First attack point para sa Lady Firefighters. And they're on the board. This is set number two. One, serving two. Kainglet, the starting setter. Nice serve to Boras. Uh, three lady block. Contra. Nice placement. And Braferosa with back to back points. Yeah, kanina kasi she didn't like yung first attack point niya, although it earned their team uh, score. Kaya eto. Bumawi siya dun sa second. Another point for her. A two point run para sa Lady Firefighters. They tie the game. Ito sa second set. Kainglet serves to Boras again. Alcansha. One to play. Inangat ni Adolfo. Kainglet. Good distribution again para dito sa Lady yeah. Firefighters. Everybody touching the ball. At madalogdog. Inangat. And this time sa gitna. And Adolfo connects. You know, Adolfo was out of place. Pero tinawag siya ng attention ni eh, Kainglet. And look at how she gets that ball over. You know, halos nakatalikod siya eh, when she faced that ball. Pero placement was the key for her. Three frontliners ng uh, Lady Firefighters. They've touched the ball. They've made contact. And very first place itong set number two. Pesebre with the push. Pancake save is no good mula kay Prate Rosa. Yeah, that is a good tip there by... Um, ito, tingnan natin yung replay by Pesebre. Out of place siya dun eh. But she was able to keep that ball alive and hit the floor. Doon mo malalaman kung magaling yung attacker mo eh. Kung nakakapag-adjust siya sa bola ng setter. Adolfo, inangat ni Alcansha. Alcansha into the net.
This is now a 4 to 1 run para sa Lady Firefighters. Lamang na sila ngayon ng isa, 4-3. Dolorosa ay nangat. Here comes Pesebre. Padalugdog mula sa gitna. Boras with the dig. Pesebre. Barcaida. Madalugdog again. Here's Kainglet with the first touch. Nice Raferosa. Set. Yes! Ganda naman nung set ni, ano, ni Madalugdog para kay Raferosa. Look at that. Hindi umikot yung bola. It was high. It was ano, comfortable distance from the net. A lot of ano, room para kay Raferosa to decide what kind of hit she wanted to deliver. Another big run para sa Lady Firefighters. Five to one run. Raferosa. Oh, Alcanza with a dig. Oh, nice push, but it's outside. Mula kay Gallo. Ganda sana kung ID ni Gallo, di ba? Kasi normally, itong zone 4, hindi mo nababantayan masyado yun eh. Yun lang, the, the, the throw or the push just went a little wide. Two of the six points nitong Lady Firefighters as an ace there. Para sa Lady Firefighters, two of their seven points mula sa errors ng Justice Servers. Kanina pa nasa service zone si Adolfo. <laughs> seven to one run para sa Lady Firefighters. Pesebre finally stops the run. Good angle of a hit there by Pesebre. And of course, since siya yung go-to player ng uh, Justice Servers, talagang you can expect na yung mga hits niya will earn their team a point. Pesebre. Lapit. Has been, and there's a ball touching the antenna mula kay Madalugdog. And that's why most coaches will say, kung alanganin ka na, itaas mo lang yung bola high enough para maka-adjust yung teammate mo for an attack. Pesebre with five points. She's been getting a lot of the sets. Uh, right now, she's ready to serve. Substitution para kay Coach Dino. Uh, we'll be seeing Joanna come into the game. But right now, uh, timeout muna tayo. Pahigyan natin ang judiciary. Pahigyan natin ang receive. Wala naman tayo receive ulit. Okay? Bawi tayo sa receive. Nasa harap ka. Ha? Mag Maghahabol kayo ni, ano, ni, ano, sa loob. Kaya ikaw ang aatake ng outside, siya ang aatake ng gitna. Okay, ngayon si si Lerman nasa gitna, ikaw ang outside. Okay? Trabaho lang tayo muna sa loob ng court. Trabaho tayo depende sa ulit, takas sa blocking. Ha? Let's go. Kaya natin to, kapit lang. Tara, tara, tara. Walang yan, ha? Tara, let's go. Let's go. Justice! Server! Kapit lang tayo. Good reminders there eh, by Coach Dino, no, na yung mga attackers, dalaw lang kasing attackers nila, outside at saka yung middle. So, kailangan maganda ang kanilang first ball. That's why kanina pa niya i-reiterate. Kailangan yung floor defense mas maganda. And that's really what they concentrated on eh. Yung kanilang defense. Lalo na pag ang kalaban mo, ang daming attackers. Like, uh, ang ano, ang firefighters. Sa harap, sa likod, yep. merong mga pwedeng mag-atake dyan. Okay, so... Uh, you look at Mitch Alcansha, Pesebre, she has yung load ng points para dito sa judiciary. I'm very impressed with her stamina. She's yeah. getting <laughs> most of the <laughs> offense dadaan sa kanya. And Correct. yet, she's still there on the floor parang hindi napapagod. Madalogdog with a powerful dunk. Ganda nung push ni Madalogdog. She knew where she wanted to put that ball. Look at that. Nicely done. And she even challenged the libero ah, ng justice oh. servers. Dolorosa inangat. Verma Tubog. There's Adolfo with the receive. Marcaida with the push. Dolorosa. Hmm. And they go to Joanne. Oh, a nice little play there using the net for Madalugdog. Joanne with the attack. Madalugdog sa gitna. One hand, the dig is good. Dolorosa out to Joanne again. This time into the net. As we set it courtside to Dana de Guzman. 
Patrick, it was a slow start for the Justice Servers and Coach Dino reminded her girls na nawala ang kanilang enjoyment when it comes to the first set. Now, ngayon, tignan natin kung paano sila kumalma, paano nila ikompose ang sarili nila at pinaalalahanan din sila na basahin nilang maigi ang bola at dumipensa. At of course, communicate din sa loob ng court. Now, let's see how the girls will respond this second set. Back to our panel. Maraming salamat, uh, Dana. You know, when you're not enjoying kasi, sobrang calculated na yung movements mo. Eh. Natatakot kang magkamali. So kaya sinabi ni Coach Dino, enjoy the game and read. Kasi pwede mong basahin kung saan manggagaling yung bola, gano'ng kabilis yung bola. You just have to stay close to the ground. Ah, pero ngayon, puro pagkakamali para sa Justice Servers. Eh, almost another one. Back-to-back -back faults para sa Justice Servers. They're down by five already. That's double contact. Yeah, ito tawag kontra sa Lady Firefighters. That stops their run. The only time the run stops dito para sa Lady Firefighters is if they commit an error. They've been oh. playing so well. Oh, oh. Kailangan talaga control those unnecessary faults. Joanne Bejek with a serve. Underhand pass. Abeliana, atake. That's outside. Back-to-back -back errors para dito sa Lady Firefighters. Nagkakaroon ng konting buhay ang Justice Servers. Oh, good read there by the Justice Servers. Yan, in-apply nila yung sinabi ni Coach Dino. Basahin ninyo yung bola. That one, they were able to read it na it was high and it was strong, kaya outside. Kainglet passes. Abeliana, papabawiin. There's a nice receive coming from Pesebre. Pesebre from the back row. Inangat ni Adolfo. Kainglet sa gitna, madalogdog. Boras with good defense. Pesebre ulit ang aangat. Great pass by Magpantay. Markaida. Uh, Boras. Then Flema Tubog with back-to-back -back errors. Ito mo merong uh, slight frustration si Pesebre doon. No? Because it was a long rally. They were on a roll. Kailang nagkaroon ng ano, attack error. So bawi na lang agad. Matagal-tagal pa naman. Lerma Tubog really struggling today. Magpantay playing great defense para sa Lady Firefighters Dolorosa. Lerma Tubog, papabawian, blocked by Madalugdog. Chance sa umata kay Abeliana. Very tight. Actually, it's an overpass and it goes outside. Another error para dito sa BFP. Lerma Tubog on your screens. And there is Coach Franz Bautista, isang Bikulana. She's been... 10 years in the service para sa Bureau of Fire Protection. Wow. Santana, Dolorosa. Right now, the setter para dito sa kanyang kopunan. Oh, a bad pass para sa Lady Firefighters. Easy point for the Justice Servers now within two points. Yeah, and that's really what you want, no? Kung hindi ka man maka-service ace, kailangan pahirapan mo yung kalaban mo. Get them out of system. Dolorosa did a good job there. Uh, another nice serve overpass. And chance ball dito para Kilerma Tubog with a push. Oh, Lerma Tubog makes up for her errors with a nice drop. Yeah. Kasi kung hindi pumapasok yung mga strong hits, go for those tips. And what a placement. Nicely done by Tubog. Time out para kay Coach Bautista will listen in. Sabi ko yung a-attacky, di ba? Kitang-kita naman kung i-drop ko ano eh. Adjust na natin. Huwag muna tayo ang gagalaw ba masyado. Ah, tingnan, tingnan, mo, tingnan nyo muna yung kamay nung a-attacky. Maririnig nyo naman, di ba? Pag nakaangat na yung kamay niya, hindi na niya papaluin ng malakas. Iuhulog na lang talaga yan. Abang, abang, abang. Adjust, adjust, adjust. Yeah! Yeah! Receive yeah! Receive kayo! Receive us! 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 Okay? Okay. Three points dito sa volleyball eh. So, calm down. One point at a time. Dito naman sa firefighters, I think that's how they won the first set. Yung abang nila, yung pagbasa nila sa kamay, at saka yung quick adjustments sa mga atake ng justice servers. Chansa para matay ang game on the serve by Dolorosa. 10-11 dito sa set number 2. 
Magpantay, short pass, and another ace para kay Del Rosa. Nawala na yung kalamangan ng Lady Firefighters. We are tied at 11. Yeah, you know, si Del Rosa is really targeting the libero. Magpantay of uh, the firefighters. So, pahinga muna siya. Profe Rosa is taking her place. After being down by five points, the La Rosa and the Justice Servers have come back. And we have a ball game here at set number two. <laughs> and that kind of serving, you're bound to make a mistake. Kinakargan kasi yung De La Rosa, and she sends that one into the net. So, aangat ulit sa kalamangan itong Lady Firefighters up by one. Game face on. Para kay Madalugdog with a nice serve. Short pass mula kay Lerma Tubog. It's gonna be a chance ball mula kay Pesebre. Paiglet sa gitna, Adolfo. Got it! Back-to-back -back points para sa Lady Firefighters. They're up by two. Yeah, you know what? Si Kainglet just put uh, Adolfo in a good position where she could look good pag tinamaan niya yung bola. Ganda nung setup. Oh, what a nice jump, sir! Para kay Madalugdog! <laughs> Sabay hawak sa temples niya, di ba? Naloka daw siya doon. Nakala niya hindi papasok yung bola. <laughs> Three-point run para sa Lady Firefighters after allowing Itong Justice Servers to get back in the set. And that one is outside, you know. A good little run already para sa Lady Firefighters to get control of set number two. That's a good read by the Justice Servers, letting that ball go for an easy point for them. Adalogdok now with five points. She is one of two players with at least five points para sa Lady Firefighters. Abellana going for six, pero may net touch. Correct. The setup was just too close to the net. The ball was high, pero nothing much that you can do with that. Kasi pag bagsak mo, talagang tatama ka sa net. So a two-point run para sa Justice Servers, but those two points nila were from errors. Hindi, yeah. hindi gumawa ng opensa doon ng Justice Servers. Errors yun nitong Lady Firefighters. Now a chance to tie for Judiciary. And they will not do it as Lerma Matubo continues to struggle in the game. Ganun eh, no? Bad game ka lang talaga. Oo, oh, talagang hindi maganda yung gising, ano? Oo. Oh, pero pwede ka naman bumawi sa defense. Matala, it is the serve. Mura kay Abellana. Oh, nice. get an ace! Yeah. Good spot there. Good speed. That is point number six for Abellana as we check in once again uh, with Dana de Guzman. Eric and Chiki, alam niyo ba na si Fanny Adolpo ay isa sa mga pinalipad ng National Headquarters ng BFP at na-share rin niya na ang team daw nila ay nagmula pa sa iba't ibang dako ng Pilipinas. Now, when I ask her what is her pre-game ritual, siya daw ay nagme-meditate para makatulong sa kanyang focus at composure. Looking at how she is playing right now, we can see how calm and composed Fanny Adolpo is. Balik sa inyo. Maraming salamat, Dana. Yeah, Adolpo is playing very well today. Yan. Kita mo naman yung palong yun, di ba? With exclamation point talaga. Ganda ng meditation niya kanina before the game, I guess. <laughs> Adolfo with yeah. five points in the game. Three-point lead para sa Lady Firefighters. Boras. Tinawid the bola. Abeliana picking it up. Kay Inglet. Sa gitna. Adolfo right on cue. Oh, kasi kung hot na hot si Adolfo, bigay at ibigay mo sa kanya yung bola. Actually, nine points na kay Adolfo, including the serves and the blocks. Oh, is she the highest pointer now? Right for now, oh. Okay? Ng bola, uh, uh, BN, ano, sigurado, ang pas na okay? Tapos cover tayo sa ilalim. Bumalik sa atin ng bola, set tayo ulit. Dalawa na yung atake sa atin, kaya kailangan natin tumulong sa depensa. Okay? Sige, go! Go, go, go! 
kayo mo frustrate. Huwag kayo mo frustrate. Laruin niyo ulit. Hindi niyo kasi hindi kayo nag-uusap. Mag-uusap kayo. Ah, kaya yan, kaya yan. Let's go. Justice! Seven! communication inside the court eh, kasi it also helps in the energy level pang lift up nito so uh, yung mga reminders nga ni coach Dino no, lower the errors well at least ito yung narinig natin sa huddle nila lower the errors kasi very very easy point yun eh para sa kalaban and then of course since dalawa lang yung attackers mababantayan sila ng defense ng, ano, ng firefighters so kailangan yung coverage nila on their toes, mabilis ang galaw, tsaka hahabol at hahabol sa bola. Uh, speaking of errors, seven of the 18 points ng Lady Firefighters galing sa errors. Wow. Ng Justice Servers. So, just so you know, kung bakit tinututukan ni oh, Coach oh. Dino yung errors na yan, because halos kalahati ng puntos ng kalaban nila ay galing sa errors nila. Pesebre with a push! Almost! Pero hindi na ito eh, ng Lady Firefighters ang bola. Boy, may kita mo sa mukha ni Pesebre, no? Never say die. Kahit na hindi ganun kaganda yung set sa kanya, kailangan niyang habulin, gagawa niya ng paraan para makapunto sa team niya. Samantala si Honorable Mendoza Villapando will serve. Nice one all the way to the back. Kailet! Praverosa! Wow! Oh, there's a net touch din. Tapos na. Praverosa, gusto pa bigyan ng isa eh. May net touch na. I'm just the servers, and uh, the point will go to the Lady Firefighters now up by four again. Alam mo gusto mo rin yun eh sa teammate mo kasi napapa ano ka yung energy mo napapatalon ka eh. Biggest lead in Lady Firefighters was five points. Dolorosa to Pesebre. Yes! Side out para sa Justice Service. And you can see si Pesebre, no, yung mga attacks niya, hindi siya down the line. It's always in an angle para hindi madali yung, ano, yung receive. Kasi kung hindi malakas yung, yung ano mo, hit mo, chances are mas madali siyang i-receive. Pero kung naka-angulo, mahirap. Kainglet. Madalog to. Got it. Walang runs para sa Justice Service. Sabi ni Madalog to. Eh, you know what, Madalugdog and Proferosa, sila yung ano, eh, gumawa ng uh, momentum para dito sa, ano, sa firefighters in those two runs. Proferosa, nice serve, pero malakas. Kargado, kargado. Uh -oh. So it's a three-point game. Joanne with the serve. Pasa ni Adolfo. Abellana. Side out ulit. Ganda naman nung set na yun. Talagang swak para kay Abellana for a down the line strong hit. Yun nagagawa ng magandang pasa. And that's oh, what oh. Uh, the Lady yes. Firefighters right now are showing. Four points to win para sa Lady Firefighters. Four points to tie para sa uh, Justice Servers. Dolorosa will pass to Boras. Oh yes, Boras connecting. Aleli Boras, uh, just her second point of the game. Yeah, Boras not intimidated even if she had double blocks there. She was able to go and find the gap in between those blocks. So, patuloy ang paghabol ng Justice Servers. Pero Dolorosa, ang Justice Servers had a three-point run on her serve kanina. Let's uh -huh. see if they have it in them again. They're only down by three. Oh! And as you say it... Eh? What is that? Eight na. Eight errors. Eight of the 22 points. Hindi ito mo rin, no? Yung shoulders ng justice servers, medyo slump uh, na. Parang nawawalan sila ng energy. Sa kumpiyansa. Oo, oh, kumpiyansa. Confidence level. Good pass. One-handed push there by Honorable Mendoza Villapando. Here comes Adolfo. Bejek with the up. Pesebre ang papalo. Sharp pass. Abellana. Good defense by Dolorosa. Mendoza Villapando to Boras. Great passing. Oh, pero nagkabanggaan doon. Adolfo na itawid pa rin ng bola despite the collision. Tubog. Avellana. And that'll be it. Long rally. Sharp point para kay Avellana. Kahit na nagkabungguan <laughs> yung ano, firefighters in that, ano, in that last play, okay lang na itawid pa rin nila. They kept their composure. They continued to communicate. At ayun ang resulta. Puntos for their team. Eight points para kay Abellana. Madalugdog with a nice serve. Underhand pass. Lerma Tubog. Tatawid ang bola. Kainglet. Adolfo. This time nakaiwas siya. Kay Kainglet. Pero sends that one into the net. Kailangan. Hawakan na dito. 
ng justice servers yung error na nakumit attack error ng firefighters. One more timeout remaining para kay Coach Bautista. They're still up by four despite the errors. And they're two points away from winning back-to-back -back sets. Overpass na ang ganda ng move ni Kainget. Itinawin ng bola. Yeah, that was an unexpected move kay Kainglet. Kaya hindi nabantayan ng floor defense yung kanilang zones. Five set points. Lady Firefighters. Mabigat dito. Magsaserve pa si Abeliana. Has a heavy hand. Abeliana with the up. Praferosa for the finish. Kinapos. You know, ang nangyayari kasi sa justice servers now, yung first ball, hindi maganda. Kaya hindi din maganda yung setup kay Pesebre. Pesebre always has to adjust. Nag-ano siya, nag-off speed hit na lang. Wala talagang full force. Boras with the serve. Let's see if they... Oh! Service ace, Alali Boras. And justice servers with 21 points. Surpassing their 20-point output in set number one. Gagamitan na ni Coach Bautista yung kanyang last time out. We'll listen in. Strict ang justice servers now sa kanilang errors. They cannot afford an error because that's going to be an easy point para sa firefighters. Pero for the justice servers, as you see, uh, Alarni Pesebre, yun pa rin problema nila. They're still in, in, back at square one. Yeah. Um, looking for others to help Alarni Pesebre. Pesebre, seven points. Everybody else, two points or less. So, yeah. langan pa rin ng tulong sa opensa. Whereas, nine points para kay Adolfo, eight points kay Abellana. No, he got four points from Praferosa, six points kay Madalugdog, and daming uh -oh. opensa na kukuha mula sa different lady firefighters. Speaking of, Adolfo, that is popped up. Tubo, gahabulin. Good okay. save. Tatawid ni Pesebre. Rally continues. Abenyana with a pass. Meantime, Praferosa. Tubo, good defense para sa justice servers. Joanne. Pass by Abenyana. Kaiglet, underhand set. Praferosa. Lobbing it over and committing an error. Yan. So, kailangan ng justice servers talagang kapitan to. Yep. Um, you know what? Uh, pwede pa eh. Kahit na ba oh, yeah. 24 ng BFP, kaya pa. Pwede pang humabol ang justice servers. So, BFP has to be careful as well. This is now a two-point run. Oh, nice defense there. Yeah, double contact yan para kang kainglit. This is now a three-point run para sa... Justice servers. Yes, that's a good call from the referee. Uh, meantime, there's a substitution. Eh, lalabas si Praferosa, Bentik, papasok. Only one set point remaining para sa Lady Firefighters. They had four set points kanina. Pero a three-point run dito ng Justice servers. And a chance to tie with another point. But they're not gonna have to do anything. Another service fall for the Justice Servers. It is outside of the serve by Boras. And Justice Servers will lose by two in set number two. You know, it was so fun to watch this game because uh -huh. both teams were really running after the ball. Tapos iniiba-iba nila yung kanilang mga atake. And it was, it was just exciting and fun. <laughs> <laughs> right now, Justice Servers uh, in, a, in a rough position. They're down two sets to nothing. As you look at the highlights, ang ating uh, last set. Lady Firefighters led by as many as five points. Preferosa starting in set number two, and she was a good factor offensively. Again, and many Lady Firefighters contributing offensively para sa BFP, and they're up two sets to nothing contra sa Judiciary going to set number three.
tayo sa Paco Arena with the Lady Firefighters winning their second straight set, uh, one by two points as you look at the stats natin. Yeah, you know, this was a longer set, 28 minutes, kasi mas madaming rallies. Yep. Um, you know what, ang daming gumawa sa firefighters. Andiyan si Madalogdog, si Abeliana, si Proferosa, si Adolfo. Ang ganda rin, you know, uh, ang lakas nung team ng BFP because okay yung dalawa nilang setters. That's right. Si Homilio at saka of course si Kainglet. So you can imagine no, na madami silang hokus-pokus, magic <laughs> na pwedeng gawin because ang dami nilang ingredients also na pwedeng gamitin. So, ito naman ang Justice Servers. They were just, their energy level was just down in that second set. Especially nung nagkaroon na ng run ang, ano, ang firefighters. And that's why you would hear them always saying na, oh, ano, smile. O kaya, ano, uh, yung shoulders kailangan hindi nakaslump. Because malaking bagay yun eh, pag yung energy level mo bagsak. Well, adjustments for both coaches to start Itong set number three as um, Yuboko will be in the starting lineup para sa Justice Servers. Samantala, uh, Tony Diaz in the starting lineup for Coach Bautista and the Lady Firefighters. And that serve is outside. Uh, the, the Justice Servers starting off on the wrong foot with a three point given up. Alam mo, maybe next time yung server sa gitna na lang, <laughs> tumayo. Parati kasi dun sa bandang yun, nag-out yung ball eh. Underhand pass para kay Dolorosa. Pesebre, papalo. Abeliana keeping it alive. Adolfo, itatawid ang bola. Dolorosa once again. This time, Nuboras into the net. Back-to-back -back errors to start off set number three para sa Justice Servers. One of the four imports ng uh, Koponang BFP, Tony Diaz with a serve. De La Rosa, Pesebre. Could have been outside, pero kinuha, pass. Yuboko with a hard hit. And that one is a uh, net violation. Okay, yeah. so uh, when you want to be aggressive at the net, yun yung ano, eh, risk mo eh, when you hit that net. So first point para sa Justice Servers off an error by Lady Firefighters and a service ace again para kay Aleli Boras. Again, the target is the libero, si Magpantay. Boras, great serving since late in the second set. Kung saan siya ang nakapagpahabol para sa Justice Servers. Magpantay, a bad pass. Here's Diaz. And it's in! Yes, it was a long hit, pero pasok na pasok. So, Navy Firefighters, labang ulit na isa, three serving two. Fosmilio with a serve. Pesebre. Malani, Pesebre. Yeah, you know, Pesebre, Wala siyang takot kahit na merong blocker. Maganda rin yung coverage na itaas naman ni Abeliana. Wala lang nag-follow through. Eight points para kay Pesebre. But she is the only player with four or more points para sa Justice Service. That serve picked Good up by Tias. Sumalinog. Tinawid ang bola. Dolorosa na Pesebre again. Got it. Ganda ng palo ni Pesebre. Akala mo, eh, she was gonna go forward or cross court. Kailang linihis niya yung, ano, yung tira niya. Kinagulat yung uh, firefighter defender. Back-to-back -back points para kay Elarni Pesebre. Now with nine. Served by Dolorosa. Just the servers up by one. Yuboko inangat ang bola. Yuboko will toss it over. Diaz with the receive. So Marino pushes. Gallo inangat. Here's De La Rosa sets it to Pesebre. Three straight points. Mula kay Pesebre. She is now in double digits with 10. And you like the energy level of the justice servers. Diba? When they you know, when they succeed in their attack, nagsa-celebrate sila. Nakaka-intimidate din yun eh, pag ikaw yung kalaban. 
Early two-point lead para sa Justice Servers. Five serving three. That service outside. There are a few shots that could have gone outside. Uh, kinukuha lahat itong uh, Lady Firefighters. With that one, they let it go. One-point game. Yuboko with the receive. Chance ball para sa Lady Firefighters. Osbillo sa gitna. Adolfo with a hit. Now and into the net para kay Pesebre. Maybe getting a little tired already. Yeah. Kasi sa kanya lahat eh, yung, uh, yung attacks. Uh, Adolfo, serving. Two-point run para sa Lady Firefighters. Good pass. Yeah. Pesebre. Block, inangat ni Mahmagun. Uh, but not enough for a second touch. Si Pesebre, even if merong dalawang blockers sa kanya, nahahanap niya yung gap in between the blockers, earning their team a point. 11 para kay Pesebre. No aces yet. She has four errors in the game so far. Lamang ng isa. Just the servers. Josmillo goes to Sumalino. Cross court hit is good. Nice hit there by Sumalino. Kapag walang blocker for that, mahirap talaga. Mahirap uh, iangat ng floor defense yun. Ang bilis kasi. At saka malakas. Six all. Set number three. Jen Sumalino with two points. De La Rosa in and out. Dada Yuboko will send it outside. Substitution. Uh, Scalio will come out. Lerma Tubog. Babalik. Lamang ng isa. Ang Lady Firefighters. Nice serve. Inangat ni Pesebre. Dolorosa passes. Pesebre. Ooh! That was an easy over. Pero malit yung dig coming from Sumalido. So, kailangan talaga ang aggressiveness ang iangat ng, ano, ng justice servers dito. Energy level nila mataas. Continue in the communication inside the court. Para Se pati yung kakampi mo na encourage. That's right. Seven all. Set number three. Diaz cross court Boras with a pass. Yuboko off speed. Good up. Osmillo. Powerful hit by Abellana. Good Super up. Big. Para kay Dolorosa. Osmillo. They go to the middle. Mamangun with a tip. Pesebre. Tato with the bola. Osmillo. They go to Diaz with a push. Yuboko again. Playing great defense. Para sa Justice Servers. Yuboko with a hit and the point. Target there for you, Boko. Ganda ng basa niya sa floor defense na firefighters. Nobody was in zone one. Kaya yun ang tinarget. First point para kay Yuboko. Putting the justice servers on top by one. Let's go to Dana de Guzman. Eric and Chiki, si Arnie Pesebre ay patuloy na pumupuntos para sa judiciary. At hindi nga bumababa sa double digit ang kanyang game. Kanina nga nung tinanong ko siya, paano siya hindi napapagod at ano ang kanyang ginagawa para magpakondisyon? Biro niya ay ang paglalaba. Dahil daw dito ay lumalakas ang kanyang braso. Kidding aside, let's see how the judiciary justice servers will help her to score points for this set. Balik sa guys. Thank you, Dana. 12 points na para kay Arnie Pesebre. Alam mo, pwede, di ba? Pag naglalaba ka, lalakas talaga braso ko doon. <laughs> uh, right now, ako si Coach Dino. I'll buy her a washing machine. Dahil <laughs> you need all her strength sa game na to. They need to win the next three sets para makabawi. Bad pass by Sumalino. And the run continues. This is three straight points para sa Justice Servers. They're up 10-7. Ano mong ginagawa ng Justice Servers? Placement lang talaga eh. Wala naman talagang strong hits there eh. Isipan natin ng maayos. Huwag natin pahirapan yung setter. Kawawa naman. Ha? Ang second ball, iangat. Ay, ang first ball, angat nyo naman. Nagmamadali kasi kayo mag-net. Okay. Buwasan natin yung net, please. Ha? Kaya yan, kaya yan. Okay. Kaya yan. Isang receipt. Kaya isang kill. One stop tayo, one stop tayo. Isang receipt. Hindi mo. Hindi mo. Hindi mo. Hindi mo. Hindi mo.
Palermo kung sakasakali. Pag siya tumalon, alala yung likod. Tutulang at tutulang kayo sa kaliwa. Nakikita niyo lang, walang tao sa kaliwa. Kaya tutulong ng kaliwa yan. Okay? O, yung tao sa likod, ha? Ito na, ito na, ito na. Ito na, ito na. Pantay lang, pantay lang mga otensa. Sige, sige, sige. Justice! Service! Sabi nga ni Coach, eh, no, walang, walang tao sa kaliwa. So, that's pertaining to zones 1 and 2. So, kailangan dun nila ita-target. Kasi walang bantay. So, I have to know for BFP naman, kailangan alam nila yung zones nila, how to cover their zones para walang butas. Jen Yabut, a lot of top spins sa serve na yan. Abeliana. Good save, but not enough to send it over. Mula kay Dada Yuboko. And our three-point run ends para sa Justice Servers. It's a two-point game. Nine points para kay Abeliana. Already has one ace. Ooh, inside. Right Two aces. Yeah. Dapat talaga, ano, eh, susundan mo yung bola hanggat sa you step on the line and then if it's shoulders up, yun na, ano na yun, outside na talaga yun. Fire Officer 2, Gang Abellana. Almost another one. De La Rosa inangat. Pesebre with an underhand pass. Magpantay with a good pass. Here's Diaz attacking. Pesebre with a dig. Boras. Got it. Ganda ng mga tira ng justice servers eh. Again, not so much power in it, but very ano eh, calculated, well calculated hits. Nahanap yung mga gaps, nahanap yung mga butas. Bangun with the receive. Ito si Diaz again. Dolorosa. Yuboko with a hit. Inangat ni Abeliana. Cosmillo. Mamangun sa gitna. Got it. Si Osmilio, no, pinapa-under niya si Mamangon sa gitna. Pero yun na yun dahil serve na siya ngayon. Mamangon with one point. That was her first one. Boras. Good pass, Abeliana. And Adolfo with a hit. Nice dig para kay Pesebre. Pesebre digs, Pesebre attacks. Osmillo to Diaz, looking for point number two, and it's not there. But you still like what Osmillo's doing. Iniikot-ikot niya yung bola. Yeah. Para hindi sa isang attacker lang nanggagaling yung attack. It will keep the justice servers guessing saan ba manggagaling at sino ba babantayan. Yuboko, isang puntos pa lang na itatala so far. Good help. Pass by Adolfo. Inangat ni Diaz. A high pass. And a short pass by Pesebre. And that will be the error. Oh, Pesebre. Yeah. As good as an attacker, she is an uh, iffy passer. <laughs> you know, kasi, pag, yun yung tinitip sa amin ng mga coaches, eh, no? Pag halimbawa, easy ball, taasan mo. <laughs> kasi, yung gravity niya is going to help you make that ano, ball even hard, kahit na easy ball lang yung ano. Another short pass. Wala kay Pesebre. What a diving dig para kay Abeliana. Tatawid ni Adolfo. Chance ball. Yuboko with the pass. Uh, there's De La Rosa. Pesebre attack. Blocked up top by Adolfo. Pesebre tries again. Off the block this time. Alay ni Pesebre. Trece ang naitatala in the game. Pesebre going for, you know, challenging the blocker because alam niyang kakatalun lang ni Adolfo. So, malamang sa malamang, hindi pa siya nakakahinga. Tatalun na naman siya. So, that was a smart move by Pesebre. Quietly, Aleli Boras with six points already. So, Malinog with the pass. Dolorosa, of course, not a surprise. Pesebre ang atake para sa Justice Servers. It's been all Pesebre here today. Ay, nice hit! Matala ang daming uh, different offensive players para sa Justice I mean, that's uh, Lady Firefighters. It's yeah. Adolfo with a hit there. Oh, ganda ng bawi agad ni Adolfo, no? And you like that about Osmilio, giving her teammate a chance again to score para yung confidence level hindi bumaba. One-point game, Osmilio with a serve. Ooh! 
Agawan, Yuboko, and Yabut, and the lead of the Jesu servers is gone. We're tied at 13. Oh, because if your teammate says mine first, sa kanya na, wag mo nang itry, ano, kunin pa. Di ba pwedeng sabihin niya mine, sabihin mo rin mine. Tapos sabihin mo ulit mine, gano'n, talagang palakasan ng process. Looking for the lead, nice serve, overpass. Pesebre, good coverage. Pesebre will hit it. Abellana, Hosmilia will set it up. Abellana, Yuboko. Yuboko, a-atake. Got it! Ito naman, ang gagawan, magpantay and Hosmilio. Ganda ng target ni Yuboko. And you know, halos hindi natin nababanggit yung name niya, no? Kaya hindi siya nakaka-attack for the Justice servers, but that was a good hit from her. Yuboko only appeared in the third set, didn't play in the first two. Right now, isang puntos kalabangan ni Dolorosa and the rest of the Justice Servers, 14-13. Avellana passes, Josmillo, nasa gitna ang bola, Adolfo with the push. Tubog to Pesebre. Avellana sets it all the way out. Sumalino, the up by Dolorosa, Pesebre will set, Angeles will hit. Tough get para kay Josmillo, Avellana sends it over, Dolorosa with a short pass, Pesebre... That's going to be outside. <laughs> Good rally. May dito mo, no, na kahit na sabay mag-mine. Ano eh, na, they learned from their mistakes and they're able to give way para dun sa kakampi nila na uh, unang nagsabi ng mine and that created or, you know, an organized play. Eight errors ulit, Justice Servers, here in the third set. So that's eight of the 14 wow. points na Lady Firefighters Galing sa errors and justice servers. And you know, speaking of errors, Mamangon uh, touching the net that time. Mamangon trying to be aggressive at the net. Yun lang, uh, sumapit lang siya. Kailangan lang ma-avoid niya talaga yung mga unforced errors na yun. Pass by Diaz. Sumalinog, cross-court. Pasebre nag-angat. Angeles with a hit. Adolfo passes. Husminio nasa gitna. Mamangon, that is outside. Ganda ng basa ni Pesebre. She was going to receive that ball, pero last minute, she changed her mind kasi alam niya, medyo nasa dulo na siya, taas pa rin ng bola, so she let that ball go. Smart two, move. Two-point lead para sa Justice Servers as we check in once again with Dana de Guzman. Eric and Chiki playing setter for the BFP as of the moment is Bansos Milio who originated from Batangas. Dati raw ay isa siyang spiker but dahil sa kanyang height noong college siya daw ay kinonvert into setter. Ayon sa kanya, mas malaki daw ang responsibility niya ngayon as a setter dahil siya ang magiging utak at magbibigay buhay sa team. As a setter, sisikapin daw niya na pagandahin lahat ng set na yung magbibigay niya sa teammates niya at of course, bigyan ng kumpiyansa ang kanyang mga spikers. Ngayon, tingnan natin kung ito na nga ba ang tung unang magiging panalo ng BFP. Balik uh, sa inyo. Sa kapalo nito ni Abellana. Mukha nga dahil ito. We're tied at 16. Abellana, back-to-back points dahil sa setting ni Osmillo. Yeah. And you know, talagang yung confidence level ng kakampi mo, aakit yan pag maganda yung mga sets na binibigay mo because wala silang choice. Nakakapunto sila. Great serving, oh. Sana. Back to back, great serves yun sa Malinog. Before that one, uh, came up very short. So, lalamang ulit ang uh, Justice Servers by one point, 17-16. Very close, third set. Oh, kailangan kasi ng Justice Servers makuha tong set na to to stay in the game. Again, para sa mga kabubukas lang ng mga TV sets or ka-fire ka up lang ng inyong mga YouTube or Facebook apps, ang Justice Servers back to back wins. Samantalang itong... Uh, Lady Firefighters looking for their first win to Season 2. And a two-point run for the Justice Servers. They're up again by two. And yun yung sinasabi nga ni Coach Dino, yung left side ng BFP butas. So doon nila dapat dalin yung bola nila. Mamangon will sit down and Bentik papasok. Angeles serving. Ooh. That one barely made it. Yeah. Abellana with a receive. Ito si Diaz. Oh! Diaz struggling today. Only one point. Uh, her arm was just a little low. That's why the ball hit the net. Three-point lead. Just the servers. Matches their biggest lead of the set. Si Coach Bautista, hindi pa tatawag ng timeout. 
They still have... Actually, I think they've used up their timeouts. We'll check that later. Diaz Samantana, underhand pass, chance ball for the Justice Servers. Boras with a push, blocked by Abellana. Boras will try again. Oh, that big, no good. Biggest lead at four points, Justice Servers. Good hit there by Boras. Going again, targeting the left zone. And easy point for them. Firefighters, yung sipag. That's why si uh, Coach Franz kept reiterating, sipag, sipag, sipag sa court. Kulang na yung habol nila eh, sa bola. So ito naman, nagtitake advantage ng justice servers. You know, and rightly so, because they want to get this set. Well, one more timeout remaining para dito sa justice, or sa uh, lady firefighters. Justice servers, still two timeouts remaining. Four-point game, Mosbillo to Abellana. Pesebre, Yuboko to Boras. I got it. Palakay ng palakay. This is now the biggest lead at five points para sa Justice Servers. Four points away from winning their first set. Oh, ang laki ng kumpiyansa ni Yuboko kay Boras kaya sa kanya at sa kanya binibigay yung bola. And, uh, you know, she doesn't disappoint. Boras with eight points. Diaz finally stops the run. Very important side out para dito sa Lady Firefighters. Abellana with 12 points. One of two players in double digits. Adolfo with 10. Yuboko. Tubog with a push. Josmilio on first touch. Bentik passes to Diaz with a left hand. Boras again. Abellana pops it up. Bentik mula sa gitna. Good pass. Oh, but the second touch, Yuboko. Uh, so it's two straight points para sa Lady Firefighters. Oh, nagkabanggaan kasi si Yuboko tsaka si Tubog. Kaya uh, the set was went wide para kay Boras. Here we go. It's a three-point game. Good pass by Pesebre. Here comes Boras. That is outside. No block touch. Oh, parang hindi ko nakita yung fingers umangat sa net eh, no? <laughs> sa block. A three-point run para sa Lady Firefighters from down five. They are now two points down. Abellana with her game face on. Floater serve. Tough get. That's going to be into the antenna para kay Pesebre. Oh. A five-point lead ng Justice Servers. Down to one. Tatawag ng unang timeout dito si Coach Dino. We will listen in to Judiciary. Again, again, walang three points dito. So, kailangan yung tiyagain. Kailangan tiyagain. Isa-isa tayo, isa-isa. Laruin nyo, enjoyin nyo to. Enjoyin nyo to, ate na to da, ate na to. Okay. Sino? Right? 
Let's go. Kaya, ang gagaling yung kaya niyan. Justice! Service! Of the team captain, no? si Inting. Talagang the way that she encourages her team. Parang pang ikaw yung player, aba, hindi ako magkakamali inside the court for you. Di ba? Ganun yun eh. Ganun yung dating. And good reminders from Coach Dino. Sabi nga niya, Dap dapat full ang focus. Be determined to win. No more timeouts remaining pala. Just an update. No more timeouts remaining for uh, firefighters. Meantime, just the servers. One timeout remaining. Chance ball dito. Josmilia will set it up. They got a big kick from the middle. And it's a five-point run for the Lady Firefighters to tie the game at 21. And you know the connection between Josmilia and Benting yeah. nandun eh. Nagtinginan lang sila eh. Alam na nila kung anong gagawin. Itong uh, Justice Servers right now stunned. Abellana with another short serve. Yuboko to Boras. Picked up by Abellana. Overpassed. Boras was right there. Inangat ni Sumalino. Here comes Diaz on the attack. Diaz sending it outside. Diaz really struggling today. Yeah. Oh, so mga, many errors. Yeah, yung mga attacks niya, no? Uh, they go wide or long. So, that stops the five-point run ng Lady Firefighters. Laban ng isa. And just the servers, a very important lead. That's gonna be short for Norma Tubog. It almost trickled over. So, take isang errors. Parehong kapunan. Mantana, Yuboko will sit down. So another import, papasok si Joanne para dito sa judiciary. All right, we're tied at 22. Big serve coming up. Para kay Angela Bentik, who has five points in the game. She has an ace already. Tough pass. Boras sent it over. Abellana, Josmillo will set it. A Adolfo nice. with a beautiful little deceptive oh, oh. run. Sobrang deceptive. Nung umatras na eh, yung floor defense and justice servers because they thought malakas yung titirahin ni Adolfo. And then, nakita ni Adolfo, uy, naka-atras yung defense. Uy, hulog ka na lang. Great ano, dun, adjustment. One point lead. For the Lady Firefighters, another good serve will be an ace. No, great adjustment. Boras keeping it alive. Osmillo. Adolfo got it. And two match points para sa BFP after being down by five. And they are now a point away from winning their first match of season two. Sabi nga ni Coach Franz kanina, di ba? Atin na to dapat, ha? Kailangan manalo na tayo. Sabi nga. Huwag niyo na paabutin sa set for baka mapagod pa tayo. Alright, uh, last time out na to. Uh, might as well use it para kay Coach Dina will listen to judiciary. Kailangan pumasok. Sino coach? Sino nasa loob ngayon? Labas mo to. Si... Kunin mo yung dos. Kunin yung dos. Lisa. Sikat. 17. Kunin mo 17. Darn, ikaw mag alarm, di ba? Ikaw mag-set. Okay? Ang gagawa eh. Oh, let's go. Double tap tayo. Okay. Kapit pa. Tingnan nyo. Kami, Nicole, mapapanalo nito. Oo. Let's go, Justice! 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 Waiting for both teams. And some adjustments got going to Coach Dino as well. Uh, Resio will be checking in for the first time along with Attorney Inting. So, and I didn't see Attorney Inting in the huddle. Kami mo kung panalo yan. Tira natin, tira natin. Sabi ko piyan sa ganun, ano? Oo. All right, here we go. Um, ang setter dito, si Lerma Tubog, we, we heard the. Uh, Coach Dino saying, "Where uh, am I set dito?" So let's see if she can get the second touch. If there's a good pass, number one, that's important. All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Final point needed para sa Lady Firefighters. Can they get it? The serve by Bentik. Good pass. There's Tubog trying to set it up. Overpass. Oh, and a net touch. 
Dalawa nag-agawa, Adolfo and Diaz. So one match point given up. There's one more para dito sa Lady Firefighters. Si Boko babalik, uh, lalabas dito si Joanne. So they're gonna serve on Justice Servers. Lady Firefighters, they need a good receive. Yes. That's all they need. And a good pass because Hosmilio has been setting very well today. Yes. Dada Yuboko. Oh! That's it. That's it! Just like set number two, a service fault gave up the set para sa Justice Servers. And another service fault here gave up the match for Judiciary. As BFP, they get their first win of the UVL Season 2. And look at the happiness of the Lady Firefighters. Yeah, you know what? The um, BFP Firefighters, they really came out wanting to win from the first set to the yep. last set. Their energy was up. They were communicating inside the court. Ang ganda ng distribution ng bola para sa iba-ibang attackers. It was so hard to get the player of the game. But wow, Abeliana, she did a good job. Front row, back row. Uh, she was the one who set the momentum for the team. All right. So I think uh, Abeliana is there now. All right. Uh, our best player, uh, top scorer, obviously, Abeliana right now. Kasama siya ni Dana de Guzman. Dana? Eric and Chiki, here with me is Gang Abeliana, our player of the game. Gang, how does it feel to get your first win of the season? Siyempre po, ano, masayang, 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 masayang. Kaya yun po. Ayan, so, <laughs> sobrang saya nga ng team ninyo. At kitang-kita natin, medyo naging down kayo nung third set. Pero nahabol natin, no? Ano yung naging key factor na sinabi ni coach sa inyo nung timeout na yun para ma-regain nyo yung confidence pabalik? Ano po, yung confidence namin sa set isa, tsaka sa team na din, tapos ano, yung eagerness namin na manalo po. Congratulations again. Meron ka bang mga gustong batiin at pasalamatan? Meron po. At uh, saka pwede po ba magbisaya? Oh, pwedeng pwede. Ano po, uh, salamat. Sa, sa, thank you po sa aming panam... Sa aming pa <laughs> thank you Lord sa aming pinakaunang panalo. At saka thank you po sa suporta ng aming ema ng Bureau for Protection, si Fire Director Louis Espuracan, sir. Command group and coaching coaches and training staff at sa aming mga officers, ma'am, si ma'am Abakin, si ma'am Silagan, ma'am Imbalzado, ma'am Gulod, and attorney Pearl of SM. Sa mga officers din, si Sir, si Sir Angot, si ma'am Angot, si Sir Atienza, Sir Tanawan, Sir Kablayan, Sir Tagyam, Sir Manaig, Sir Engineer Miranda, tsaka sa BMW Owners Society of Safe Riders, Barangay Bagumbay, at sa lahat ng kasamaan ka sa region at sa buong ansya ng Bureau of Fire Protection. At sa tanan nga mga Bisaya nga nagtanaw sa mua. Sana ay gamay! Nyor! Okay, Rakadiya! Kay Summer, kay Dilan, sa mga bata, kay Ma'am Lois! Sa palaging sumusuporta sa amin, tsaka kay Babing. Hi, Babing! At hindi ko na maasa. Thank you po. Okay, thank you, Gang. And once again, our player of the game, Gang Abeliana, back to our panel. Dana, uh, congratulations. Abeliana and the rest of the Lady Firefighters, what a game. And uh, again, confirmation of the three-set win. Yeah, you know, the third set was the longest at 30 minutes, and it was the, you know, tied nga with the second set, no? 25-23. Parehong, ano eh, pareho talagang um, nag-beef up sila sa kanilang floor defense, net defense. May kita natin dito yung attack points. Uh, mas madami sa judiciary, pero mas konti yung errors ng uh, BFP. Sa blocks, um, Nobody really scored their service aces, pareho lang. So, you know, itong errors, ang laki-laki-laki yeah. bagay niyan eh, yung mga net touch na yan. So, kung naiwasan lang yan, di ba, uh, things could have turned. But ito, ito na ang match statistics natin. Uh, 37 attack points for BFP. They had better first balls. Uh, the, the setters didn't really have a difficult time distributing the sets. They have one uh, good block point and seven aces. Yun yun yung talagang binabantayan sa ano, eh, BFP, yung mga aces nila. And, uh, you know, their errors are higher, but the attack points are higher. And with this three-set win, um, Lady Firefighters will get their first win, snapping their 
three game losing streak sa Mantana. And that win also will snap the two game winning streak ng uh, Judiciary. As you look at the next two games that's coming up uh, AFP taking on SSS and Senado contra sa PNP. Two more games uh, remaining in your triple header ngayong Sunday. Thank you to uh, my partner, uh, Chiki Pablo. Uh, in the meantime, we'll take a quick break and come back with more action. This is uh, UVL right here on UNTV.
believe that the Paco Arena game day continues. And we are now in match number 16 of the eliminations round of the UVL season two. Win for sports and win for charity. This is a match between the AFP Lady Gunners. And the SSS Pension Protectors! Magandang araw po, and we're coming back dito sa Paco Arena for the second game of our triple header. Pagkatapos manalo kanina ng uh, BFP, yung kanilang unang panalo, binigyan ng uh, first loss after two straight games, two straight wins ang judiciary. Eto po tayo, defending champions, AFP Lady Gunners, on a three-game winning streak, taking on the SSS Pension Protectors na galing sa dalawang sunod na talo. Hi everybody, thank you for watching us on UNTV and the UNTV News and Rescue channel on Facebook and YouTube, Eric Dupan, kasama si Rina Villamar Camara and Courtside, we're going to be joined. Our uh, Courtside reporter is Dana de Guzman. Our game correspondent is Ira Pablo. A big game coming up, a big test para sa SSS, Rina, because they are trying to bounce back after uh, two straight losses, but it's going to be against a tough opponent. That's right. Itong kuponan ng uh, AFP at saka SSS, we're expecting not only a three sets here, <laughs> but expect a long game That's here. That's right. Um, this is the first game that uh, Toy Pachari, Samuang Pachari, will be back in action, no? Dahil dalawang games din siyang hindi nawa kapaglaro para sa right. kuponan ng SSS. And uh, the AFP, technically, they're still on top of the team standings right now. Itong kuponan ng SSS, right. they're in the middle of the Technically, itong AFP, actually, hindi pa natalo in a, in a real game. It was a Tama. technicality yung kanilang unang talo against PNP as we take a look at the the result of our first game today. Yes, it's the first win of the BFP Lady Firef Firefighters. No, kanina napanood ko yung inyong game with uh, JK Pablo kanina. Three straight sets pa ito in a total of uh, 75 to uh, 66 compared to the judiciary. Kasi dito, maganda, no? Parang similar lang yung uh, pag-atake nila when it comes to the defense. Parang similar lang din sila. Pero nagkatalo lang talaga dun sa errors na ibinigay ng uh, judiciary, especially on the servers, uh, service errors rather, no? At ang kanilang uh, player of the game is Gang Abeliana with uh, 12 points, 10 attacks, and uh, 2 aces. So talagang nag-celebrate dito ang kuponan ng BFP dahil meron na silang one win dun That's sa kanilang right. record. And sobrang happy nga si Gang Abeliana kanina. Hindi naman lamang kung magbibisaya o magtatagalog nung in-interview natin siya. <laughs> but she's so happy and we're very happy for her as well as nakikita nyo dyan. They are already uh, have a notch sa winning column na DFA naghahanap ng kanilang unang panalo. That's right. Ito naman, no? Uh, Talo-talo naman dun sa ating uh, first spot. Itong kupanan ng AFP Senate siya ako. Malik, dahil pareho silang tatlong kupanan na merong three win and one loss record. At para naman dun sa PNP, meron silang isang talo dito. Uh, judiciary, tatlo na yung talo nila pagkatapos silang matalo kanina. And uh, the SSS, they had uh, one win in uh, this uh, UVL Season 2. But I know they have so much to prove pa dito sa ating uh, season na ito. Dahil marami silang mag gagaling na players. That's right. DFA still have to win a game here. 
All right, uh, puntahan natin itong last game ng ating defending champions. They are coming off a three-set win contra sa Comelec. Yes, itong uh, AFP siya ka Comelec. No? We all know that Comelec is really a hard team to beat. No? Pero this is a good thing because this is a first time para sa kupuna ng AFP team na manalo in three straight sets. Uh -huh. Kasi halos lahat ng laban nila, four hanggang five sets yan natatapos. It was really the blocks and the aces that really silenced the suffragettes, especially on the third set. Nakita mo yung disparity, no? 25 is to 13, especially on uh, that third set. At itong si Yen Olores talaga, yung kanila mga imports talaga yung nagdala para sa kanila. Uh -huh. Maganda yung ball distribution ni Yen Olores para dun sa lahat ng players ng AFP. Yari Yonko, you know, she has 16 points on that ball game, but the first set alone, she has 9 points na agad. So, maganda yung performance ng AFP, kaya 3 straight sets nilang nakuha itong larong ito. Samantala, SSS naman, you, we mentioned already they're coming off two straight losses after winning their very first game. Yes, kung mapapansin nyo dun sa laro ng uh, SSS tsaka Judiciary, halos hindi nagkakalayo no, yung kanilang mga attack points, block points, and aces points. But you know, the big differentiator there, yung kanilang mga serve, yung mga kanilang mga errors, no, especially for the SSS side. Kaya sila natalo din on uh, that game no, in uh, three or four sets. no, Three sets, rather. So, parang naging... Um, Malaking factor para sa kanila yung mga errors nila, kaya hindi nila nakuha yung makabangon sila dun sa mga games nila. But of course, with the help of uh, yung kanilang mga imports right. dito, they also have the middle blocker itong si Jamie Penny who contributed 14 points para sa kanilang kupunan. At uh, Larni Pesebre was the best player of that ball game with uh, 24 points. So malaking bagay that the regular players are also showing up and stepping up for the SSS in right. that game. Uh, they gave up almost a set and a half dito sa kanilang mga errors lang. And then yung sabi mo nga, yung pagbalik ni Sang Wang, uh, a big addition of course para sa SSS in order to get back on the winning track. The development dito, Coach Miremko will not be uh, head coaching para dito sa uh, AFP uh, for development. Development naman para sa SSS. Uh, let's watch this. Napagandahan naman namin yung sa ensayo, yung plano, maayos naman yung training namin. Pero tingin ko kasi doon dahil new team, bagong expose sila sa malaking liga. So parang binububan nila yung confidence nila at saka yung gelling nila na pag uh, nakaharap, nakaharap na sa crowd, pag uh, na under pressure na, yun yung tingin namin nakulang pa. Pero... Sa skills, sa skills, tiwala naman ako sa kanila eh. Hindi naman sila under skills or ano, over age, hindi din naman. Sa exposure lang, matututunan pa naman nila yun throughout the uh, season. Totoo naman na bumaba yung performance nung nawala si Pitoy kasi kailangan umalis ni Pitoy for one week. Pero hindi yun basis dapat eh. Kasi team ko, hindi naman to one-man team. Dami namin sa team, so dapat hindi, hindi lang kami nakapokus sa isang tao. Ang ginawa lang namin is winners namin yung games, past games nila. Paano nila hinahandle yung mga situations, different situations tulad nung mga past game nila. Natatalo din naman sila. Hindi naman sila yung perfect team na parang talagang unbeatable. Pero may, may mga butas din sila. Pero yun nga, dahil new team to, Na-expect namin ma kung matalo manalo, panalo pa rin kami for the experience. Yung nakababantayan, wala kasi, nire-respect namin sila lahat. So, lahat ng papalo, lahat ng bigyan ng setter, nire-respect namin na babantayan namin sila lahat. Hindi pwedeng isang tao lang kasi anim yan eh, anim na tao yan. Ah, uh, yun, tiwala lang tayo sa skills natin, tsaka sa panagyan sa iyo. Sama-sama namin, i-work out lahat yan. Uh, pension protectors looking to snap a two-game losing streak and in the process snap the three-game winning streak nitong Lady Gunners. We're gonna send it courtside para kailangan natin lineup ng parehong kapodan.
Ladies and gentlemen, let us now meet our national referees for this match. Ryan, first referee, Ryan Vincent Corpus, national referee. Second referee, Elmel Ongkoy, national referee. And now let's meet the starters first for the AFP Lady Gunners. Starting off with the team captain wearing jersey number six, Yen Olores. Wearing jersey number one, Major Kair Hacken. Wearing jersey number two, First Lieutenant Kijoy Betinho. Wearing jersey number eight, Staff Sergeant Yang Smarifoske. Wearing jersey number 11, May Maduli. And Libero wearing jersey number 10, Rage De Gia. And wearing jersey number 4, Sergeant Ia Yonko. And now let's meet the starters for the SSS Pension Protectors. Wearing jersey number 4, Pao Sia. Wearing jersey number 9, Jean Reforma. Wearing jersey number 12, Vera Guillerma. Wearing jersey number 14, Fitoy Saeng Muang. Wearing jersey number 15, Jan Jan Samosino. Wearing jersey number 17, Arby Camacho. And liberal wearing jersey number 5, Rossell Salarda. UBL fans, let's get ready to serve, spike, and set with the AFP Lady Gunners and the SSS Pension Protectors. This is the UBL Win in Sports and Win for Charity. And we're back here at Paco Arena as you look at the team on your left the, with a white uniform. That is the Lady Gunners and that is your starting lineup. A very formidable six. Yari Yonko leading the way para sa kupuna na ito. And they are right now undefeated, at least in points. But they have lost their first game by a technicality. In the meantime, itong SSS Pension Protectors, I'm sure they're glad to have number 14 back. Kapito Isang Wang uh, only played in one game, their opening game, but she missed the last two. Uh, she will be a big help today. Uh, I'm expecting Vera Megillema to be giving a lot to her in this match to finally snap their two-game losing streak. And the serve from Olores sets us off. Not a good pass there. There's going to be a chance ball going to the Lady Gunners. Madulid with the pass. Olores to Yari Yonko. Why not? Guillema sets it up. Here's Fitoy with her first touch. Madulid with a dig. Marifosque popping it up. Ito naman ang pension protector sa atake. Sangwang from the middle. Yes! Nice comeback coming from uh, Sangwang. Coming from a uh, two-week break in Hong Kong. Diba? So, nagpakilala na siya. Nagbabalik na yeah. ako going into this game. Yeah, she is very fresh after missing the last two games. SSS on the board first. Yari Yonko. Guillema. And this time goes to Reforma. Uh, Yari Yonko again getting the bulk of the touches by the Lady Gunners. Good attack coming from uh, Yari Yonko. On that sequence. Still great form. Rina para oh, Yari oh. Yonko. No, really stayed fit uh, despite missing a lot of seasons. Tsaka I think pag sundalo ha, kailangan talaga yung oh, oh. magiging fit is number one priority para sa kanila. Hindi sila nawawala dun sa kanila mga training. That's talaga. right. Chance ball para sa Lady Gunners. Olores goes to Madulid with the tip. Reforma, not a good pass. Another chance ball. Olores gets the first touch. The toss all the way to the back row by Madulid. Inangat. And Sang Muang, this is the third chance ball para sa Lady Gunners. Olores, Madulid. And that'll do it. Not a good receive coming from the SSS that time around. <laughs> Thank you. 
So this is back-to-back -back points para sa Lady Gunners. Lamang na sila dito. They have scored two straight points. Another chance ball. Hindi maka-open sa arena itong uh, yes. pension protectors right now. Captain Hake with a hit. I beg your pardon, that's Major Hake. A tip. And finally, a side out para dito sa pension protectors. But this time around, it was just the drop coming from uh, Pachari, no? Dun sa kanilang middle area that was not able. Na hindi sila nakaresponde on like, that ball. Concern dito para kay Coach Eugenio as the team has not been unable to really attack offensively. Mm -hmm. Ito sa ating opening set. Naaral San Sebastian, Vira May Guillema with a nice serve. Baka they're also adjusting pa, no? Uh, with the, the first time to be able to... Uh, go up against the AFPS. That's true. Oh, oh. Nangangapa pa sila, di ba? Meantime, Pitoy with a hit. A two-point run naman para dito sa pension protectors as they retake the lead. Lamang dito ng isa ang SSS 3-2 opening set. Another good serve para kay Guillema. Yari Yonko mula sa back row that is outside. That was too strong coming from Yonko that time around. Right idea, but too strong. Yari Yonko coming off a double-digit performance. We talked about her during our pre-game. Well, it's 16, yeah, 16 points, ano? Yes. Nine points alone in that uh, first set last time. This is now a four-point run for the pension protectors. Make it five now. Five. They were down 2-1. And now they're up 5-2. Pariforske will set it. Madulid, a-atake. Chance ball again. Madulid, second hit. Sangwan. Pariforske popping it up. Olores, Yarionko from the back row. Guillema, Reforma, Papalo. Rifoske with the up, long rally going on. Madulid, Guillema with the pass. Masing it na, si Pitoy. And the run continues for the pension protectors. Once again, Pito, I think this is the third time, no? Na ginawa ito ni Pitoy on that uh, area lagi, no? Nararattle dito ang AFP when she does it. Just Why? dropping that ball. That's right. Sang Wang with four of the six points. Ng pension protectors, but that service out para kay Guillema. And an easy point here para sa Lady Gunners. That stops the five to nothing run para sa pension protectors. But a good sized lead here. Tatlo ang hinahabon ng Lady Gunners. Three serving six, major hake. Guillema. Passing Pitoy again. Uh, this time, nowhere to go. Madu lived with the block. AFP was ready to uh, block the ball coming from uh, Pachari that time around. Iniba na ni Pachari yung angle niya dun sa ball uh, eh. Pero ito na abangan na to ng AFP. Well, they, if there's one player AFP needs to focus on, so depends on, obviously, that's going to be Sam Wang. That's nice right. short serve. And that's going to be four touches contra sa pension protectors. Now Sasagot with a three-point run on Lady Gunners, and it's a close one again. From down 6-2, it is now a 6-5 scoreline. Isa na lang hinahabol dito ng Lady Gunners. Another strong serve from Major Hake. Guillema papunta kay Sang Wang, and that stops the Lady Gunners run. How many attacks coming from uh, Pachari already? I think that's the fifth already coming from Pachari. So five attack points, making it a two-point lead para sa kupuna ng SSS. Madulid, short pass. Madulid gets it back. And a short off-speed stab para kay Madulid. And no runs para sa pension protectors this time. We're not ready to uh, get that ball. Not in position actually to get that and receive that ball. But Pachari made an effort to run for the ball. One point game, chance to tie. A serve ni Marifoske. Ooh, that's gonna be short. You don't 
want the errors on the service alone. Oh. Malaking bagay yun eh, mga service nila. A free point given up as we check in with Dana De Guzman. Eric and Rina, the pension protectors are looking for their bounce back win as their import fitoy Sam Wang is now back on the court. Ngayon, naharapin nila ang AFP. Pinagtibay daw nila sa kanilang mga trainings ang depensa. At ngayon, kompleto na ang SSS. Tignan natin kung paano sila makakasabay sa opensa at depensa ng AFP. Balik sa inyo. Maraming salamat, Dana. Sabi ka ni Coach Eugenio. Um, character is one of the things they're trying to build. Kasi may mga close games daw sila. Hindi sila makakapit towards the end. That's right, kasi halos lahat ng mga games ng SSS, nagpa five sets talaga uh -huh. sila. Ang um, una lang nilang naipanalo is against the BFP, but they lost against the Senate right. and the, the Judiciary. Pero maganda yung performance nila. Solid performance. Mantala, Camacho was sending it wide. Camacho, new entry dito sa opening set. And now we're tied at eight. Second deadlock. Pag-asang lumamang, madulit serving para sa Lady Gunners. Camacho with a good pass. Uh, standing spike is way outside. It wasn't even close para kay Samusino. And now all of a sudden, napako ang pension protectors. At eight points, ang Lady Gunners lalamang ng isa. Solid serve coming from Madulid. Seya, underhand pass. Could have been outside Madulid. Kinuha. Here comes Yari Yonko. Samusino, underhand pass, chance ball for the Lady Gunners. They go to Yari Yonko, running attack, in a post. Yari Yonko falling down, but she's okay. Missed time to jump and sent it out. So an easy point for the pension protectors to tie the game at nine. Second attack of Yari Yonko that is uh, outside. Makad an easy point for the SSS, tied at nine. Already with four errors. Itong uh, pension protectors. A nice hit para kay Kili Betinho. Ooh, collision. Two players para sa pension protectors where everybody's okay. They're scrambling. Betinho hits off the net. Camacho will attack the push. Popped up by Olores. Madurid to Yari Yonko. Much better timing this time. And the Lady Gunners back on top by one. Camacho failed to uh, block that ball. Ah, may hirapan siya. Oh, Malaki oh. lang ito si Yari Yonko. Um, Yari Yonko, about maybe 5'10". Modest estimate. Guillema Camacho with the left. Blocked by Yari Yonko. Samosino inangat. Chance ball. Papunta sa Lady Gunners. Looking for a two-point lead. Yonko with the tip. He up by Seya. Guillema to Camacho. And again, Camacho sending it long. Now, Camacho really struggling rin na pa pagpasok niya off the bench. Too much on the right angle that time around. So, napasobra ito to the right. Kaya outside itong bola coming from Camacho. But Camacho is very powerful, especially on the front area. Kapag ganito, maganda yung usual na ginagalaw ng SSS. Antara Jamie Peña in the game for the first time. Para sa pension protectors. But they continue to struggle. Their service receivers outside. Na palaki na na palaki ang kalabangan dito ng Lady Gunners. They're up by three. Usually, the coaches would say, kailangan talaga na pakaganda ng mga service receivers mo. Usually, yun ang naririnig ko sa mga coaches. Pag nakikinig ako sa mga kadal nila, ayusin lang nila yung receive nila. And then the attack will follow. The defense will follow. Now that's not a good receiver. Overpass, Yari Yonko. Nanggigil ng konti. Sayang. That was a free ball for Yari Yonko. Mantala, uh, Coach Eugenio has seen enough. Papasok si Seya and Vitoy Sangwang is back in the game para sa pension protectors. They don't want this first set to slip away. Macho in the service line. Macho looking for her first points today. Major Hake with a hit. The tip there. A good play para kay Vira Meguillema. Nanginayang si Olores that time around. She was not able to receive that ball on her right hand. She was extending her hand, pero hindi. Hindi niya nakuha yung bola. First point para kay Vira May Guillema. First player aside from Fitoy with a point for the pension protectors. Yari Yonko buries that one. Solid attack coming from Yonko that time around. 
Yeah, Ryoko, a lot of energy today. I mean, first set pa lang, ang dami ng touches. Kasi mama yung second set, baka magpahirap siya eh. <laughs> so, bigay niya ng lahat ngayon. Yeah, Ryoko with three points already. Not a good first ball. So, si Vera Nekilema ngayon ang atake. A rare hit by a setter. Major Hake with a hit. Guillema, they go to Fitoy, of course. Matulit pops it up. Yarionko will send it over. Binalik. Ni Vira may Guillema, and that's what setters do. Was on the line that the AFP could not defend or get the ball at anymore there. First touch, smart play by Yarionko, by uh, Vira may Guillema. Off the pass by Yarionko. Nagahabol dito ang SSS. They're down by one. Chance to tie here. Yari Yonko. Uh, good save. But not high enough para sa third touch. Hindi masyadong naitaas yung set right there coming from uh, Seiya, no? So balik sa dalawa. Ang kalabangan ni Yonko and the Lady Gunners. Uh, service ace. Yari Yonko now with five points. That's her first ace of the game. No head coach medium goal, no problem so far para sa Lady Gunners, Rina. They're very confident right now. AFP is very confident with or without coach medium goal. Nakabakasyon si coach medium. Baka nanonood yun. Hello, coach. Pareho mo, galing sa bakasyon. Kasi parang yung mga players naman nila can be coaches na rin. Sa sobrang dami na nilang experience. That's right, veterans. Individually, mga veterans na yan. So parang sila, they know very well how to handle the team. Biggest lead para sa Lady Gunners, Coach Eugenio will be forced to call his first time out. We'll listen in. Receive lang ang depensa natin. Huwag tayo masyado nagmamadali. Itaas lang natin para dahan-dahan lang tayo. Hindi naman natin kailangan mabilis. Ha? Bawi tayo, apat yan. Guys, guys, huwag kayo makatay. May opensa tayo sa hap ngayon. Ang kailangan natin, depensa. Receive. Hindi tayo makakapalo na walang depensa. Dahan-dahan lang. Lahat ng receive, pataas. Walang mabilis. Yung balik ng bola sa 8. Sa 8. Yun ba, yun ba. Pagka hindi, pagka pangit reception, pag pangit yung second ball, may target tayo doon, yung number 8. Pagka, pakitignan kung saan po pwesto yun. Doon yung over. Pahirapan yung konti. Ha? Go, 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 go. Ano lang kayo? Go lang. Focus lang, focus. Yes, yes, yes! So, Coach Tan Eugenio, As you look at um, acting head coach Randy Fallurina and the Lady Gunners right now up by six. Coach Tan Eugenio. On paper, he's the head coach. But according to him, he's one of three head coaches of the team. Mm -hmm. Pero sa papel kasi, they can only put one head coach. He's, so they're looking to snap this uh, run by the Lady Gunners. Let's check in first with Dana de Guzman. Eric and Rina, kanina nga ay nabanggit nyo na si Coach Miriam ay nasa bakasyon. Kaya ngayon, si Coach Randy ang magtitake over as a head coach for the AFP. Sabi rin niya sa akin kanina na wala naman daw binago sa training ang AFP dahil kanilang ine-expect ang pagbalik din ni Sang Muang. Ngayon, tignan natin kung paano nila tatapatan ng may init na palo mula sa SSS. Thank you, Dana. Biggest lead now at 5 points after a service ace ni Ari Yonko overpass. Battle at the net. May angat ni Guillema. Sang Wang with a tip. Pancake save is no good para kay Madulid. There will be no cha. I don't think there's a cha. We, have, we don't have a challenge system, right? Oh, wala. Si Coach Rati, sumisenyos na with the challenge. Sa iba meron. Can't challenge here, Coach. But that ball is unsavable. So that stops the run. The Lady Gunners, it's a four-point game. 13 serving 17. Good pass. Olores sets it up. Here comes Major Hackett. Down the line, and she got it. Ito yung sinasabi kanina ni Coach Yano, Eugenio kanina. Talaga yung receive nila, yung first ball is very important. We have committed a lot of errors already. It's all coming from the service receive. After a few hiccups at the start of set number one, itong AFP, ang ganda na nang inilalaro. They are in rhythm. Vira May Guillema. Oh, that's gonna be an overreach. No, actually, it's a net touch in Tinawag. Kay Vira May Guillema. So, a free point here for AFP. The presence ni Madulit. Medyo na ano si Vira May Guillema. Got bothered kaya she touched, forced to touch oh, the net. Back to the biggest lead. And Lady Gunners up by six. Major Hake with a strong serve. Another tight pass, Samusino. That is definitely outside. 
And see si coach Tan Eugenio will use his final timeout as his team right now falling apart down by seven uh, here late in set number one. Spiker kayo. Re-receive, magsaset, bablock, papalo, lahat gagawin nyo. Kaya pag binigay sa inyo, dot ready kayo. Nagugulat kayo, dalawang beses kayo na nagulat. Ah, receive, receive muna. Simulan natin, receive muna ulit. Receive. It's all about doing the right things, no? Para dito kay uh, Coach Eugenio. No? Yung sabi niya sa akin, yung kanina, yung mga attacks nila, kailangan, it should be strong also. At yung kanila mga service receive also. Because right now, they have uh, seven errors para dito sa kuponan ng SSS. So, kailangan uh, uh, at par sila dun sa intensity at saka yung mga attack yung binibigay sa kanila ng AFP, di ba? Well, let's see. Last time out there ni Coach Eugenio, they're gonna have to work it all out on the floor to players ng SSS and try to stop the bleeding. Down by seven. Substitution para kay coach Randy Fallorina as Bettina will sit down. Mabayad will check in for the first time today. Major Hake and the rest of the Lady Gunners looking for their fourth straight win. Much better pass. Tough set para kay Guillema. They go to Fitoy. And Fitoy will stop the run ng Lady Gunners. That's exactly what Coach Eugenio wanted. This time around, not a good uh, receive naman there coming from the AFP. So, hindi nila nakuha to save that ball. Seven points para kay Fitoy. She is... Uh, Top scorer, uh, Camacho sending it into the net. No runs again, Rina, para yes. dito sa SSS. And uh, itong si Camacho, kanina pa rin siya nagkakaroon ng error, especially uh, close to the net, no? That's their third already. Third, yeah. Strong serve, short pass. Problema na naman. Camacho will try to get it in. Olores sends it to Mabayad. Oh, what a dig. Battle at the net. One by Mabayad. Here comes Reforma with a hit. Major Hake pops it up. Olores underhand set to Madulid. Oh, what a dig. Vera May Guillema. Camacho underhand pass. Could have been outside. Kinuhani Marifosque. Olores sets it for Major Hake. Here comes Reforma again. Popped up by Marifosque. Madulid. Short. And it's good. But they were not able to get that ball around. It was Jan Jan, no? Not able to respond on that ball. That's why AFP is so happy right now because they have three points away to be able to get this set. Uh, biggest lead at eight points para sa Lady Gunners. Reforma will sit down. Navarro will check in for the first time today, number two. Guillema to Camacho. Easy pick up para kay Madulid. Mabayad. Got it. When you know that Mabayad is in front para dito sa kupuna ng AFP, you have to be ready yeah. sa kanya mga atake. Itong si Mabayad is a uh, very smart player kasi talagang in all angles, she can do the ball uh, on that angle. Any angle actually. Samusino will sit down. Parinas checking in for the first time as Marifosca serves. Nine-point lead, pinakamalaki para sa Lady Gunners. Camacho. This time a harder hit. Olores will set it. They go to Madrid this time off a combination play. Pascual popping it up. Nice hit. Para kay Navarro. First touch of the game. Navarro, Seya, Pascual will not be able to get to it. And it's a 10 point lead for the Lady Gunners. Grabbing pagpahirap ng Lady Gunners. Oh, Rina, oh. dito sa Pets and Protectors. Rina, dalan nila yung ball. <laughs> Para dito sa SSS, no? They could not anticipate kung saan manggagaling yung ball, eh. That's right. Navarro with a pass. Guillermo will just toss it over. Chance ball ulit para sa Lady Gunners. And that's it! Mabayad! Mabayad was saying sorry, pe. Pero nakuha niya yung point na yun, eh. She was saying peace tayo, ah. <laughs> no mercy for the AFP. 
as they win by 11. He let Mabayan with a powerful kill to end it all in set number one. A few highlights, Pitoy, top scorer, Rina, para dito sa SSS. Good thing that he had uh, Pitoy on yeah. that uh, first set, no, para dito sa kupo na ng SSS. At least they're trying to slowly build the confidence of the SSS going up against the AFP because this is the first time na nagharap nga yung kanilang kupo na. But of course, AFP showing their veteran skills here at yung kanilang uh, defense and attacks uh, were very powerful on that first set. Eight errors para dito sa pension protectors. That's what really did them in here. As they lose by 11 contra sa AFP going into set number two. UVL fans, we are on the lookout for our next Barkada of the Game. Saktong sakto Sunday ngayon. Pagkasama nyo ang inyong pamilya, mga kaibigan, at lalong-lalo na ang inyong mga kabarkada. Susunod na Barkada of the Game! Ayan, kompletong pamilya magkakasama sila DM, Grace, Aya, Kiano, Sai, Jojo, Epoy, Malia at Elise. Ayan, kayo ang ating napiling Barkada of the Game. Thank you so much for joining us here at the UVL Season 2, ang unang volleyball league ng mga public servants. Twenty-five fourteen uh, AFP over SSS, a very dominant win as we look at the numbers, Rina. Yes, when it comes to the attacks, talagang namayat pag dito ang kupon na ng AFP, no? 12 as opposed to 9 given here by the SSS. At syempre, nalimitahan din nila yung kanilang mga errors. Kalahati lang nung errors na naibigay dito ng SSS, especially on that uh, uh, service receive na kanina pa natin pinag-uusapan. And of course, the AFP giving away uh, four aces dun sa kanilang first set, led by Yongho and Madulid with uh, six and five points respectively. At para dito naman sa SSS, Says they had Pachari had given seven points para dun sa kupunan ng SSS. Pero ang problema dito for the uh, pension protectors, Rina, you mentioned seven points, that's a good number para sa isang set for uh, Pitoy Sang Wang, mm -hmm. but the second leading scorer only has three points and nobody else has scored. So dadalawa lang ang pumuntos para sa pension protectors. They're gonna have to get their offense going. They're gonna have to um, get other people involved para naman mas maging unpredictable ang kanilang opensa kontra sa very solid defense ng Lady Gunners. Let's see if the second set will work uh, better para dito sa kupuna ng SSS if they will try to limit on those errors and uh, they will do a better job on their offense and defense as well. Kasi para sa Lady Gunners, they have five players who've scored yes. in the game. So, ang dami. I mean, mas maganda yung, yung distribution ng bola nila uh, which is what made, made it hard for the pension protectors na depensahan because hindi mo alam kung sino ang gagawa ng puntos eh. And not a good start, Camacho. Really a rough game this Sunday. She's struggling today, no? But I saw her in her last few games then napaganda ng performances uh -oh. ni Camacho. It's just today. It's just today na marami siyang errors. Four, four errors already for Camacho in the game. Tough pass para kay Salarda. And Mapayad. Nice hit. <laughs> Pitoy with a set to Vira Meguinema. Quite the opposite. Mapayad gets the first attack point para sa Lady Gunners. She does it again. Basta when she's in front, be ready for her. Alam mo, she always does this na when she hits the ball, it's like spinning uh -oh. over onto the net na hindi mo alam kung saan babagsak yung bola. Four points para kay Lilet Mapayad. Block at the net. Uh, Guillema keeping it alive. Guillema na naman ang aatake dito. That's on the line. Nice push. First point para sa pension protectors. Smart move coming from uh, the import that time around Guillema. 
Uh, several times we've seen Kijema attacking para sa pension protectors. Dahil nga kulang na kulang sila sa aggressive players sa opensa. Good pass. Patulid mula sa back row. Guillema, atake si Reforma. And that's him. De Gia let it go. Good way to boost the momentum and confidence level of the SSS. Two-point run para sa pension protectors to tie the game. Just when it looked like kakapusin sila dun. Uh, off to a bad start. And get two quick points to tie the game. Kanina, when we were listening into the segment uh, before the start of this ball game, sinabi ni Coach Eugenio right there, it's win for the experience talaga ang hapon ng kapuna ng SSS, di ba? And I'm happy that they're here with us right now in UBL Season 2. Alam mo kasi Season 1 pa yan eh. Gusto uh -oh. nilang sumali talaga. Kaya lang sabi sa akin ni Miss Jamie Peña, hindi pa sila kompleto. Nagahakot pa daw siya ng mga players. <laughs> eh si Jamie kasi dati nang naglalaro, di ba? Uh -oh. For the NC, if I'm not mistaken, NCAA perpetual siya eh. So, siya yung eager, very eager talaga to uh, be joining us here in the UBL game. Uh, it's nice to see them here. Although right now, uh, you've got a feel for SSS. Kasi kalaban mo, these are the uh, defending champions. These are very experienced players. Last season, they showed everybody how dominant they are. Yes. So, for a Cinderella team, talagang a tough challenge as Mabayad with a service fault there. Guillema on the service line right now. Guillema with four points, one ace already, and three attacks. Good pass, Major Hake. Lores back to Major Hake. Guillema, tough set para kay Pito. She had to push it. Lores picking it up. Set over by Pantino, who's in the game for the first time, by the way. And Pantino, nice save by De Gia. Oh, what a game for the Gia! That was an easy ball, no? Na hindi na anticipate ng SSS. Good save coming from uh, the AFP that time around. And I like how the AFP are talking uh, very loud here. I heard kanina si Yen was saying, Akin ang bola. Uh, That's the thing that uh, the SSS needs to improve on siguro. Yung kanilang communication also. Major Hake serving 5-3. Reforma sets Samusino. Picked up by Mabayad. And here comes Pantino. Got it. And Pantino with a nice long hair now. Wow, oh, short hair. Oh. And Pantino that day. Nagpapahaba na. Baka may event. Nagpapahaba na. Baka may event. Ganun ba yun? Okay. Service ace, Major Hake, uh, maagang uh, kumakawala itong Lady Gunners right now. They're up by four. That's what they want. <laughs> Gusto nila to be dominant. Uh oh, and that's what, exactly what they're doing. They're doing the right things dito. Ay, pa na nagbakasyon si Coach Miriam eh. <laughs> <laughs> Guillema to Fitoy. That's outside. Coming from Pitoy that time around. Uh, Kami hinayang si Pitoy. Her first error in the game. Uh, first time out dito para kay Coach Eugenio will listen in to the SSS pension protectors. Service nung nagsaserve. Huwag natin madaliin. Huwag tayo masyadong magpa-pressure. Laruin lang natin yung laro natin. Ha? Habol tayo, alin mo yan? Huwag nyo na ipalayo. Kailangan dumikit na tayo dito. No pressure, just to enjoy this ball game. Yun lang ang sinabi talaga sa kanila, no? Kasi nakikita nga ni Coach Chuhen yun na talagang baka nanggigigil sila sa bola dahil na nagigipit sila dun sa kanilang score right now. They're under five points here against the AFP. All right, putahin natin si Dana de Guzman. Dana? Eric Enrina, a returning player from AFP, is Rhea Marifosque, who is now a starting six 
for the team. Sabi nga niya, iba na raw ang level ng UVL ngayon. Mas naging competitive ang mga teams. And this time, mas pinag rin niya ang kanyang mga ensayo para makakontribute sa depensa at opensa ng AFP. Balik sa inyo. Maraming salamat, uh, Dana. And that's right, no? Uh, just by the scores, the number of sets we played, may kita mo na the competition has gotten higher and better sa season 2 ng UNTV Volleyball League. And there's Pitoy knocking in her 8th point of the game. There you have it coming from uh, the angle of Pitoy. Sabi niya, ibabagsak ko yun just on the line uh -oh. where they cannot anticipate the ball. Kung kayo yung ka kabukas na ng inyong mga TV sets, you're wondering, sino si Pitoy? She's a Thai native who's uh, now part of the SSS as an import. Betinho, cross-court hit, Pitoy with a nice dig. Marifosque popping it up. Ito si Olores to Pantino. Good rally. Camacho sending it over, Marifosque. Olores, sinabol. Pantino, and another great dig para sa pension protectors. Reforma. A nice tip para kay Olores. Reforma ulit. And finally, napako sa pinatatayo nila itong Lady Gunners. Eh, if he thought na hindi na makukuha ni Reforma yung bola niyo na. So nobody was there to catch the ball for the AFP. Pitoy on the line again. A good little run dito para sa pension protectors there within three. Bitinho. Yes! Another stop para sa pension protectors. Just as what uh, Coach Eugenio was saying, huwag na nating uh, palayuin itong score na to. And unti-unti bumabangon dito ang SSS. They're now just two points away, no? Dito sa kuponan ng AFP. Three-point run. Make that a four-point run para sa pension protectors. They are now within one after being down by five. Coach uh, Randy Fagliorina on your screens. Ayaw pang tumawag ng timeout. And Pantino with a pass. Pantino gets it back, hits. Sang Wang with the receive and the hit. Mabayad, unable to pop it up para kay Olores, and the lead is gone para sa AFP. We're tied at eight. This is what you want to see para dito sa kukunan ng SSS. No? Yung nag nagtatay sila, minsan nangungunan okay. rin sila sa scores against the AFP. A nice uh, boost of confidence para sa kanila. Olores, sinabol yung pasa ni Pantino. Pantino gets it back. Pitoy again with the dig. Reforma, mabayad, overpass, the push by Pantino. Inangat ni Guillema. Camacho. Yes, it's in again! <laughs> Unbelievable! Six straight points scored by the pension protectors. Uh, up by one after trailing by five. Akala natin na nabas na rin yung bola yun eh. Uh -oh. But this time around, minake sure ni Camacho na makakabawi na siya dun sa kanyang mga errors kanina on that first set. First point para kay Camacho after committing four errors. Pantino with the pass. Olores to Betinho. Oh, that's four touches contra sa AFP. And finally, tatawag din ang timeout si Coach Fagliorina as his five-point lead is now a two-point deficit. SSS up 10-8 contra sa AFP set number two. Uh, hindi naman totally na lumalaban. Kayo yung gumagawa ng para para lumaban sila. Ang tagal, ang tagal ng ano natin na hindi tayo maka-score ng maayos, makapuntos. So ngayon, kailangan natin putulin 'yan. Okay? So ngayon, kalimutan na natin 'yan. Ha? Ah, pan kailangan magpatulong ka sa kanila mag-receive. Resibo na pa lang, mahirap ang talaga niyan. Libero at ano, mabayad kailangan mag-receive kayo ha. Okay, kalimutan nyo yan. Bago ulit tayo, bago, bago, ha? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Tama yung sabi ni Coach Randy, no? Kasi yung mga puntos, yung mga errors nila, yung mga easy points para dito sa SSS right now. Napakuna sa ocho itong Lady Gunners after a comfortable win in the opening set 25-14. Eh, pinanood nilang gumawa ng 
this is going to be a seven, seven point run para sa pension protectors to lead by two. Pantino. Di pa rin nagbunga yung timeout na yun ng uh, Lady Gunners. This is now an eight point run para sa uh, pension protectors. Oh nga. And still pachari on the service line. Panginang yep. ano na to sa service line. A three point lead para sa pension protectors. This is their biggest lead of the set. Abayad with the pass. Pantino. Finally a side out. But a good run para sa pension protectors right now uh, will attempt to protect a two point lead. Guillema. Reforma sa gitna. Uh, nice up by Olores Pantino. Off speed hit. Guillema. Uh, back to Reforma. That's on the line. No, it's. Yeah, it's on the line. It's on the line. There's an overrule in Tinawag and Lions Judge outside, but Ryan Corpus, our first referee, says, wait a minute, I saw that. It landed in right on the line. This is the second attack of Reforma in the line, just on the line. Back to a three-point lead para kay Reforma and the pension protectors. Pantino, got it. Uh, slowly cutting the lead here of uh, SSS, no? Dalawa na lang, hinahabo nila. Espeña is back in the game for the second time today. Oh, what a nice serve. Man, Pantino, here comes Peña, her first hit. The Guilla passes, inangat ni Mabayad. Betinho, cross court. Peña picks it up. Camacho! It's on the line! coming from uh, Camacho that time around. Kanina napapansin ko puro to the right yung kanyang mga atake. Parang iniba niya ngayon yung kanyang oh. atake. Yeah, it's good to see Camacho finally getting her rhythm pagkatapos ng four errors. She's picked up two points here in the second set. Olores to Mabayad. The push by Peña de Guilla with a dig. Mabayad again. Got it. Bayad in front of uh, the AFP right now, so please watch out para dito sa upunan ng SSS. Nagkahabol ang defending champions after dominating in the first set. They're down by two. Pero lumamang sila as many as five early here in set number two. But a big eight-point run para sa pension protectors put them on top. Camacho, that's short. Had the right idea, but was not able to execute that idea of Camacho. Tsaka nagbago yung isip niya last second eh. Oh. Pababa na siya yung sinabi niya. Itadrop ko na lang kaya. Hindi na nakuha sa timing. So, one point game. Well, dumitikit na dito. Ang Lady Gunners. Guillema. Peña. Nice dig. Coming from Kilian Betinho. Back row! Nagkaagawa ng Olores. And si Pantino nagdikit. Oo, oh, okay. Kasi nakita ko na rin si Olores. So, si ako, ako. <laughs> But then Pantino had the right, ano eh, another idea. Alright, so hindi makakaligit ang Lady Gunners. They're back down by two. Camacho will serve. I serve, but the Guilla with a super pass. Mabayad, the up by Reforma, Guillema. Fitoy, got it! Nice one. Tinadaan dun sa kamay ng AFP ni Fitoy ang bola. So, back to the biggest lead para sa pension protectors. They're up by three points. 15 serving 12. Camacho, gigil na gigil sa serve. Overpass. Guillema with the push. De Gia, great coverage. Tumabayad, standing spike. Pitoy, one-handed dig. And Sangwang rejected. Guillema, ang atake picked up by Pantino. Olores, tumabayad. Yep. Again, Mabayad did that uh, attack, no? Minsan hindi niya hinihintay na hanggang third pa eh. Oh. Pag alam niyang kaya niya nang ibagsak yung bola, ibabagsak niya na. Alam niyang butas yung area niyo, she will uh, give that ball to that. 
Two-point game. 13 serving 15. Make that 14 serving 15 now. Uh, service ace. Para kay Olores. Si Yen, laging nandito yung kanyang mother. Eh. Very supportive. supportive ano? Coming from okay. uh, Cavite. And the last time around, binigyan pa, binigyan pa kami ng mango top yun. <laughs> Mami Armin. Uy, Napitan kasi kami. Sarap yun. Sabi niya, Ira and Rina. Mommy Armin, kasama daw yung barkada ni Yen. Kasi si, yung barkada ni Yen ang laging nanonood dito talaga. Tapos hinahap na lang daw si Mami. Sinasabay na lang. Hala ko, barkada ni Yen yung laging may tapioca. <laughs> We're tied at 15. Nakahabol na dito ang Lady Gunner. Sang Muang looking to give them the lead back. Pantino. Now, nagahanap ng kalamangan dito ang AFP. But no attack there. Chance ball. Sang Muang for the lead. Got it! Solid attack coming from uh, Pachari that time around. Nice. Puntahan natin itong report. As we watch this uh, hit muna by Sang Muang, we'll check in with Dana Di Guzman. Dana? Eric and Rina, alam nyo ba kanina napanood natin si Jamie Peña? At hindi lang pala siya volleyball player. Siya rin ay isang volleyball coach at volleyball referee. Hindi lang yan, nag-aaral din daw siya maging volleyball analyst at isang court announcer. Ngayon, pero ngayon ay panoorin muna natin at abangan kung paano maglaro si Jamie Peña. Balik sa inyo. Maraming salamat, Dana. Ah. This, these days, kailangan talaga mag-multitasking. Mag 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 eh. Nice to see Jamie Peña exploring uh -oh. uh, you know, possibilities uh, around her volleyball career. Good rally going on. Sangwang. Pinangat ni Major Hake. Olora sends it over. Chance ball para sa SSS. Guillema. Back to Sangwang. Blocked up top. It's not coming back. Uh, Benson Protector scoring two straight points to go back up by two. SSS good battle in the net area. And Sang Muang now, the only player in double digits. Tresi na, ang naibo puntos niyan. Seiya serving. Begia with the pass. Mabayad. Into the net. But not right timing kung sa kanyang pagtalon to be able to attack that ball. Third error para kay Mabayad. She has seven points. And si Coach Fallurina, I think, papasok si Bitinho. A little later on, wing time serve muna, panoorin natin si Seiya, send it over, Degia with the pass. Major Hake sends it outside. The angle of the ball is too high. Para dito kay Major Hake. And a lot of problems para sa AFP. Yung ganda ng inilarun in the first set, they're not the same here in set number two. Damning errors, they're now down by four points again. Mabayad. Good up. Reforma. Oh, nice one. Coming from Reforma. Pang ilan na to ni Reforma, no? Na hindi nasasala ng bola ng AFB. Five now. And Coach Fallurina has seen enough. Sa tawag siya ng kanyang huling timeout, we'll listen in. Ang pangit. Hindi maganda ginagalaw niyo. Ha? Huwag ka mapapagod kung ano. Nawawala yung back row attack mo doon, nandun. Hirap na, hirap na sila. May pantapon ka pa sa kabilang side. Ha? Hindi na tayo nag-iisip eh. Para-para na ginagawa nyo. Hindi dapat ganyan. Hindi, kayo, hindi ganyan ang ginagalaw nyo. Binabago nyo eh. Hey, may sunusunod tayo ng sistema kung sa ating de-depensa, sa ating bablock. Okay? Isa lang yung, isa lang yung kalaban natin. Ba't kailangan pahirapan mata yung sarili natin? Na pero huwag ka muna, uh, huwag ka muna ang papasok ha. Siya muna. Okay? Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Gunner! 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 Sabi ni Coach Randy, not organized ang kupuna ng AFP ngayon, no? Kung ano yung ginanda ng laro nila, kabalik na rin ngayon. And parang mas napag-pressure pa silang maglaro ngayon as opposed to the SSS who's just really enjoying this game. Kaya din siguro naging less errors para sa kupuna ng uh, pension protectors. And they've committed more errors. Contra sa Pension Protectors, Reforma and Company, only five errors. AFP, six errors. Dito sa set number two. And that's why, Guillema and the Pension Protectors up by five. With Seiya continuing to serve. 
And Kili Betinho in the game. There is Mabayad. Finally a side out para sa Lady Gunners. Mabayad trying to uh, bounce back, uh, siding that uh, ball, no? Mabayad serving. The up by Samusino. Reforma, that is way outside. So two straight points para sa Lady Gunners. From down five. Tatlo na lang, hinahabo niya na dito. I think yung biggest nila, five points ba yun? Five points. Naman. Naman. Uh -huh. Mabayad. Not a good pass. Coming from Salarda. The up by Babayad, inabuli Olores, chance ball mula kay Pantino Guillema. Uh, will go, no surprise, Samoa knocks it in. He has the right target in mind para dito kaya sa Ram, no? 14 points for Pachari or Fitoy Samoa. Nice comeback kasi na-miss daw niya talaga. Sabi niya sa akin kanina, sabi ko, na-miss mo ba kami? Opo, ate, na-miss mo. Maroon na mag-Tagalog. Yeah, magaling yeah, mag-Tagalog. Nakakaintindi na rin. Oo. Oh, oh. And swipe by Pantino is off. Yung two-point run ng AFP na buro na. Balik sa lima ang kalamangan ng SSS. Vira May Guillema, four points. Two errors. Good pass, Olores. Major Hake. Sang Muang will play center. Reforma, attack into the net. Medyo mababa lang siguro yung set na binigay dito kay Reforma. She was not able to uh, adjust and uh, attack that ball. Alright, uh, Coach Fagliarina. Towards the end of the title set number two, he has to put in one of his best players. So, Yonko is back in the game. Let's see if they can make a good four-point run here. Yan ang kailangan to erase this deficit. Salarda inangat. Chance ball para sa Lady Gunners. Yari Yonko running attack. The push. And Seiya will not be able to get the up. A little two-point run para dito sa AFP. Tatawag ng timeout si Coach Eugenio. Isang receive, isang set, ihikot na si Pitoy. Hey guys, one stop lang. Ganto, pumasok yung dalawang import nila. Nakaredy na agad kay Pitoy dito. Pag binigay sa'yo dun sa open, hindi na makakahabol yung dalawang para umabol. Paluin nyo lang, paluin nyo lang ha. Tiwala lang, tiwala lang. Tababa, tababa. Push tayo, push, push pa. Tulong sa akin lang, gano'n lang. Trabawin nyo yung tatlo, trabawin nyo yung tatlo. Okay. Go, Tipi! SS! SS! This has to watch out uh, for the imports here, especially the right now. Alam nilang babawi sila. They want to get this second set para maagang matapos itong narong ito. That's why pinasok nga ni Coach Randy kanina si Yonko. And they have to watch out for Yonko. Oh well, kinakausap kanina ni Coach Eugenio si Reforma telling her na nakabantay na kay Fitoy yung uh, dalawang imports, which is Yari Yonko and Mayan Pantino. So, pag binalik sa'yo doon, hindi na makakahabol yan. So, paluin mo na lang. Kasi kanina, yung palo ni Reforma was into the net. Ah, here we go. Two-point run para sa Lady Gunners. Can they continue? No more timeouts remaining for both teams. Good serve. Salarda with the pass. Pitoy. Outside. Three-point run. Para sa Lady Gunners, <laughs> si Vira Miguelema signaling review, challenge, no challenge in the UVL. Pito yung was saying, alam niyang pasok yung bola. <laughs> Nagulat din siya lumampas ng konti dun sa linya. Siguro kung beach volleyball pasok yun, mas maiksi yung court dun eh. Oh. <laughs> And that save is no good para kay Reforma. It's now a four-point run for the Lady Gunners from down five. They are within one. Olores was saying, buti na lang hindi ko sinib yung bola ngayon. <laughs> Major Hake, big serve coming up. Gotta get it in. Oh, 
Oh, good pass. Reforma. Short hit is good. Reforma, her six point. And hindi ba kadikit ang Lady Gunners? Short, sweet, and smart para dito kay Reforma. Yung mga moves na ganun. Oo. Hi, sir from San Juan dito. They're up by two. And they're two points away from winning the first, their first set. And tie this game. Oh, but Yari Yonko says, wait a minute. Yonko, eight points. Mabayad, eight points. They are the top Lady Gunners and so far in this game. One point game ulit tayo. Seiya with a bad pass. Gonna be a chance ball for the Lady Gunners. Yari Yonko, one to play. Got it. The game is tied at 23. Back to back points para kay Yonko. Same attack para dito kay Yonko. And SSS could not uh, be able to uh, receive and uh, put the ball up. And a service fault, but it Foske. That's gotta hurt for the Lady Gunners uh, arena. <laughs> Something na kailangan iwasan mo when at, you're at this crucial point now. Hindi pinaghirapan to get to set point. 24 serving 23. Good pass. Pantino. Pascual with the up. Camacho looking for the winning point. And si Pantino. Battle at the net. And Samusino sends it over. Chance ball para sa Lady Gunners. Yarionko. Samusino saving it. Reforma will send it over. Another chance ball for the Lady Gunners. This time, Pantino. Pascual with a dig. Seiya. It's outside. Set point is gone. We're tied at 24. But good rally and good defense coming from these two teams, the SSS and the AFP. Betinho and Mapayat Babalik. Yonko will sit down. One set point lost. Ang Lady Gunners nagahanap ng pagkakataon to get to set point. Pantino with a serve at 24 all. Not a good first ball, Samusino. Underhand pass, Camacho will hit. Dolores picking it up. Bitinho will be setter. Mabayad off speed. And the hit by Pascual is over. Dolores back to Mabayad. Got it. Mabayad puts the Lady Gunners at set point 25-24. Pinatama niya talaga dun sa kamay. <laughs> First set point for the Lady Gunners at 25-24. Pantino hoping for an ace. Guillema chasing it down. Seiya underhand pass. That could have been outside, but Ifosuke picked it up. Going to be a chance ball this time for the pension protectors. Guillema to Camacho. Off the chest of Pantino, set point saved, we're tied at 25. Binawiya naman ni Camacho, itong kupo na ng AFP. Camacho, picking up point number three. Ang ganda ng offense ang pinapakita dito ng SSS. That's right. And I love how they're playing right now. Oh! Samosino with an ace! Na pako dun ang Lady Gunners. Nobody moving for the receive. It's so unlikely for the AFP. Oh, yeah, exactly. Oh, na tumingin lang sila dun sa bola. So, second set point. Overpass by Pantino. And the set point is saved. We're tied at 26. So, two set points lost by the. Pension protectors, Samantala, um, Lady Gunners, they also lost a set point. Madurid is checking in again after not playing a lot here in set number two. Loving the attitude here of the SSS. Talaga dito sa ating second set. 26 all. Betinho with a serve. Guillema to Seya, underhand pass. Marifosque to Olores. Madurid. I got it! Uh, so the Lady Gunners set point number two here. There were two attackers running for the ball. And hindi na anticipate ng SSS. Mandin was also there running to the net. The last time 
Lady Gunners were at set point. They made a service fault. This one is in. Good pass, though. One to play. The Gia. Mariposke. That's not coming back. Set point. Saved by the pension protectors. 27 all. SSS responding very well to the call of what a their game. fans and yeah. their coaches. What a game. Both teams having lost two set points already. Camacho with the surge. Oh, could have been outside. Olores to Madulid. That's outside. No, it's on the line. It is on the line. Third set point for Madulid and the rest of the Lady Gunners. Just on the line. This time. Maswerting attack. On the line. Can the Lady Gunners complete their plays and get the win. Extended set number two. Set point number three for the Lady Gunners. San Juan, nasa harap. San Juan. Why not? Set point save. So Seiya will serve here. 28 all. Seiya, wala pang ace. Madulid with the pass. Abayad. Nice defense by Salarta. Marifosque to Olores. Back to Abayad. Popped up by Seiya. Great defense. Para sa SSS. There's a block against San Juan. San Juan will try again. Madulid. Got it. Coming from Madulid this time around, it's really in. Eight points para kay Madulid. And this is set point number four para sa Lady Gunners as Major Hackett returns to the game. Papatan si Madulid. Moto nila, walang bibitaw, walang kukurap. <laughs> yeah. Full front line para sa Lady Gunners. Major Hake, Pantino, Marifosque in front. Tip by San Juan, Olores, Pantino, got it! After an extended second set, Lady Gunners with a tremendous win. They really wanted to prove themselves na veteran kami, kaya namin yan kahit mahaba pa yan, more than 25 points. And they made it through, no? Itong kupuna ng AFP. But you gotta love the spirit of the SSS right there na talagang they... Keep it close, keep it close with the uh, AFP Lady Gunners. No? Yung offense nila, it was there already. A lot more errors para sa Lady Gunners in set number two. Uh, Sang Wang with a big factor already in double digits with 15 points. And that helped the bench and protectors, in fact, have two set points to the second set because of the efforts of Sang Wang and the uh, floor defense of the rest of the team. But uh, clearly not enough. Just too much firepower from the Lady Gunners. And in an extended set number two, they come away with a win, 30-28. And they're going to set number three to the defending champions with a two sets to nothing advantage contra sa SSS. Time out muna tayo sa ating mga UVL games. At punta naman tayo sa ating mini games na hatid sa inyo ng UVL. Alright, kasama ko naman ngayon si Miko at siya ang ating napiling mga kasali sa ating emoji cam. Ready ka na ba? Apo. Sino bang kuponan ang sinusuportahan mo dito sa UVL? Uh, kung sino po manalo. Ay, kung sino daw manalo. Okay, abangan natin yan uh, for this match. Ngayon, ready ka na ba sa ating emoji cam? Apo. Alright, simple-simple lamang ang iyong gagawin. Magpapakita kami ng ilang mga emojis dito sa screen at gagayahin mo lang yon. Alright? Are you ready? All right, in three, two, one, emoji cam, let's go! All right, abangan natin kung anong emoji ang lalabas sa screen and impersonate mo lang. All right, ayan, nakataas si dalawang kamay, kaway-kaway, and smile. All right, ano na, ito, gulat, shock face.
Grabe, ang galing nag-practice yata itong si Miko. Alright, next emoji. Tulog. Night, night. Alright, congratulations, Miko. You will receive gift packs from Dazing. Alright, abangan natin kung ano ang mangyayari sa ating third set. Kung makakahabol pa ba ang SSS Pension Protectors, abangan natin yan sa set number three. Uh, getting that uh, second set in that ex extended uh, set again, no? 30 and uh, 28. Maganda yung ginawa doon, of course, of the SSS team. They're working more as a team there. The offense is there. And aside from Pachari and uh, Guillema, uh, nakakontribute na rin ng puntos dito si Camacho and uh, si Reforma para sa kupunan ng pension protectors. Pero syempre, kahit mas maraming errors dito ang AFP Lady Gunners, hindi pa rin sila nag, uh, nagpadaig dun sa kanilang mga veteran moves para maipanalo yung uh, second set na yun. Third set on its way para dito sa kupunan. Two sets now. Uh, won by the AFP Lady Gunners. Camacho in the service line. So for everyone who's watching us right now, you can tune in to our Facebook page and YouTube channel of UNTV Sports. Of course, don't forget to like and follow us there para mapanood niyo po itong nag-iisang uh, liga ng mga public servants sa volleyball naman po ang UVL Season 2. The ball is on the side of uh, the AFP right now. Olora sets it up and Yari Yonko puts it away for the first point of the Lady Gunners in set number three. Yonko now with nine points, make that ten points. So first Lady Gunner in double digits, Yari Yonko. And Dito sa set number three as uh, Olora gets an ace. Lady Gunners for sure, ayon na lang malamangan pa dito because they don't want a repeat of what happened in set number two because they were able to almost the entire second half of the second set. And the uh, good thing that they were able to get that second set yep. was where they got That's right. Pitoy. Yes, first point for Pitoy in set number three. And uh, the pension protectors uh, on the board. from Pachari and um, dito kay Guillema at least Camacho and Reforma was able to yeah. contribute para dito sa kumpanan ng SSS in that second set and hopefully more players will be more involved dito sa pension protectors on the third set that's right Camacho with three Reforma with six as San Juan gets another point back to back points para sa kanya blocking Yoko two point run para sa pension protectors to tie the game at two Set number three, Seiya with a nice serve. Yonko, overhead toss. Chance ball para sa pension protectors. Here comes Reforma. Madrid. Major Hake on the attack. Got it. An easy attack coming from Major Hake that time around. If you're SSS, you want to win this uh, game dahil ayaw mo mapapagawa lang dun sa bottom of the team standings, no? Kasi pag natalo pa sila dito, it will add up to their loss record, which is three or two kasi ngayon, eh. So pag right. natalo sila, magti-three na yun. They're gonna be one and three. Only one win para sa pension protectors. That was their first game. They're all coming off back-to-back -back losses. Samantala, three straight wins naman para dito sa AFP. Titoy, one-handed dig, but Fosque. Major Hake popping it up. Madulid, overhead toss. Underhand pass the man, Mulaka Guillema. There's Yonko popping it up. Guillema with the tip. Victino with the push. Tito on the attack. Adelin popping it up. Olores out to Yari Yonko through the block. Got it. Showing the importance of Yonko para di sa kupunan ng uh, AP Lady Donners. 
11 for Yonko. Nine attacks and two aces. Major Hake serving 4 2. Third set. Service ace. Para kay Major Hake. That's her third ace. Five points in total para kay Major Hake. Good serve, but a better pass by Salarda. In a and the second attempt is no good. A rare error from San Juan. Just her fourth error of the game after 15 attacks. I wonder if it's because napapagod na rin siya. Yep. Because uh, she's been here from the first set hanggang ngayon. Eh. That's right. Could be. Fatigue could be a factor para kay Pito. Eh. Madulid with the up. Yari Yonko. Here's Reforma, underhand pass. Dolores, running attack. Yari Yonko, goodbye. Salarda, second time around. Para dito sa kanyang receive. At the tawag ng time out, si Coach Eugenio. They're down by five here in set number three. Showing more energy, ang importante para dito sa kumpona ng SSS, no? They have uh, to have that will for them to be able to uh, win this ball game. Maganda na yung performance nila on the second set. Eh. Um, ewan ko lang kung anong nangyayari sa kanila ngayon, kung bakit medyo mabagal uh -oh. kanilang uh, depensa. And it's demoralizing a, a little bit as well. Yung having two set points in the second set and having a five-point lead, in fact, and burahin yun ng kalaban mo. So, they're trying to get their confidence back up after a really tough loss in the second set. Betinho, that's popped up by Salarda. Sangwang blocked up top by Yonko. Major Hake popping it up. Yonko with a tip, it's short! Kahit siya nagulat sa sobrang pagka-short ng kanyang tip. Walang angle. Umakyat lang yung bola. Pataas. Guillema now on the service line. Guillema, five points. SSS down by four. Guillema with a good pass. Yonko, Babawe, after that error, and she does. You can see there, yung sobrang pagod na ni Pachari. Gusto niyang saluhin yung bola, but she will, uh, hindi siya nakalood agad to be able to receive that ball. Let's uh, go courtside, check in with Dana de Guzman. Eric and Rina, kanina, bago magsimula ang set number three, pinaalalahanan ng coach ng SSS na hindi pa tapos ang laban. Back to zero tayo pagdating dito sa third set. Kaya huwag kayong matakot na lumaban. Pinaalalahanan din kanina si RB Camacho na maging matapang sa kanyang mga palo at magtiwala sa kanyang mga teammates para sa coverage. Ngayon, tignan natin kung magre-responde ba ang SSS at hinahanap ng kanilang coaches na sipag at tapang. Balik sa inyo. Alright, thank you, Dana. Alright now, hindi natin nakikita yun. They're down by six. Yung sipag to run for the ball na wala sa kanila sa so, oh. SSS this time around. Yung kanilang depensa. Reforma. That's popped up by Madulid and to si Betinho. Almost an overpass. Difficult get para kay Guillema. Chance ball for the Lady Gunners. Madulid, got it. Nobody, nobody was ready there between uh, Seiya, no? At saka dito kay uh, Pao. 
Uh, kung gaano kahirap pumuntos uh, in the second set para sa Lady Gunners. Ganun naman kadali ngayon. They're up by seven already. Overpass and outside. Only one timeout remaining para sa uh, SSS. Parang first set na lumulobo na naman yung kalamangan dito ng uh, AFP Lady Gunners. Guillema. And finally, a side out. Vitoy will get her 18th point of the game. The match will back for SSS. Almost. Yes, it is. An ace will add him third touch for AFP after that nice serve by Vitoy. You want to continue this kind of momentum for the SSS to be able to uh, get back. A two point run for the pension protectors. Another ace. Yes. Three point run. Pension protectors. Coming off two aces. Mula kay Titoy Sang Moa. Six serving 11. Padulid! Parang gigil na gigil. Oo. There you go with that attack coming from Madulid. Six point lead. Para kay Marifosque and the Lady Gunners. Overpass. Yarionko with a dump. Nice save by Samosino. Yarionko, that's popped up by Pascual. Reforma. Yonko again. This time, Guillema popping it up. Reforma attacking. Olores sets it up. Petinho. Pascual with the dig. Reforma into the net. But Kinuna, yung kanyang uh, attacking. Thirteen six. Solid advantage. Para kay Marifosque and the Lady Gunners. Camacho. Samosino picking it up. Guillema. Tight pass. Battle at the net. Won by Madulid. Camacho was not uh, able to save that ball. Dumaan na lang dun sa kanyang balikat yung ball. Eh. Patuloy ang pag-arangkada nila. Yari Yonko and the Lady Gunners here. Now up by 8 points. So that service way too low for Marifosco. Comfortable advantage. Para sa AFP as Larion checks in for the first time today. Team captain of the SSS. And uh, the most senior pension protector at 61. Guillema, tough pass, Camacho. That's going to be four touches. Will I block Ayari Yonko Don? The lead is now eight. That is uh, Lady Gunners. Uh, acting head coach Randy Fagnolina. They will put in some of his second stringers. Barion, Papaso for the first time today. He's more confident to bring in some more players ngayon because mataas yung lead nila ngayon. Oh. Contra sa SSS. Good serve by Betinho. Almost an ace. Seiya underhand pass. Olores. Madulid. May Madulid would always attack on that area. Oh, oh. Nobody was ready again to receive that Madulid attack. Well, points para kay Madulid as we check in again with Dana de Guzman. Eric and Rina, speaking of May Madulid, alam nyo ba na aksidente lang ang pagkakakuha sa kanya bilang volleyball player? Siya lang daw ay nagja-jogging sa Burnham Park noong kanyang college days at inanbitahan na siya ng isang coach sa UP Baguio para maglaro sa kanila. And the rest is history. Now let's go to the timeout. Huwag tayo magre-relax. May pinasok silang isang 
second stringer nila. So, mas mahina yung lineup nila ngayon. Pakitarget naman yung mahihina. Di, hindi tayo mananalo kung ganyan gagawin nyo eh. Kailangan nyo pumalo. Tulungan kayo, tatlo kayo sa... Tatlo kayo sa... O, tatlo kayo mamamalo eh. Kailangan nyo pumalo. Hindi nyo kailangan mag-error. Ha? Yo, tapang pa, tapang, tapang, tapang. Kaya, humingi kang bola. Hindi mo kapalo yung gitna. Ay, let's go. Tapang, tapang, tapang. Hindi pa siya eh. Hindi pa siya eh. Wala nang pang mangyayari. Ano yung may binigit, bibinigit yung sa'yo? Ano mo awala? Wala na mo awala diyan. Tama 'yon, no? They have to take uh, advantage of uh, this lineup of the AFC. Just have to attack strong and uh, play it smart. Pwedeng ibigay nila dun sa second stringer nga ano na pinasok dito ng AFC. No more timeouts remaining. Para kay Coach Tan Eugenio or Jonathan Eugenio. Matala, still two timeouts remaining para kay uh, Coach or acting head coach Randy Fallorina. Biggest lead para sa Lady Gunners. They're up by 10, 17, serving 7. Oh, not a good first ball para sa SSS. And di pa maitawid ni Guillema. It's now an 11 point lead para sa AFP. Mali din yung angle ni uh, Guillema that time around. Talagang hindi papasok yung uh, bola. Very comfortable advantage for the Lady Gunners. Good save para kay Guillema. And she gets it to fall in. Another substitution here for both coaches. As Hernandez papasok para sa Lady Gunners and then Velasco also checking in para naman sa pension protectors. High serve. Dolores. Yeah, hit. that hit going outside. First, first attack para kay Mimi uh, Baron. I serve again. Coming from Velasco. Antala Madunid. So back to back errors, Lina, para sa AFP. And this is what you want. Ito yung sinasabi ni coach sa Tantanina. Take advantage nyo ngayon. Itong rotation at lineup ng AFP. That's what SSS is doing right now. Olores, go back to Madulid this time. No more errors. But when Madulid is on the ball, she knows how to attack it. Madulid, 13 points. Looking for her first ace. You know. Back to a 10-point lead. The biggest was 11. Para kala May Madunid and the Lady Gunners. Fourteen points now, May Madunid. Much better pass mula kay Pascual. Camacho mula sa gitna. It's in. with that uh, swing of the arm, no? To be able to attack the ball. Camacho, four points. All from attacks. Substitution para sa pension protectors. As Kim Suba, 28 years old, opposite hitter, papasok, papaltan si Camacho. Suba, malamig pa to off the bench. Big serve coming up. Down by nine. The pass by Yonko. Yonko will look to finish. He got it. Alam mo, parang alanganin pa nga yung uh, atake oh. ni Yonko yun eh. Kala mo hindi rin papasok eh dun sa net eh. Back to a ten-point lead as Reforma magbabalik. 
Papaltan si Larion. Four points away from their fourth win, ang Lady Gunners. Wait a minute, ulabang pito. Excited na si Ulores. Oh, oh. Excited ng kainin yung meal ng mami niya na pre-nepare sa kanya post-game. Meron kasi <laughs> lagi eh. Meron kasing lagi eh. No. Meron request daw lagi si Yen. Si Yen? Oo. Oh, oh. Well, kung panalo naman palagi, why not? Oo, no? oh, saka makikita mo, as a team silang kumakain. Oo. Oh. Kapag katapos ng game nila, uupo sila doon, manonood sila ng first set ng ano, susunod. Susunod na game. Ganun ang tradition ng AFP. Service ace, back to the biggest lead. Para kila Yen Olores and the Lady Gunners, they're up by 11. Battle at the net, and that's going to be a net touch on Vila May Guillema. Errors after errors, para di suko po ng SSS on this third set. Lores on the line right now for the AFP. Five errors, the third set, para sa SSS. Lores to Yonko. That's on the line. Smooth attack coming from Yonko. Kung baga sa boxing eh, ito, gulpi sarado. Oo. Ang SSS in the third set. This is 13. That's points. And they didn't even waste one. Ito, Lady Gunners. I was expecting it would be a longer match, no? Uh, first time, I think, for the SSS na uh, matalo sila in uh, three straight sets lang against a veteran team against the AFP because ang dami talaga nilang error, especially on the first set and the third set. Doon lang sila sa second set, medyo nakabawi, eh. Uh -oh. Talagang ang ganda ng performance na they were doing everything doon sa second set natin. Two players in double digits. Para sa Lady Gunners, they're led by Yonko, 17, Madulid with 14. Mantala, only one player in double digits. Mm -hmm. Para sa Pension Protectors, 20 big points para kay uh, Pitoy Sangwang. And not enough to even steal a set contra sa Lady Gunners. Our best player right now is May Madulid. Kasama niya si Dana de Guzman. Dana, take it away. Eric and Rina, I'm here with the player of the game, May Maduli. This is her second time as the player of the game. Ngayon, medyo dumikit at medyo matagal-tagal yung set number two natin. No? So, pinasok kayo ni Coach. Ano yung naging mindset mo at paano kayo nag-stay composed para makuha yung second set? Um, lagi naman po sa amin sinasabi ng coach namin na once na nandun kami sa loob or pinapasok kami, binibigyan kami ng chance, ibigay na namin lahat. Kaya nung pinasok kami, nung nag-sub kami na pumasok, ang mindset lang namin is habulin at manalo po. Ngayon, third set, medyo lumaki yung lamang ng uh, AFP sa SSS. Ano sa tingin mo yung naging ibang ginawa ng team nyo para lumaki yung lamang? Kailangan lang namin maging compose, tapos enjoy namin yung bawat bawat puntos na nagagawa namin at tulungan pa rin kasi isa kami sa loob ng court. Wala kaming papabayaan dapat. Ngayon, meron ka bang mga gustong pasalamatan at batiin? Ako, madami po. Una-una po sa lahat, gusto ko pong batiin. Um, very supportive ship of staff ng AFP na si General Bronner Jr., Philippine Army. Kay VC staff, General Cordura, Philippine Air Force. Kay TDCS, General Gaarla, Philippine Navy Marines. Tapos sa general namin, kay General Roldan, Philippine Air Force. And sa assistant managers din po namin na si... Colonel Ginol by Philippine Army, kay Lieutenant Colonel Parsha, Philippine Air Force. Sa aming beneficiary na Victoriano Luna Medical Center, and of course, the flag officer in command of Philippine Navy, na si Vice Admiral Adasi, sir. And yung commanders din po namin sa Naval Reserve Command, kay Major General Kisoy. Sa Philippine Fleet, kay Rear Admiral David. Commodore Trinidad, Commodore Lagasca returned. And of course, sa unit ko po sa Naval Air Wing, Four kay Commodore Marayag, um, Captain Mga Haas, and Commander D. And pati na rin po sa buong family po ng teammates and coaches ko. Happy birthday, Bea! Hello, Forrest and Gaia! And sa family ko po na nandito at nanonood, sumusuporta.
sa buong Madulid family, uh, Balmaseda and Gutierrez family. At sa lahat po na sumusuporta ng Team AFP, Mapa Army Air Force or Navy man yan. Thank you po. Yan lang po. Mjen, Mjen, well done sir. Hello po. Sir Pasha, hi. <laughs> Okay, congratulations, May Madulid, for being the player of the game and to AFP Lady Gunners. Balik sa inyo. Ay, maraming salamat, Dana. Um, double digit score, hindi naman kasi si Yari ako, kaya nagbato rin ng konting greeting sa dulo, no? Yes, yeah, so <laughs> oh, napaganda ng performance itong dalawang to, si Yonko at saka si Madulid talaga. And right now, AFP has the solo spot dun sa ating ano, no, team standings because they won in three straight sets nga dito sa ating game na to kontra sa SSS. As you can see here, napakarami din yung attack points na ibinato nila on the third set, no? Um, 13 as opposed to the four given here by the SSS team. At uh, yung kumbaga dun sa kanila mga blocks at saka errors halos pareho lang sila pero isa din doon yung mga aces nila kung bakit sila nakalamang doon sa third set at para dito sa ating uh, final stats no uh, yung attack points talaga solid attack points given by the AFP here 40 as opposed to the 30 maganda rin yung mga aces na ipinamalas nila sa larong ito and of course they were able to limit those uh, errors no dun lang sila dun sa second set talaga nagka problema na wala sila dun sa sistema nila but they were able to get the third set bounce back redeem themselves and finish this game in three straight sets so for uh, the pension protectors, third straight loss to, they will uh, go down to one and three. Sa ating standing, samantala ang AFP will go to the top. Uh, fourth straight win, uh, four and one in the standings. Coming up, my last game, ng ating triple header. Ngayon linggo dito sa Paco Arena, it is the PNP Lady Patrollers taking on last year's first runner-up, the Senate Lady Defenders, next dito lang sa UNTV.
live at the Paco Arena and game day continues. We are in match number 17 of the eliminations round of the UVL season two, win for sports and win for charity. This is a match between the Senate Lady Defenders and the PNB Lady Patrollers. Araw, nagbabalik tayo sa Paco Arena for the final game of our triple header uh, dito sa second season ng UNTV Volleyball League. Uh, the last year's first runner-up, Senate Defenders, contra sa AFP. These two teams are coming off wins. Ang uh, Senate Lady Defenders are right now 3-1. and one. Ang AFP, or make that PNP, of 2-1 in the standings. Hello po sa inyo lahat. Eric Tipan kasama si Rina Villamar Camera. And a uh, great matchup. We're expecting both teams uh, galing sa panalo. So mataas ang kumpiyansa coming into this matchup. And Two strong teams right now, diba? Para ang ganda ng team standings nila. And they wanted to continue that momentum right. also, as you mentioned. No? So, kailangan uh, galingan nila dito sa larong ito. Samantala, bisitahin natin yung first two games. The results after um, we finished in straight sets, back-to-back. Uh, -back. Yes, kanina na uh, first win yan para sa kupunan ng... Uh, BFP Lady Firefighters no in three straight sets against the judiciary. So ito nga naging best player natin dyan, si Gang Abeliana making uh, her 10 attacks and uh, two aces para dun sa kanyang 12 points on uh, that match no. At para naman dito sa ating uh, second game or game 2 kanina, it's a heartbreaking comeback para dito kay Pachari. You uh -huh. know, she was there but uh, SSS failed to uh, at least uh, win a uh, one a set there no kaya three straight sets din ito para sa kupana ng AFP Lady Gunners no at si May Madulid nga itong naging kanila nga player of the game 11 attacks two blocks and uh, one ace there napakaganda actually ng performance naman itong dalawang games natin kanina dito uh, dun sa ating game to kanina SSS really fought on the second set kaya lang kinulang na sila dun sa kanilang energy pagdating dun sa third set so let's see the adjustments sa ating team standings after the first two games sa ating triple header today and of course, dito naman po sa ating team standings, nangunguna dito ang AFP Lady Gunners with 4-1, no? Mm -hmm. Solo nila yung number one ngayon dahil sa panalo nila kanina kontra dito sa SSS. And of course, Senate and Comelec with a 3-1 on their win-loss record. Ang PNP, 2-1, still at the middle. Uh, judiciary, 2-3 naman sila. Bumagsak na dito ang SSS kasama ang uh, BFP dahil din dun sa talo nila kanina dun sa mga earlier games natin. And DFA has to win a match here. So you see the importance of this game para sa parehong kapunan involved in our third game today. Para sa PNP, para makadikit with uh, AFP right now at 4-1. and one. Samantalang ang Senado, they want to be at 4-1 and one as well with a win here today against the PNP. So talagang very crucial to match up ito, uh, between these two teams. Let's take a look at the last game ng Senado. Again, they're coming off a win. That was uh, against DFA. They took them down in straight sets. Yes, uh, Senate made sure to come back on this ball game kasi bago pa itong game nila against the DFA, natalo na sila uh -oh. contra sa Comelec and it's really a heartbreaking loss for them. No? They did very well when it comes to their blocks and to their aces. Makikita mo ang laki ng disparity ng scores nila. Pero pagdating dun sa attacks nila, um, halos pareho lang 
naman sila ng DFA dito. Tapos maganda rin yung pagginawa nila dun sa paglimit ng mga errors nila. We have this uh, three imports nila, sina Sabas, Tobiera, and Cecilio, who really stood out para dito sa kukuna ng Senate team, no? Para mamayagpag sila dun sa larong ito to make sure that they will be able to bounce back considering wala din dun si Coach Roger on that game. And now let's take a look at the last game ng PNP. It was a win against BFP. And uh, this game, bumawi din dito ang, ang PNP you know, kontra sa BFP kasi ang common denominator ngayon ng PNP tsaka Senate, pareho silang natalo sa Comelec in 5 sets. Yeah, so dito sa game na ito, bumawi dito ang uh, PNP kontra sa BFP in 4 uh, sets. No? Maganda yung pinamalas nila dun sa kanilang attack points. Talaga makikita mo, 67 as opposed to the 41 given here by the BFP team. Pero pagdating dun sa mga errors, halos pareho lang din sila, aces nila. Dun sa mga blocks nila, maganda rin yung pinakita nila dyan kontra sa BFP Lady Firefighters. Sina Elove Oliveros, Etukas, tsaka si Gomez yung gumawa para dito sa kupunan ng Senate uh, team. Now, an update para sa PNP. They will not have Hazel Magpantay today because of a knee issue. Walang timeline according to Coach Rod Pinalba. And for an update naman para sa Senado, let's watch this. Pinagkakabisihan ko yung anak ko, si Kali. Hi, loves! Tumutulong rin ako sa sister ko na i-manage yung volleyball camp niya. So, yun lang po. I-spend time ako sa family, sa, lalo na sa anak ko, kaya ni um, nagtuturo, naglala, uh, naglala, naglalaro. So, yun. Lala rin. Meron din akong ano, isang anak at lagi rin nalagan. And lagi akong nakasuporta sa aking boss. Hi, boss! Ambitious sa tao ay isang ambitious sa Diyos. Ayan, maraming salamat. I'm very hands-on sa bahay, sa pag-aalaga ng aking fur babies at saka ng uh, mahilig ako magluto. So, lagi akong nagpe-prepare ng from breakfast to dinner ng pagkain sa bahay. So, ganun. Nagdudag ako habang yung asawa ko tumatakbo kasi nagkakilala kami as runners. So, yun. Pwede ka na meron ako ang family and planning to study ko. Currently, nage-engage din po tayo into workshops for producing and directing content. Plus, nagka-participate po tayo sa basic citizen military training na hinanda po ng Armed Forces of the Philippines, particularly po ng Philippine Navy para maging reservist po tayo para sa bansa. Inispend ko yung time ko sa pag-aalaga ng mga anak ko. Two kids. Yung two kids ko. Yun lang. Tinatalawan ko yung family ko sa business namin. Pag wala kami training, nauwi ako. Yun. Hi din sa baby ko, si Angel at si Sam. Yun. Hi, Mama! Bukod po sa paglalaro ko ng volleyball, nag-a-assistant coach po ko sa Kano sa Lipa High School Girls and Boys. Yun lang po ako. Third year law school, uh, law student po ako sa Arellano. Shout out sa mga professors ko po. <laughs> Ang pinagkakabalan ko, pag-aalaga ng pamangkin ko, and then nagtatry ako mag-breed ng um, puppies, ay ng dogs, yung vision. Meron akong dalawang um, vision ngayon na bagong pangkin. Uh, so very nice to see, Rina, what uh, these players do outside of the volleyball court. Yes, it's a new segment that we want to introduce dito para hindi lang natin sila makilala, di ba, as a public servant. Pero ano pa ba yung pwede nilang ipagmalaki? That's right. Uh, so it's nice. To... Well, ngayon, nagahanap ng ipa maipagmamalaki. Parehong ko po na looking for a winning streak. Both teams, Lady Patrollers and Lady Defenders, let's go courtside and meet the lineup of both teams.
Ladies and gentlemen, let us now meet our officials for this match. First referee, Marlon Macabenta, national referee. Second referee, Ryan Vincent Corpus, national referee. Number two, Jalai. Middle blocker, number eight, Chichi Tupiera. Opposite spiker, number 11, Candice Cerezo. Outside hitter, number 15, Kyle Sindai. Middle blocker, number 16, Javen Sabas. And libero, number 12, Jesse Vinluan. Head coach of the Lady Defenders is coach Roger Gorayev. Meet the starting lineup for the PNP Lady Patrollers. Team captain and setter number three, Patrol Woman Tin Bangola. Opposite spiker number 15, Patrol Woman Malu Padilla. Middle blocker number five, Patrol Woman Chris Etucas. Middle blocker number seven, Police Corporal Cesc Oliveros. Outside hitter number 13, Patrol Woman Kia Gomez. Outside header number 20, patrol woman Ronky Ronquillo. And libero number two, patrol woman Rexa Limsiaco. Head coach of the Lady Patrollers is Police Master Sergeant Rod Penalba. <laughs> UVL fans, let's get ready to serve Spike and set with the Senate Lady Defenders and the PNP Lady Patrollers. This is the UBL Season 2, Win in Sports and Win for Charity. Back here at the Paco Arena, as you look at the Senado, there's the lineup for the two and make that three and one. Lady Defenders looking to get their fourth win today to take on the always gritty Lady Patrollers and their starting lineup. Starting setter Tin Bangkola will be in charge of the offense. Para sa parehong kopunan. Ladies and gentlemen, this is set number one. PNP Lady Patrollers uh, right now at two and one, looking for their third win in season two. Bangkola will get us going in the opening set with a serve, Lai with a tip. Pancola sets it up, and the dump is good for Oliveros. Nice first point coming from the PNP that time around. Both teams undersized. Gomez popping it up. There's the pass. There's an overpass actually. Lai picking it up. Good floor defense para sa lady, def uh, lady patrollers and the tip by Oliveros back to back points para sa kanya. Good early points coming uh, from uh, Oliveros no dito sa kupuna ng PNP team. Oliveros is a police corporal. Tubiera hits. Pangkola. Atu Padilla. Three straight points para sa Lady Patrollers. Good defense and good attack points also for the PNP, no? A perfect start so far para sa Lady Patrollers. Tubiera with the up, Lai sets it. And hit into the net for Sabas. Ito naman sa back-to-back ano, -back, uh, errors naman para dito sa simula ng Senna team. Let's listen in. Bola. 
may hinang atake, nakakamatay, lalo nang nakakamatay yung malalakas. Jeben, huwag mong paluin ng diretsyo. Kahit naman na sinasahot-sahot ka lang eh, huwag mong paluin ng diretsyo. Haliwat ka na ng palo. Hindi tayo obra na ang anong ganyan. Ha? Huwag tayo magpalamang na masyadong malaki. Kunin na natin yung ano. Early timeout no para dito kay coach uh, Clint Malaso dahil ayaw niya syempre mas lumamang dito ang kupuna ng TNT. Gusto din nila makuha yung momentum dito sa ating first set. No, uh, coach Roger pero sabi ha, habol daw dito sa game natin. <laughs> <laughs> Oo, kasi nandun pa siya sa kabilang league. <laughs> Nasa ano lang sila eh, San Juan I believe so. Malapit lang, makakahabol. Malapit lapit, oh, pwede no? Oo. Oh, oh. First point para sa late defenders uh, coming from the service fault ni Tin Bangkola. One thirty-four. Lai with a serve para sa leading defenders. Here comes Padilla. Tobiera popping it up. Lai underhand pass. Agawan sa bola. It results in an easy over para sa leading defenders. Gomez. That hit by Sabas uh, is outside. Uh, Sabas struggling today. Too much, uh, too much, no, dun sa kanyang uh, effort to put in that ball for Sabas. Javin Sabas with a couple of errors already. Uh, bad first ball. Sabas with a touch. Tubiera, easy over. Bancola will set it up. They go to Ronquillo. Tubiera. Sabas back to Medji Tubiera. It's outside. Wow. Another error coming dito para sa kupuna ng Sena team. And isa na lang ang timeout. We go Clint after using a very early one when they were down 4-0. Lai sets it up. Sabas punches it through. Finally, the first attack point para sa Senado. Oliveros was there to uh, block the ball, pero nakalusot dun sa kanyang mga kamay. Bumaba dun sa net. Two serving six. Padilla. Lai will set. They go to Tubiera. And it's on the line. Finally, back to back. Good hits this time after misfiring. No, kadalang first few touches. Two straight points scored by the Senate. This one is out. So it's on the line. It looked like it was going outside. The technique para pahirapan dito ang PNP is to push the ball more on the line because the PNP would think it would be outside. Lim Siago letting it go. So three straight points scored by the Senate. Lim Siago overpasses. And Tubiera with a help from the net. Matras kasi si Bangkola. That, uh, that's why wala nang nagbabantay dun sa net area. Four straight points para sa Senado. And it's a one-point game. Just when it looked like tatabakan sila ng Senado. Hindi magpapadaig ang Senado. <laughs> Oh, another ace. Bukang buka yung corner na yon para sa PNP. And Coach Pinalba is now on his feet. They're watching right in front. It dropped right in front of Coach Pinalba. And a five point run para sa Senado. The game is tied at six. Now, this one dev definitely outside. Kumbuwa ba pa naman yun sa linya ay wong kanila? From our angle, kitang kita natin na outside na siya eh. A serve by Oliveros. Lie to Tubiera. Pangkola pops it up. Padilla magseset to Ronquillo. Tubiera with the toss. Tin Pangkola. Lie at the Sabas. Great pass. Padilla is blocked by Tubiera. Perfect timing for Tobiera to jump, to block for that ball. Seven all. 
Ronquillo. Rock by Tubiera. Etukas in ang atambola. Ronquillo papalo ulit. Tubiera. The Sabas. It's outside. Senate needs to control the ball more, no? Para naiiwasan nila yung mga outside nila. Outside attacks. 8-7 lamang ang uh, PNP as we check in with Dana de Guzman. Eric and Rina sitting in as the head coach for Senate right now is Coach Clint as Coach Roger is still in the NCAA. His advice to his players coming in today's game is to focus on their strength which is their defense. Enjoy the game at magtulong-tulong lang sa loob ng court. Sabi rin ni Coach ay magtulong-tulong sila sa depensa at hayaan din nila ang kanilang import na mag-contribute sa opensa. Eric and uh, Rina. Alright, maraming salamat Dana. Uh, right now, after that timeout, somehow, Lady Defender is able to turn it around and they are up by one. Pero wow, both teams with service faults, Rina. Sunod-sunod, bigaya ng putos dito. Hindi natin nakikita dito yung mga long rally na ini-expect natin from uh, these two uh, teams, no? Oo. Oh, oh. Here's Tubiera. Limsiaco with a nice dig. Back row para kay Oliveros. Overpassed. Bangkola to Gomez. Magnaye popping it up. Battle at the net. Tubiera winning the tip. Limsiaco na nakipag-agawan. And a nice hit from the back row. But Senado, very good on the floor defense. Etukas. That's not coming back. Not able to uh, balance that ball, no? Dun sa kanilang uh, side ng Senate. PNP now with the lead here. Not a good first ball. Lai, underhand pass to Biera. Limsiaco with a dig. Gomez! There's a net touch against Tubiera. Tubiera is very good dun sa, ano, no, sa front line para dito sa kupuna ng uh, Senate team. Kaya lang that time around hindi niya anticipate na magka-touch na siya dun sa net. Lai with a set. Oh, Sabas. Really struggling today. Probably still adjusting. Ito sa larong ito. We don't know if Sabas was able to attend the practices then. Five, uh, five errors, Rina, para kay Sabas. Only three points. Nice score niya. Pangkola. Etukas. Got it. Etukas is very powerful dun sa kanyang jump at saka dun sa kanyang atake. Patrol woman, Ronky Ronquillo with a serve. I love the nickname. Tobiera with a hit. Bancola sets it. And back row attack. And it's good para kay Oliveros. Everything falling again para sa Lady Patrollers. And si coach, assistant coach Malazo will burn his final timeout dito. They are back down by five points. Contra sa Lady Patrollers. Paano tayo mananalo niyan? Wala silang ginagawa. Nabi ko na sa inyo, yung mga drop ball yan ang makakapatay sa atin. Hindi palo. Kayang-kaya natin depensahan yung mga palo. Pero yung mga off speed, mga drop ball, kailangan natin kumilos. Ang dami natin error. Mahihirapan tayo. Tayo nag nagpapahirap sa sarili natin eh. Wala na akong timeout. Laro nyo na yan. Ha? Pag magtulong-tulong kayo dyan sa loob. Tama yun, no? Butas na nga yung kanilang gitna, no? Para dito sa kupuna ng uh, Senado. Tsaka napakarami talaga yung errors that they could uh, limit also. They need to watch out for the drop balls na binibigay dito ng kupuna ng uh, PNP. Kasi yung mga atake, kayang-kaya naman nilang saluhin yan, eh. You know, nakakatuwa kahit wala si Coach Roger. Pag nagsalita si Coach Malazo, parang andyan din si Coach oh. Roger. <laughs> Kaboses niya nga minsan, eh. Pati yung tono, pati yung delivery, pati yung choice ng words, parehong-pareho. Right. Gomez, dili-dili, popping it up. Etukas with a nice pickup. Etukas sa atake. That's way outside. Five 
There's Javin Sabas, uh, one of the imports, na really struggling so far today. Oh, five errors para kay Sabas, but she scored three points. Pero mas marami na ibigay niya kesa na ipuntos niya. Tubiera with a serve. Lim Siako will play setter. An easy over para kay Etukas. Lai. There's Sabas and another miss hit for Javin Sabas. But wait a minute. Block touch ang itatawang kontra sa Lady Patrollers. So Sabas picking up her fourth point today. Senado down by three. And tulad na sinabi ni Coach Malazo, no more timeouts para sa Senado. They're gonna have to do it all on their own sa floor. Gomez, got it. The difference here is that PNP is attacking stronger. Yeah. Kesa sa kupuna ng Senate here. Just look at Gomez there. Sabas. It's on the line. Sabas back to back points. Starting to come alive para sa Senado. Javin Sabas. Kailangan niyang uh, bumawe para dito kay Coach Clint Malaso. Three-point game. Biggest lead was five points para sa Lady Patrollers. Oliveros, block. That's double contact. Contra kay Oliveros. A run continues para dito sa Lady Defenders. Si Coach Clint parang si Coach Roger, nakatayo na rin eh. Pero hindi ko alam kung ganun ka-effective yung... Di ba pag si Coach Roger na nagra-rattle na yung Senate niya, alam na nila eh. Mayroon na umulo ni Coach Roger, umayon sa tayo. Sabas with a tip, Bangkola pops it up, Limsiaco sends it over. Yes, uh, ito, atake na naman, Sabas into the net. So after two straight points, Sabas with an attack fault again. Patahan natin si Dana Di Guzman. Eric and Rina, Coach Rod is more confident with his lineup now this season two of the UVL. Sabi niya, mas pinatibay daw ang kanyang team ng mga reinforcement from different regions of PNP. Ngayon, tingnan natin kung paano nila lalabanan ng Senate at makabawi para sa game na ito. Alright, paraming salamat, Dana. Here's Gomez. This is wide. The angle of Gomez... Ibang-iba siya, so na-outside talaga yung uh, bolang yun. Ja Lai. Sister of the assistant coach, Jua Lai. Pangkola. Oliveros with a dump. Yun na yung sinasabi ni Coach Clint kanina. Bantayan niyo yung mga drop ball ng kalaban niyo. Kasi yan ang unti-unti papatay para sa inyong kapunya. Oo. Oh. Kia Gomez, patrol woman Kia Gomez with a serve. Lai, Sabas. Yes, Javen Sabas scores again. But itong si uh, Kia was not able to uh, put up the ball, no? Para dito sa kupuna ng uh, PNP. Got the dig, pero mababa uh -oh. yung pasa. Sabas with a nice serve. Lim Siako pops it up. Oh, that set short. Malaki Bangkola who was falling down. Tin Bangkola, a former Lady Knight of Letran. Senado from down five. They are within one. Chance to tie on the serve by Javin Sabas. Sabas with seven points. Already with two aces. And that is outside. So, seven points, seven errors para kay Javin Sabas. Binalance lang niya. <laughs> and Coach oh. Manasa saying, well, it's yung lights judge niya para nagbago yung isip last second. Inagayway yung kanyang flag. Two-point lead, Lady Patrollers. Sabas with a nice pass. Jewel Lai to Tubiera. Could have been a save para dito kay Padilla, no? Kaya lang parang nag-hesitate pa siya to run for that ball in the corner. But so, woman Padilla on your screens. Dili Dili looking to tie with an ace here. Jamie Dili Dili with the serve. Pangkola to Ronquillo. Popped up by Sabas. Lai goes to Tubiera. Why not? Good dig. Coming from Oliveros. Padilla. Got it. 
There again, the floor defense of uh, the Senate is struggling right now. Still at the middle. Lai with the ball, Tobiera with the hit. But Oliveros failed to uh, catch the ball, no? Para di suko po na ng uh, PNP Lady Patrollers. Nice serve. Tukas to Ronquillo, cross court hit. Tobiera turning around and scoring ties the game at 19. Five point lead ng BNP nawala. After this nice point by Menchi Tubiera, timeout for coach Pinalba. Pakigin natin ng BNP. They have to watch out for the spiker para dito sa kupunan ng uh, Senado. Yun yung sinabi ni Coach Rod para dito sa kupunan ng Lady uh, Patrollers. Four players um, scoring para sa PNP. Samantalang para sa Senado, only two players have put up numbers, but they are big numbers considering first set pa lang tayo. Tubiera with six, Sabas with seven. Mantala, the four players with points already. Etukas with two, Gomez with one, four para sa Oliveros, and Padilla with two para sa Lady Patrollers. So much more balanced offense mula sa red shirts. But ito, Senado looking to tie, actually looking to take the lead for the first time here in set number one. Ronquillo! Yes! Dili Dili was not able to anticipate the ball, no? One point lead, Lady Patrollers. Oh, and there is Dili Dili in the Humabol. Two-point run for the Lady Patrollers. That service outside. So an easy point given up by Ronquillo. Still a one-point lead here by the PNP Lady Patrollers. Tupiera will serve. Uh, looking for her first ace. Six points para kay Menchi Tupiera. Good pass by Limsiaco. Gomez, that's going to be wide. First error, I believe, for Gomez, ba? On, on that. Uh... Oh, we'll check that yeah. number in just a little bit, but a good pass there. And a point scored by Etukas. She has a nice target right there. It was Etukas, no? I'm sorry, Shaq. It's a very good target. It's a very good target. Gomez, that was her second error, Rina. Right? Second for Gomez. Ito, Gomez, off speed, overpassed. Pagkakataon, umatake ulit para sa Lady Patrollers. Oliveros, got it! And once again, no, parang hindi na salo ni Miss uh, Jamie Dilidili yung bola for the Senate. Two-point lead, Lady Patrollers. Lai sets it up. Oliveros got it. Smart attack coming from uh, Oliveros right there. Dinalan niya talaga yung uh, bola to her uh, left. It is a very small front line dito. Oliveros, uh -huh. Gomez, pero they're very effective para sa PNP. Right now, they have three set points. Lai, Sabas. Chance to put it away. Gomez. Got it! Oh, Senate failed to uh, save that ball. 
Take another look. Gomez going long. And hindi na inabot ni Benji to be Arayon. So after tying the game at 19 all, the PNP Lady Patrollers went on a big run to win by four points in the opening set. The Senate committed a lot of eh, errors dito, no? Yung, especially yung hindi nila na-anticipate yung mga drop balls na binibigay sa kanila ng uh, PNP. So it led to a lot of uh, missed scores at saka easy points para dito sa kubuna ng PNP also. Oliveros leading the way para sa Lady Patrollers with six. Samantalang it's Sabas, the top scorer para sa Lady Defenders with seven. Lady Patrollers on top, one set to nothing. Contra sa Lady Defenders going into set number two. UBL fans, make some noise! We are searching for our next face of the game! Alright, nag-iikot na po ang ating mga cameras para hanapin kung sino ang magpapakita ng pinakamagandang smile. Baka kayo na ang ating susunod na face of the game. Ito na nga siya, si Miss Kylie Bugarin. Show us your smile. Wave to the camera. Alright. Thank you so much, Miss Casey, for joining us in today's UVL Games. Maraming maraming salamat po. The PNP Lady Patrollers winning that uh, first set no against dito sa kupuna ng uh, Senate uh, Lady uh, Defenders no of course uh, leading scorers para sa kanila si Sabas and uh, si uh, Tobiera no with 7 6 uh, points respectively napakaganda ng ginagawa dito ng kupuna ng uh, PNP especially mas marami silang atake dito uh, dun, compared dun sa kanilang uh, sa Senate team, no? mas maganda yung floor defense na pinakita ng PNP dito. When it comes to the errors, halos pareho lang naman sila but it's really how they defended yung mga bola nila at yung mga attacking ipinamalas nila against the Senate team that made them one that first set. I had an impressive run. Itong uh, Lady Defenders, they were down by as many as 5 points. But... Uh, there's one deadlock. They tied the game, but they could not take the lead. Hindi nakatikim ng kalamangan itong Senado uh, the entire opening set. Six deadlocks in the first set. So many opportunities to take the advantage para sa Senado. They just could not get over the hump wala sa kanila, yung sense of urgency nila to be able to get a point para sa kanilang kupunan. Kasi uh, kapag nandiyan si Coach Roger, yung, they're always on their toes, they're always on their feet, there's presence of mind, there's sense of urgency. Pero ngayon, nawala yon para sa kupunan ng Senado. Kahit ako, pag nandiyan si Coach Roger, I'm always on my toes as well. <laughs> ako, napapatingin na lang ako sa kanya. <laughs> Kasi minsan, kahit hindi ako part ng coaching staff, kinakausap niya ako. Eh. Sila, ang errors din mo, hindi mo Oh. So I let Coach vent out to me. That's why. I'm in. I'm always on my own. I'm always on my own. I'm always on my own. Anyway, uh, Coach Roger, we hope uh, you make it back here because their team needs you. Yeah, they're down one set to nothing. Contra sa PNP. And that'll go outside. Not a good start here. Para sa Senado. Errors very important. Dapat maging maayos para sa kupunan ng uh, ito, PNP and the Senate. Good serve coming from Tin Bangola. Lai will set it up. Here comes Tubiera. Block. Good effort to keep it alive para sa Lady Patrollers. Off speed hit. Sabas turning around and the save is no good. 2 0 start para sa Lady Patrollers. Nagrattle sila doon. Nagkagulo sila. There were two players running for the ball there. Another good serve. Short pass. Lai to Tubiera. The tip is short. And just like the opening set, Rina, this is a 3 0 start para sa Lady Patrollers. Oh, guys, si Tubiera had the right thing in mind. Nagusto lang yang i drop yung bola dun sa ginet. Kaya lang, she was not able to execute it well. Bangkola serving 3 0. Short serve. Oh, it's a 4 0 start. For the Lady Patrollers, 
exactly the same. It's like deja vu, but different courts. Parang sa parehong kopunad. And but now, Coach Malazo not calling a timeout. Remember, he called his first timeout 4-0 ng opening set. Yes, and Sapa's making an effort dito ha. This time around talagang she runs for the ball ngayon. In the meantime, binigyan ng first point, just like the first set, of an error coming from PNP. So, 1-4. Ating talaan, second set. Pangkola sets it. Nice tip. Lai picks it up. Set by Sabas to Tubiera with a left hand. Pangkola. Lai popping it up. Sabas from the back row makes sure it's in. Padilla. Lai playing great defense. Sabas again. Limsiaco also playing great defense in the back row. That's in. Oliveros with a point. Battle at the net won here by uh, the PNP Lady Patrollers. No matter how effective Tobiera was there uh, in front, no? Para sa sanity. It's not an import that leads the way para, sa Oli para dito sa Lady Patrollers. Oliveros with seven. There's Tobiera with a hit. Oliveros again. Difficult set para kay Lai. Cerezo Magnaia sending it over. Off the block. Padilla popping it up. Padilla attacking. Uh, Sindai with a good up. Tubiera. Yes! Strong attack coming from... Uh, Cross-court attack coming from uh, Tubiera there. And that, just the first attack point. Para sa Senado, their first point was an error by Bangkola. So yung palang yung unang opensa nila that we've seen here in set number two. Tubiera with a serve. Limsiaco with a pass. And Lai trying to keep it alive. Tubiera hits, sends it into the net. Another error para sa Senado. Ito na naman, lobo na naman ang errors para yeah. sa kupuna ng uh, Senate team. No? Unwanted errors para sa kanila simple things that they should be doing right, right now. Oliveros with a serve. Lai, at the Sabas. Here comes Ronki Ronquillo. Nice shot. Nice right, time, a push by Etukas. Padilla sets it. Another tough hit para kay Ronquillo. Lai, to Sabas with the tip. Got it. But this time around, it's naman PNP yung nabutasan dito sa middle court nila, no? Uh, one way for Sabas to be able to have a point para dito sa kupunan ng Senate. Dili Dili with a serve. 3-6. Ooh, what a nice hit there. Smart na bang uh, hit nitong si Ronquillo, no? Talagang she's trying everything, uh, every body part para masave yung bola. Three points para kay Ronquillo. It's back to a four-point lead para kay Padilla and Lady Patrollers. Nice serve. But a good pass coming from Tubiera. Sabas with a push. And that big donut hole has been there para sa PNP. The second time around, it's been the target of uh, Javen Sabas. Cerezo Magdaya with a nice serve. And a nice hit para kay Etukas for the point. Masyadong dikit sa net kasi eh, kaya nahihirapan mag-receive itong uh, Senate team. Let's check it courtside with Dana de Guzman. Eric, kanina, Rina, kanina ay nakausap ko ang team captain ng PNP at playmaker na si Tin Bancola. Sabi niya sa akin na ang game plan, game plan daw nila ay simula ng game ng agresibo pero nag-iisip. Sabi rin niya, niremind niya ang kanyang mga teammates na huwag masyadong ma-pressure sa game kontra sa Senado. At ngayon naman nakita natin na nagbunga ang magandang communication at magandang pag-uusap ng team sa loob ng court. Balik sa inyo. Uh, maraming salamat, Dana. Overpass. Another chance ball mula sa Senado. And right now, a lot of confidence para dito sa Lady Patrollers. Uh, like what 
Dana was reporting. They're playing loose, they're playing happy, they're playing comfortable. Sabas! Yes! Hindi ba naman ni Sabas yung kanyang atake? Not a drop ball, but a solid attack right there. No? So Sabas. With 10 points, first player in double digits para sa parehong kopunan. Nice serve this time. Overpass. Easy put away para kay Tubiera. Back-to-back -back points para sa Senado. Ayun na yung uh, AFP, oh. Nandun na sila, oh. Nanonood dito sa ating... Uh, exactly. Ah, oh, oh, that's what I told you kanina. Kumakain na nga, eh. Oo. Oh. Ano kaya yan? Yan kaya yung tapioca? <laughs> Iba naman ata yung request niya. Ano <laughs> nga. Yan. Pero sabi niya, more on sweets daw. Sweets? Mahilig daw siya sa sweets pag uh, post-meal niya. Well, three straight points para kila Lai and the Lady Defenders. And from leading by five points, dalawa na lang hinahabol dito ng Senado. After being down by five, Bangkola. What a dig para kay Sabas. Sinday hits it. Bangkola will set again. Dili Dili with a dig. Tubiera turning around. Off speed, nice block by Tubiera. And Tukas. Yes! Nice one coming from Etukas. Nakalusot yung bola. Ito sa kupuna ng uh, PNP. So Etukas, five points. All from attacks. Good serve. Not a good pass. Wala kay Sabas. Sabas will hit it from the back row. Pangkola. Ato Gomez. Yes! Kia Gomez. Uh, five points para sa kanya. Two straight points para sa PNP. And this is the way para gusto ng PNP sila yung lamang talaga of dito course. eh. Oh. Oh. Tubiera, nice hit. Effort by Ronquillo to keep it alive. Padilla sends it over. Ganda ng depensa ng PNP. Tubiera hits again. This time, gets the side out. But that time around, hindi naman naitaas ang bola, no? To be able to save uh -oh. that ball. Coach Rod Pinalba on your screens. Kyle Sindai, 30 years old. Good serve. Limsiaco popping it up. Mangola to Gomez. Good dig coming from Cerezo Magnaye. Dili Dili with the push. Mangkola, underhand pass. There is a nice off-speed hit for Oliveros, now with eight points. Mangkola. Full rotation na para sa PNP. She's back on serve and just like the last time, service fault para kay Tim Mangkola. This time around, lie on the service area. Pancola. Egoro. Gomez. Good save coming from Sabas. Easy over. Ooh. Pancola, underhand pass. Padilla, battle at the net. Panalo si Tubiera. Mas matangkad ako. Mas kaya ko yung ipasok. <laughs> Tight set. No other chance for Padilla. Net touch as well para kay Padilla. Two-point game. Pangkola. Pinabawi. Uh, nice push by Oliveros. Smart eye and uh, hand para dito kay Oliveros. To push the ball on that side. Oh, miss receive. By Sabas. And just like that, balik sa apat ang kalabangan ng Lady Patrollers. Kia Gomez with six. Lai. 
to Cerezo Magnaye. Padilla. Limsiaco, easy over. To Biera. What a dig for Bancola. There's a net touch. It's a tower contra sa PNP. Now three points ang inahabol dito ng kupuna ng uh, Senate, no? 11 serving 14, that is way outside. Ang hina lang ng palo niya, pero ang lakas pa rin ng dating. Uh, Benji Tibiera, ipapahinga, papasok. For the first time today, si Cecilio, who one of three players in double digits para sa Senado in their last game. Another bad pass by Sabas. Sabas gets it back. Sends it outside. Another error coming uh, from uh, Javen Sabas right there. Okay, Sabas, that's going to be error number eight. And uh, Coach Malazo has seen enough. We'll call a timeout. Senate down by five. Konting sipag sa paghabol ng bola. Alam nyo naman na yung gagawin nila eh. Diba? Lahat, yung, pinalo, yung mga palo nila, hindi naman lumalapag eh. Yung drop ball. Kaya dapat mas extra effort tayo sa mga drop ball nila. Ha? Sige, tsagayin nyo. Ha? Huwag, habang magbente, dapat nakadikit tayo. Nakadikit na tayo eh. Nagumpisa lang naman sa error eh. Ha? Tsagayin natin yan. Tulong-tulong tayo doon sa loob. Oh, nga, I agree with that. So unlikely for the Senate na maging tahimik sila dito sa larong ito. Eh. Sila talaga yung may ingay dyan. Pero there's Sheila Cecilio already. So we expect na mas magiging uh, okay yung communication nila dyan. Tingnan natin kung magingay pa sila. In the meantime, pakinggan natin si Dana de Guzman. Eric and Rina kanina ay nakakwentuhan ko si Jalay who's playing a setter for the lady for the lady defenders at nasabi nga niya na na-discover lang daw siyang maglaro ng volleyball when she was waiting for her sundo sa kanil sa kanilang school noon na niyaya lang daw siya ng isang senior niya at nagkataon na nagya siya at ayun na nga tuloy-tuloy na ang kanyang volleyball hanggang college hanggang pagdating sa Senado ngayon tingnan natin kung paano mapapaikot ni Jalay ang opensa ng Senado balik sa inyo All right, thank you for that report. Dana, right now, he has been distributing a lot. Punta kay Sabas and Tubiera. There's si Tubiera on the bench. He's senior with a nice hit kanina. Oh, but itong uh, PNP, despite the scrambling, has still found a way to get the point. Gomez just uh, taking that uh, attack in zone one para dito sa kumpunan ng Senate. Short serve is an ace. Oliveros with another point. Oliveros now with it's gonna be ten. That was her first ace. Chance ball para sa PNP. Padilla, Dili Dili setting it up. Lai will set. Go to Sabas. Mancola. The defense. By the Senate. Sabas hitting. Monkey. Sabas on the attack. Could have been outside. Chance ball. Para sa Senado. Down by eight points. Lai. Sabas with a push. Nice shot. Ito ata yung isa sa mga long rally nila uh, for this match, no? But Bancola was not able to uh, commit and save that ball para sa PNP. That hit is outside. Medyo napalakas for Etukas. Two straight points. Well, it's actually not only trying to make a comeback because of set number two. Bancola. 
Out to Rocky. Another miss hit. Back to back na malakas yung atake nitong uh, kupuna ng TNT on the outside. So time out for Coach Ron Pinalba. And their lead is down to five. so after leading by as many as eight points itong uh, lady defenders on a three-point run and now within five sabi nga ni coach mamaya na daw sila mag celebrate the game is not yet over oh. Oh. meantime seeing action for the first time former lady tamara simborio is in the game for the first time Siborio gets a touch. Lai was set. Simborio tosses it over. Sabas with a hit. Romki. Cecilio pops it up. Easy over. Malakay Lai. Dili Dili. Short on the pass, the save is no good. Gonna be four touches contra sa Senado. Medyo alangan yung bola kay Miss uh, Dili Dili, no? Kung ipapasok niya, but it went uh, on the net. Kaya hindi ni-expect ng Senate. Nasasaluhin pa nila yung bola that time around. Charm Simborio will serve back to a six-point lead para sa PNP. Live. Sabas through the block. Power hit. And Etukas alone cannot uh, block that ball, receive that ball. One on one at the net. Sabas versus Etukan, and Sabas will get the kill. Five point game. Ronquillo. Lai. And Sabas again. Ronquillo, second straight hit. Sindai with a toss. Again, Ronquillo, this time, underhand pass. Cecilio. Sabas, blocked by Etukas. Cecilio with the pass. Lai, back to Sabas. There's a net touch. Contra sa PNP. Touch uh, breaking that long rally between these two teams. Four point game on a two point run para sa Senado. Sabas will be in the back row. Nice serve! An ace! Sabas now with uh, 15 points in the game. No? 10 attacks and. Uh, uh, four, yung kanyang service aces dito. Three-point run. Senado from down three. Tatlo na lang. Kailangan nilang burahin. Another ace! Make it five service aces para dito kay uh, Javen Sab. One of the leading scorers nitong kupuna ng uh, Senate, no? Aside from Tobiera, who has a double digit also dito sa atin. So from down six, two points na lang, hinahabon lang Senado. Tukas with a tip, stopping the run of the Senate. That time around, Tukas has the, had the presence of mind to be able to drop that ball.
Ronquil, you now with four points on this game, three attacks, one service ace. Ryan Corpus, second referee, clearing something up with the table officials. And finally, everything is good to go. And iyon nga tayo tinitingnan nila. Uh, rotation error para sa Senado. All right, so they're still clearing it up. Assistant coach Clint Malazzo now right there standing by the line. Kasama si second referee Ryan Corpus who's positioning the players in the right place. All right, everything is sorted out. Oh, free point nakuha ng uh, PNP dahil dun sa error ng Senado. Gamit na ng timeout, si Coach Malazo, we will listen in. Maabutan natin yan, maabutan natin yan. Ha? Ayusin nyo yung laro ngayong second set para may momentum tayo doon sa third set. Ha? Hindi man natin makuha to at least doon sa third set. So dapat ayusin natin ngayon pa lang. Ngayon pa lang set na to. Ha? At lo pa yan, kaya pa natin tigilan yan. Diyan. Ha? Gisila. Agawan niyo na ng receive sa in dalawa ha. Ni sige. Let's go. A lot of motivation coming from uh, coach Clint Malaso telling the ladies na kaya pa nila tong habulin which they have proven themselves no in the other matches naman talagang hinabol din nila yung ibang kupunan. So he was saying na kaya pa natin yan, gawin na natin yung momentum ngayon para pagdating ko sa third set, maganda na yung simula natin. And si Sheila Cecilio was reminding her teammates kailangan magkaroon lang talaga sila ng communication. Ingayan pa natin inside the court. Last time out yun para sa Senado. One more time out remaining para sa BNP. They're up by four. Sabi nga ni Coach Malazo, kaya pa yan. So let's see if they can pull it off. Ronqui, Ronquillo with a serve. Overpassed. Sabas keeping it alive. Cecilio, back row hit. Cecilio playing great defense in the back row. Atake naman, Cecilio. Almost coming up short. Bancola will set. Off speed. Sindai popping it up. Sabas nasa harap. And this time a power hit is good. Para kay Gomez. Not good received by uh, Sipborio, or rather the Candy Cerezo. Cerezo, yes. magnaye, oo. Oh. Cecilio, tough pass. Sabas. Nice tip by Bangkola. But good reflexes by Sindai to keep it alive. Bangkola. Sagit na. Got it. Nice tip. Eh, Tukas. Smart move coming from Etukas that there uh, put the ball. And here we are. Six set points para sa Lady Patrollers. Nice serve. Chance ball. Back row attack into the net. One set point given up by Oliveros. Not a good time for, uh, for Oliveros, no? To uh, attack that ball. Meantime, the top scorer para sa Senado. 16 points, Sabas with a serve. And an ace, another ace. That's going to be number six. Para kay Jalen Sabas, her sixth ace. One, actually the second set point saved by the Senate. But there's still four more para sa PNP. Um, that will, ooh. It could have been outside. And that hit is good. And it is all over. Gomez getting the winning point para sa PNP as they go up 
Two sets to nothing. Contra sa Senado. No energy para dito sa kupunan ng uh, Senate team. At uh, we're hoping na mas magiging motivated sila pagdating doon sa ating uh, third set. Everything going well para dito sa kupunan ng uh, PNP. Uh, when it comes to the attack, lahat yon chinaga talaga nila. Dito naman sa Senate team, medyo nawalan sila ng uh, moral no? uh, to be able to beat uh, the PNP Lady Patrollers kasi ang laki na nung agwat ng scores kanina. A big second set. Five points in the second set para kay Etukas. Five points in the second set as well para kay Gomez to help the Lady Patrollers to a two sets to nothing advantage dito sa match na ito. Uh, hoping to go up to three and one in the standings as they lead and are in control of this match contra sa Senado. This time around, hinahanap na po namin ang susunod na barkada of the game. Kaya kung kasama nyo ang inyo mga pamilya, kaibigan, lalong-lalo na mga kabarkada, kumaway-kaway na po sa camera, baka madaanan po kayo. Like na like po tayong napapanood sa UNTV channel. Everything going well para dito sa kupuna ng PNP Lady Patrollers who has uh, took advantage of uh, two sets here already. No? 25 is to 20 dun sa ating uh, second set. Uh, four players yung gumagawa para sa kanilang kupuna. You have Oliveros there with uh, 10 points right now. Si Etukas, 9. We have Gomez, Ronquillo also. Pero dito sa Senado, dalawang players lang talaga yung nagpapakita dito. Sabas to be, uh, and uh, to to Biera also no para naman dito sa uh, attack points naman nila halos pareho lang naman sila on uh, set number 2 pero yung errors nila it's almost the same but yung presence of mind it's more on the part of uh, the PNP team right now kaya nga mas lumamang sila dun sa attack nila nothing special when it comes to the attack na ginagawa ng Senate also on that second set. And we're hoping nga, no, na talagang makabawi sila dito sa ating uh, third set. So many players stepping up. Nabagit mo nga yung mga top scorers, uh, Rina, for both teams. Uh, we had good numbers also mula kay Sabas, Tubiera also contributing but not enough para kay Tubiera. Uh, not seeing a lot of action. Uh, inupo siya doon ni assistant coach Malazo in set number two. A lot. At pinagbigyan si Cecilio. Uh, but now, a uh, different starting lineup para kay Coach Malazo. As Cecilio is in the starting lineup. Along with Tubiera, magpapahinga si Sabas ngayon. And we're also seeing Pantonas in the game for the first time. Along with Aquino para sa Senado. And Felipe ba? First... First, then, Felipe. Actually, Felipe yeah, seeing oh, action oh. for the first time. He used to be the starting setter para kay uh, Coach Roger Gureyev last season. She's starting today. Gallares also in the starting lineup. So a totally new, almost totally new six para sa Senado. To start set number three. Aquino pops it up. And that will get through. Good effort. Mangola will hit. Cecilio. Ronquillo with the nice pass. Simborio attacks. Cecilio pushes. Pancake save is no good. Sabi ng ating first referee si Marlon Macabenta. You like the ano eh, yung motivation coming from Sheila Cecilio also oh. para dito sa kupuna ng Senate. Kasi unti-unti nabubahaya ng loob itong uh, kupuna ng Senate. Felipe with a nice serve. Here comes Oliveros. That's going to be wide. So for the first time 
in this match, actually, Senate will start off with a 2-0 lead. It is their first lead of the match, by the way. And hoping that they will be able to continue with that kind of uh, right. momentum, no? Short pass, very short from Limsiaco. Antonas got it. 3-0 start by the Senado. Limsiaco was very apologetic to her teammates. Dapat siya yung sasalo ng bola eh. Pero hindi siya nakaluwa the guy to be able to take the ball. Si Coach Pinalba nakaupo pa. Doesn't look concerned yet. Two sets kasi. Oh, lamang Napansin niya, no? Napansin na dito ng two sets pa. Felipe with the serve. Pangkola. Uh, pushed by Gomez. Cecilio with the up. Ooh, muntik na may kumalimot doon na magkaroon ng third touch para sa Senado. Pero tuloy-tuloy ang errors ng BNP. They're down 4-0. Start of set 3. Too long there coming from Oliveros. Felipe, short serve. Bangkola passes to Simborio. Cecilio. Bangkola with the up. Simborio, attack. Cecilio sets it up to Biera. Limsiaco with the pass. Nice hit. And finally, the first attack point. That is a PNP. Although maganda na rin yung pinapakita dito ng floor defense ng uh, Senate team, no? mas tight sila compared dito sa PNP now. 1-4. Cecilio. Limsiaco. Much better pass. Ronquillo. Popped up by Tubiera. Ngayon ito si Cecilio. Block! Oh, terrific defense at the net para kay Oliveros. Oliveros now contributing a lot para dito sa kupuna ng uh, BNP team, no? She now has 12 points in the game. Cecilio, down the line, Lips Yako playing great defense. Ronquillo, cross court, 3-0 run para sa BNP. And from down four, isa na lang hinahabol dito ng red shirts. That's why hindi na alarm si Coach Rod dito kasi alam niya kayang kayang bumawi talaga dito ng Lady Patrol. And eto na, Rina, right on cue. Ubos ang kalamangan ng Senado. 4-0 run para sa PNP to tie the game at 4. Another good serve and it's on the line. 5-0 run para sa PNP and they are now on top after trailing by 4. Jesse Vinduan, ano, was trying to say, sayang, di ko na kukuha talaga yung bola. A much better pass by Tubiera, Cecilio, looking for a side out. Got it! They just slow mo si Simborio doon. And she went for the dig. Different kind of attack naman ito coming from Sheila Cecilio. Just a drop ball right there. Good pass. Oliveros got it. No runs para sa Senado. Very smart player. Itong si uh, Oliveros, no? Blocking, attacking. She's doing it all. Mantala Tejada checking in for the first time para sa PNP. Number one. She's in front. And tip is outside. <laughs> para kay Pantanosas. So, two-point lead para sa PNP, 7-5. Ooh, nice serve. Tip by Tejada. Tobiera, battle of the net. Tip again by Tejada. Yes! There's a net touch din. Itatawag kay Tobiera. We'll take a look here. Ayun, tumama yung braso ni Tobiera as we check in with Dana de Guzman. Eric and Rina, after the second set loss, Coach Clint instructed the girls na ibahin nila yung trend sa loob ng court. Huwag daw silang masyadong malungkot at ibahin nila ang atmosphere kapag naglalaro. Try nilang mag-enjoy at pagaanin ang paglalaro sa loob. Ngayon, tingnan natin kung makakabawi pa nga ba 
ang Senado sa game na ito. Balik sa inyo. Maraming salamat, Dana. Well, they had a good start as Ronquillo. Now the biggest lead for PNP at four points. 4-0 start para sa Senado. You couldn't ask for a better start, Rina. Yes, that's right. No, napakaganda talaga yung itong uh, ginagawa pa rin ng PNP no? uh, right now. Pero tama naman din yung sinabi ni Coach Clint kanina para dito sa kupunan ng Senate. It, uh, it's all about the attitude of the Senate towards this ball game, no? They just have to enjoy this ball game. Kasi pag mas nag enjoy ka, mas ano lang eh, parang uh, the, yung mga attacks mo comes natural to you, di ba? Parang hindi mo, hindi ka gigil sa bola, hindi mo pinipilit yung bola, di ba? That's right. Uh, Tubiera, getting a side out para sa Senado. Uh, Menchi Tubiera in double digits with 11 points. Pantanosas with a serve. Tejada. Block. Tobiera once again guarding that net for the Senate. So two-point run para sa Senado. Pantanosas. Ronquillo. Got it? Yes. Very powerful attacks coming from uh, Ronqui, Ronquillo of uh, the PNP team right now. Si Ronquillo has seven points on this ball game with six attacks and uh, one service eight. Simborio with a nice serve. Pantanosas passes to Viera. Oliveros popping it up. Ronquillo again looking for back to back. Got it. Same attack para dito kay Ronquillo, no? And same result. Yes. Eight points. Para kay Ronquillo. And the lead is now four points. Para sa PNP. Felipe with the pass. Great defense by Oliveros. The push all the way to the back. Cecilio trying to keep it alive. Unsuccessful. Nice effort coming from uh, Sheila Cecilio but was not able to uh, really save the ball there for the Senate. Twelve serving seven. Biggest lead now para sa PNP at five points. Cecilio, back row. Simborio, great pass. Tejada with a push. Overpass. Tejada with a hit. Cecilio. Oh, that's double contact. It's important then, no, yung spacing ng mga players inside the court para hindi sila nagkakatamaan. Time out para kay Coach Clint Malazo. We'll listen in. So yan, inaabot tayo. Nabago nga yung trend. Inabol naman tayo ng kaka-error natin. Control ninyo, minsan na lang natin makuha yung mga ganun eh. Pa natin makontrol. Sila, Ikaw pa mag-e-error dyan sa likod. Ikaw na lang aasahan ng defensa dyan. Tulong-tulong. Magtulong-tulong tayo dyan sa likod. Go guys! Go guys! Go guys! Malayo ba yan? The attitude is there for the Senate, but ito nga lumulobo na rin unti-unti yung kanila mga errors, giving easy points para dito sa kupunan ng uh, PNP. That's why uh, the lead now is uh, six points. No? That's right. Biggest lead para dito sa Lady Patrollers who were trailing by four early in set number three. Just an update in case kabubukas na lang inyong mga TVs. Two sets to nothing advantage para sa PNP kontra sa Senado. Tubiera into the net. Tuloy-tuloy ang paglamang itong Lady Patrollers. That timeout ni Coach Malazo, no effect. Lead is now seven para sa Lady Patrollers. Uh, not a good pass mula kay Cecilio. Ronquillo with the up. Ronquillo atake. And we'll score off the block. What a run, Rina, para dito sa PNP. And of course, napakaswerte nito ni Ronquillo. Lahat ng atake niya, pumapasok lahat ng atake niya. Hindi agad na-anticipate dito sa kupunan ng uh, Senate team. Much better pass mula kay Cecilio. Tubiera. The up by Simborio. Ronquillo. 
Got it. This is the player that you should watch out for para dito sa kumpana ng PNP na yun. It's Ronquillo. Nine point lead para sa PNP as we check in with Dana de Guzman. Eric and Rina, kanina ay natunghayan natin si Malu Padilla na naglalaro para sa PNP. Ngunit alam nyo ba na bago pala siya pumasok ng PNP ay dati siyang physical education teacher at nagko-coach sa kanilang senior high. Nagkataon nga lang daw na nagkaroon ng pandemic kaya niya isipan na pumasok sa PNP dahil may mga online applications na. And the rest is history. Now, balik sa inyo. Maraming salamat, Dana. Uh... Nice to find out uh, yung uh, pinanggalingan ng some of our lady patrollers. Wait a minute, wala pang pito. Oo. Oh, oh. <laughs> Na-excite to get that point. Si Fam Gallares. Uh, one of the more senior players para dito sa Senado at 45. Pero once you're a volleyball player, kahit na gano'n katanda ka, ah. yung skills mo nandun pa rin talaga eh. Oo. Oh, oh. Pangkola sends it over. Nice hit there by Menchie Tubiera. Tubiera making sure she hits it right para makabawi naman dito ang kupuna ng uh, Senado. Nine serving 16. Malayo-layo pa rin ang ahabulin nitong Senado but uh, at least it's a good start. Making an effort, di ba? Yeah. Tejada. That's popped up by Gallares, Aquino. And now, an easy over, hindi pa tumawid para kay Tubiera, itong Masanado. They can't really move forward because of so many errors. Akala niya papasok na yun eh, but she was not able to look for it eh. Nakatalikod kasi siya sa bola. Felipe sets it. Tubiera, babawe, limbs. Yako, what a dig. Gomez, Cecilio. Will attack. Tejada pops it up. They go back to Tejada. Yes! Back to a nine point lead para sa PNP. As Dili Dili will check in. Tapatan si Steffi Aquino. Ito, alarming na to para sa kupuna ng yep. uh, Senate. Nine point uh, lead para dito sa kupuna ng PNP. Back to the biggest advantage para sa Lady Patrollers. Gallares, Tubiera, easy over. One to play. Para kay Bancola, battle at the net. Oh, Limsiaco again with great defense. Gomez, inatrasan for an underhand pass. Tubiera, yes! Eight-point game. Pag nakuha dito ng PNP yung uh, win dito, magkakadikit pa sila sa team standings. Although may advantage pa rin dito ang Senate, but still, ha tabi na lang sila dun sa team standings natin. They're still part of the top four. Gomez. The up by Sinday. Battle at the net. Mananalo si Tejada. Swing sir, wrist, no? To her left uh, side, no? Para hindi ma-anticipate dito ng bola ng kupo na nagsend. Substitution. Para sa Senado as Marshall will check in. Iupo si Tubiera. Only one import on the floor. Nalalabi para dito sa Senado. They have Cecilio. Gomez, the tip by Cecilio, kept alive by Tejada. Here comes Gomez again, second try. Marsalo off her shoulders, and the save is no good by Gallaris. Great effort. And with a commanding lead, uh, up by 10 points. And some second stringers, Papasok. It seems like Coach Pinalba has put in everyone. Everybody's getting uh, seen playing time today. Salas, Papasok, along with... Pangilinan. Pero din hindi lahat pagod, di ba? At oh. least there's uh, ample time for the other players to be able uh, to rest. 
Five points away. Itong uh, Lady Patrollers from back-to-back -back wins. Felipe to Cecilio. Cecilio scores. Yun lang, hindi na taas ni Ronky yung bola. Cecilio with her third point of the game. Ooh. But then it's not, but it's going to be wide on the hit by Ray Gomez. And you don't want these errors, no, para sa PNP. Kasi baka makahabol pa dito ang uh, Senate claiming a uh, third set here. That's right. Uh, sabi ni Oliveros, I heard you, Rina. <laughs> Balik na. well. Balik natin agad yung uh, nawalang puntos. Back to a nine-point lead para sa Lady Patrollers. Paginado, the uh, second setter with the serve. Cecilio, through the block, got it. Strong attack coming from uh, Cil Sheila Cecilio right there. Felipe serving. Ooh, that's got to hurt. So PNP back up by nine. Biggest, biggest lead para sa kanila was ten points. Felipe sets it. Cecilio. Pinangat ni Ronquillo. Paginado. And a nice hit by Salas. As everybody contributing para dito sa PNP. They're uh, celebrating early on, no? Kasi ilang two points na lang sila. Uh -oh. To be able to uh, win this set. At uh, itong Senate, they need to... Um, Execute well doon sa kanilang mga receive. Chance ball para sa PNP. Paginado. Ronquillo with a push. Cecilio will set. Gallares will hit and set it into the net. And that'll be 11 match points para sa Lady Patrollers. Not uh, what we expected uh, oh. from the Senate today. Overpass, chance to put it away here. Paginado, Salas, that's it! It's over! BNP with a 12-point win in set number three and a sweep of the Senate to get their second straight win. Dito sa ating season two ng UNTV Volleyball League. They started out uh, strong uh, sa first set pa lamang, no? At nakita mo talaga yung consistency nila to be able to recover from every error. At saka yung mga powerful attack talaga nila, no? Uh, nothing very special coming from the side of the Senate. Pero itong uh, PNP talagang sigurong pinaghandaan nila ang uh, match na ito. Para sa Senado, they have two players in double digits. Tobiera 14, Sabas with 17. But it's three players in double digits para sa PNP. They're led by Oliveros with 14. Yeah, 10 from Ronquillo, 11 for Gomez. And Ronquillo, Ronquillo, our top player right now. Kasama ni Dana Guzman. Dana? Eric and Rina, the PNP dominated this match in three straight sets. And one of their uh, main attacker is here with me, our player of the game, Ronky Ronquillo. Now, Ronky, anong feeling na nanalo kayo versus Senate? Yes po. Um, yung ano po yung teamwork po namin, at least na overcome po namin kung ano po yung weakness namin, yung pag sa communication po, sa laro, nalang po. Ano yung naging motivation nyo as a team para mapakita yung gantong kagandang laro? Um, sa... Nagpapasalamat po kami sa boss namin na si Police Brigadier General po, Rossi Alvarado po, sa pagsuporta sa amin, lalo-lalo na po sa PSM, BFI po, sa pagsuporta po sa amin mga sapatos po sa PNP po. Yan lang po. Maraming salamat and once again, our player of the game, Ronky Ronquillo, Eric and Rina. Maraming salamat, Dana. Congratulations, Ronky Ronquillo, one of three players in double digits para sa Lady Patrollers to get back-to-back -back wins and they are gonna go up 
in the standings. Now 3-1, hahataki nila pababa ang Senado to 3-2. That's right. Napakaganda kasi. Napaka-explosive dito yung mga attacking binabato dito ng uh, PNP Lady Patrollers. And of course, yung mga service aces din talaga nila. Ito talaga yung nagpanalo sa kanila during uh, this third set. Extra effort uh, from everybody in uh, the PNP Lady Patrollers. And we're hoping that the Senate will be able to bounce back on uh, their next game naman from this loss. Alright, speaking of next games, ito yung ating magiging uh, upcoming Actually, tignan muna natin, himayin muna natin yung match statistics uh, between these two teams after three sets. Of course, the biggest uh, differentiator here, yung atake talaga, walang iba, kundi yung defense, mga atake na binibigay dito ng uh, PNP, no? 45 as opposed to the 26 given here by uh, the Senate team at nalimitahan din nila ng bagya yung kanila mga errors, 18 as opposed to the 22. Pero halos pareho lang sila dun sa kanila mga blocks and aces dito. All right, upcoming games. I'll check it. I believe we're going to be back here, no? Yes. Yes, we're going to be back here, Paco Arena. That's going to be on Thursday. Uh, game number one, Comedec contra sa Judiciary. Uh, Samantala, game number two, DFA looking for the first win as they take on these lady patrollers or coming off back-to-back -back wins. BFP after the big win kanina contra sa Judiciary will take on the lady defenders who will try to bounce back after losing to PNP today. Speaking of next games... Yes, we do have a game tomorrow. Wag niyo pong kaligtaan niyan sa Phil Sports Arena. That will be game 3 naman ng ating UN TV Cup Season 10. 6 p.m. po yan. Magsisimula. It's going to be between the DA Food Masters going up against the SSS Kabalikat. So see you there at the Phil Sports Arena. All right, para kay Dana de Guzman, Ira Pablo, my partner Rina Villamar Camara, I'm Eric Depan. Thanks for watching our coverage, our triple header today of the UVL Season 2. Dito lang sa UN TV. TV Volleyball League would like to thank the following sponsors. Kalos PH Sportswear, Quality Matters. Akari, bringing sportsmanship to life. Shawarma Shack, the first and the original buy one take one shawarma in the Philippines. Day Zinc, protection siguradong zinc gorado para sa buong pamilya. EFS, making modesty a lifestyle. We would also like to thank our partners. Wiseman Insurance Agency, Daniel's Coffee. It's not my coffee if it's not Daniel's. Best House of Chicken. Salute. KDR Adventure Camp. Marsid Blue Purified Drinking Water. ERC Travel Services. 
KDR Studios and Productions Incorporated, KDR Distribution and Marketing, Moral Star Hotel and Resort, Smallville Dive Center and Resort, Our Media Partners, KDR Music House, UNTV News and Rescue. Tuwing sasabak sa labas sa anumang hamon ng buhay, dapat maingat at malakas ang resistensya para makaiwas sa anumang viruses at sanhinang sakit. Kumain ng masustansyang pagkain, mag-exercise regularly at magpahinga ng sapat. Sabayan din ito ng Daysing Capsule for Adults. Ito ay may kombinasyon ng vitamin C at zinc that helps boost immunity, proteksyon para makaiwas sa sakit at ang buong pamilya. Daysing Capsule for Adults. Tulong sa proteksyong siguradong zinc kurado. A product of Earth Philippines Incorporated. If symptoms persist, consult your doctor. Sa isa, anong hinihintay pa? Dobling minam na 